I believe it was fake meeting you was written in the stars. Yeah, real. Girl, you be my one, you be my own. Trust. Promise that I'll never leave you alone. Send you be my lover and my own Hello, hello, welcome to the stream, my friends. Segoy! Oh, we gotta get centered. Oh, did you make sure the audio devices were all the same? Since we unplugged uh, things today. No, but I can check. <laughs> just quickly click the gear and just make sure they're set I mean, to the right thing. Or as long as the mic's going up and I'm talking, it's not bumping. Yeah, right. mic's, yeah. mic's going. Actually, still click the wheel, make sure it's set to the uh, Yeti and not the uh, webcam. Proper OBS likes to do that. Yeti. Okay, as long as it's Yeti, we're fine. Alright, I think uh, the cams were working, so... Yep. Cool beans! How's it going, guys? How is your wonderful Tuesday? Hopefully it's wonderful. Okay, I feel like my horizon line is, like, tilted. Oh yeah, I bumped it when I was cleaning the uh, lens, sorry. A little better? A little better. Ish. All right, well, there wasn't enough room for Shuckle and Whale Lord, so we opted for the bald noodle turtle. <laughs> <laughs> so, Whale Lord's just hanging out. He's, like, on stage crew today in the background. All right, guys. I feel like I should talk about something, but I don't have... I always have something to talk about. What am I talking about? Uh, we got exhibition matches today, guys. We have B from the Galar region. Uh, B, the gym leader, fighting gym leader, here visiting us. Uh, exhibition matches are going to be fun. I did not pull up the store page. I was going to do that. I was going to say, because this exhibition match, it's we're no longer in the testing phase, so this is a much larger exhibition match with more prizes. Yes. Also, it's cheaper, so that's always good. Um, sorry, I am playing with windows in the background. Do, 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 do. I, I'm not certain I'm a shuckle personified poke. <laughs> it's not your uh, spirit Pokemon? No, no. And the Eevee's not being given away, so. Okay, there we go. That's the window I was looking for. Um, but exhibition matches, if you're new... Uh, they are similar to our gym challenges in style, so it's like a, a personal pack battle with the point system. Um, but instead of taking on the gym leaders, taking on a visiting trainer. So this one is B. She is a gym leader, but she is not the current Johto gym leader series. A little bit different. So if you defeat B in an exhibition match, you will get a regular prize card. Uh, regular prize cards are themed to the Galar region, so it could be any Galar Pokemon. It could be like a VMAX Pokemon, since that's new to Galar. Um, but everyone who wins a regular prize card from B gets entered into the grand prize drawing for the Rainbow B at the very end. We have three Rainbow Bs to give out. Not one, not two, <laughs> three Rainbow Bs. So three chances to win. Yes, so there's a total of 30 regular prizes, so you have a 1 in 10 chance, if you win, of drawing that grand prize Rainbow B. I think the way that we're going to do it this time is every time we get 10 victories, we're going to draw a prize. See if that works a little better. That's, pretty, that's a pretty good way of doing it rather than waiting for the very end for all of them, yeah. These battles going to be in 3B? I don't even know what 3B would be, so let's let's go with no. <laughs> um, but yeah, so this is a battle styles focused uh, match. B is very fighting oriented. We thought that was very appropriate for battle styles and all the fighting bears. So yeah, that's our exhibition match. So I know what 3B would be. What would, what would it be? About two GPA points better than 3D. Boo! <laughs> uh. Alright. Oh shoot, I forgot to get our ladder graphic on. I thought I was all prepared, but you know... Sometimes... Why are you... Not that one. Um, speaking about new things on the shop, the 3V bundles have changed to a new version. So, uh... We no longer have the Fates Collide available, but we do have Breakpoint, so the freebie bundles are now Guardians Rising, Breakpoint, and Sun and Moon. 
Sorry for my windows noises. I um, still feel like my horizon's crooked. Stop being crooked. And other bundle changes, uh, we have some evolutions again. So the Charizard bundles have gotten an upgrade. So now you get six packs that could possibly contain Charizards. Woohoo! So you got Evolutions, Shining Fates, Hidden Fates, Darkness Ablaze, Champion's Path, and Burning Shadows in those bundles. Okay, since I just set up my ladder graphic, real quick, we have a Psychic-themed ladder this week. Um, everything from UV all the way to Rainbow Latios. Uh, we did lower our ladder goal by 100 packs, so hopefully we can hit 1,700. Might be tough. I know a lot of people are saving for the new set release, but... We can try. We can try. Um, we do have... Oh, real quick, to enter the ladder giveaway, everyone who buys into pack openings on our shop um, earns an entry, one entry per item purchased on the shop. Um, the more packs we open in the pack counter up in the top left, the more cards we unlock. You can see that every card has a pack goal to unlock it. So our first goal is 200 packs to unlock new V. So that's what we're working on right now. We currently have 90 packs out of 200. So anyway, that's the ladder for this week. Good luck, everybody. Uh, we have a new item in our promos and other items sections. We have Entei coins. It's just a very fluffy guy with a mustache. Entei coins, if you like coins. Okay, um, other than that... I'm trying to think of anything else we have new. Uh, oh, drafts for today. Since we changed those up. Drafts are... First one is Battle Styles Pure at the top of the hour, in about a half hour. Yep, it's an 80 pack draft for Battle Styles. Uh, next one is... Go Ghost. Uh, Hidden Fates for this is the second one. There so we go. 36 packs of Hidden Fates draft. And then our final draft was requested last week uh, for Shining Fates. So we have a 36 pack Shining Fates draft for our third draft of the night. And then if we do have some interest in more Hidden Fates drafts and stuff like that, we can put some of those up after all of our drafts for the night are done. We also have a large number of Hidden Fates personals up this week, so if you guys are looking for some Hidden Fates packs, there's that. There's also Hidden Fates wishlist breaks and things, so if you're on the hunt for some hidden stuff, it's a good place to look. Alright, last thing is that we did have a restock of the Swing Vignette blind boxes. So these are the little hanging figures. Um, if you are interested in those, we have some more available up on the shop right now. Blind boxes, lots of good options, super cute, love this set. Okay, I think that's all in the way of announcements, so shall we uh, open some packs? Let's do it! Oh, also, new gym leader, Morty's up this week. Oh, that's true. Morty. Go, Morty. It's the return of the purple box. Oh, gosh. <laughs> the drama box. All right, Jacob, up first with a Lady Luck bundle. Um, ghost. This one? Um, hold on, I will open up the image. Uh, no, I mean between this. Uh, Cosmic Battle Style Sun and Moon Sword Shield. This or this? Okay. <laughs> Sorry. This is what I get for reorganizing your shelf. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, here we go. Uh, we have our four sex sets in the Lady Luck bundle. You know, in hindsight, what I should do is organize your shelf so the bundles are all next to each other so no, you just grab four in a row. I'm so confused. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Good luck. Parasect Reverse. Ooh, starting off with Lunology X. Sigoy. Sigoy. All 
right, Shuckle, please uh, supervise our hits for us. Thank you. <laughs> on stream. Are we too dark? Do I need to brighten it up again? Um, give me a second. I have to refresh my stream. It looks pretty solid. That didn't sound very confident. <laughs> Obstagoon Hollow. And Cosmic. Yeah, it looks about the right brightness. I mean, anyone in chat, you know, does it look good enough good brightness or not? Olivia? Abominable. Okay, uh, Jacob going no bulk, so we have our hollows, and then our Lunology X. There we go. Sorry, I was fighting with the printer, so I wasn't playing. <laughs> How was your uh, drop frame? Uh, well, there's a little red thing, so red's not usually good. Yeah, no, no. <laughs> I think it's struggling a little bit. I think Twitch might have, yeah, we are, okay, now we're better. Oh, God, that was, yeah, 3%. Between red and green. Okay, um, I have it set for auto-refreshing the internet browser, or the uh, router, so. Oh, we did that, trust me. <laughs> okay, good to know that it has been doing that. Uh, just... uh, somebody was posting on my Facebook feed that, like, an internet company was having some issues today. Yeah, that was this morning. It was, mm -hmm. uh, it was like, Fastly or something. It just boosts speeds and stuff, but it took down a lot of the internet temporarily. But it shouldn't be affecting Twitch. Firefight Ranger, thanks for the bids! Sigoy! 1,500 till 10,000. Dang, nice. That is a lot of bits. Well, uh, I guess we'll just kind of keep pushing through. Hopefully things smooth out. My apologies. Yeah, just maybe keep an eye on it. And, I mean, because it does keep going between red and green. I don't like that. Oh. Alright, guys. Well, let me know if it gets really, really bad. We'll see what we can do. All right, Victoria up next with a gym challenge. First time gym challenge. Also, do let me know in chat if the stream ever actually goes down completely, because sometimes it doesn't for me, but it goes for everyone else. So that way I can uh, fix timestamps and stuff. All right, we are challenging Faulkner with Cyndaquil. Oops. All right. First time gym challenge. I have all the wrong images up. My apologies. <laughs> Faulkner with Cyndaquil. And going in with Bow Styles. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. feel a little dark. Alright, you brighten it up a little bit. <sighs> it's, it's the whole fighting with the camera thing. It's either it's automatic exposure, which makes it go bright and dark depending on what's on screen, mm -hmm. which is annoying, or you keep it steady and be a little dark. Alright, whatever. Alright, best of luck to Victoria. Here we go. We need six points. Score uncommon, non hollow rare. We got common, Mr. Mime. Come on, Battle Styles, it's our big tonight. Hey, John, welcome. Uncommon. Oh, there we go, Flapple VMAX. Segoy! Segoy, four points. I feel like I was dreaming about gym challenges. <laughs> I can't remember exactly. It was like we were using gym challenges to make like really important decisions. 
They're like, well, I'll just battle it out. <laughs> okay, and everybody was just fine with it. Uncommon. We got Hollow Meow Sticks. Sigoy. Sigoy. Two points. I, I feel like gym challenges there we go. may not be the, uh, the, the best decision making process, but. It's like, let's buy a house. Which one should we buy? This one. Well, let's battle it out. <laughs> <laughs> Common, non hollow. Oh, 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 sorry. One more. Uncommon and non hollow. Well, we got exactly six points. Sigoy. Congrats, we did it. First time success. But we got a flapple there. <laughs> Pretty much, Spectrum. At least that's what my dreaming brain thinks. My dreaming brain. Oh boy. It is on one. You do tend to have, like, really, really, like, complex dreams. And mine are, like, really dumb. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's get a prize box going. We have Fall Pairs box here. And for your prize card, I have Lavern GX Full Art. There you go. His ears look like bowls. Like want to fill them with cereal. That's not weird at all, Colin. <laughs> well, now I think I think I know where uh, your dreams get the creativity from. <laughs> it's all natural. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, Faulkner defeated. Congrats. Right, now let's pull down that extreme brightness. All right, uh, looks like we have some break spots that have been taken. Nothing is completely full yet, but Hidden Fates wish list and Battle Styles wish list, two spots down each. So, if anybody wants to start up a break, yep. those are two great choices. And that's the 36 pack Battle Styles wish list one. So we have both the 36 and the 80 pack wish list, I believe, this week, if they went up properly, which we need to check because. Yes, they did. Oh shoot. Ghost. I forgot. What? Rappers. Oh, right. I will take care of rappers. Uh, get that. Luckily, they should be pretty much all the battle styles ones. <laughs> hey, Volta guys! Thank you so much for the sub. Three months. Thanks so much for being here. You actually do a fantastic job on these rappers, too. They're really good. I tend to do well when I'm not paying attention. I was getting in that zone the other day when I was like, <laughs> opening wrappers for people. I was like, hmm, yeah, I'm doing it by default. <laughs> All right, um, Ariana up next. All right, now I'm now I'm paying attention. We're going to keep your wrappers as well. Uh, Victoria, we're grabbing your wrappers too. Uh, what cereal do we buy? I really like the uh, the honey oat Cheerios. Those are really good. They they're like as good as Cheerios, but they have that extra, like, oat crunch. I'm an old person now, so I have oats in my cereal, apparently. <laughs> I like the crunch. Also, what was the other one we got recently? It was the, uh, it, we had the apple cinnamon Cheerios and then the honey nut clusters or something. They were all really good. Very um, crunchy. Honey bunches of oats? That's the one. That's what I'm missing. Here we are. Oh no, did I freeze? Come back to me, stream. You got this. Be strong. Cosmic Sword, Battle Styles, and Sun and Moon. Good luck. Here we go. Oh goodness, it's rough. Are you dropping a lot of frames? Uh, I go from freezing to dropping frames. What's the percent? Uh, 19.2 when it goes red. Uh, no, no, that's overall. Like, one out of five oh, frames. Oh, sorry. 
Uh, 3.5? That percentage? There's okay. two percentages on Oh, yeah. There. The, the first one is how much the CPU yeah. is doing it. That way you can tell <laughs> if it's our computer or the internet. So, okay. I 3% is tech. much better. Ghost is in charge of tech. Oh. I'm just fix this one. Also, welcome, welcome to everybody dropping in. Uh, today's stream has been a little bit rough on the tech side. We're not really sure what's going on, so apologies in advance, but we're glad you're here. Yeah, I definitely feel like it might be on Twitch's end. I keep doing that. Hey, Big Teeny V, Segoy! Segoy! I totally spaced that Victini is also part psychic. Oh yeah, because he's almost always a pure fire card. Like, they never give him a psychic card. Well, I realized that while researching for my uh, psychic ladder. Jingle O oh, reverse and Palisand. All right, well, getting that psychic slash fire Victini V for this batch. And no bulk. Also, welcome, Lady Misses. Thanks for the follow. Yeah, I think I missed one. Yeah, I'll find it. What's the other one in the Lady Lock? Sun and Moon. Okay. Uh -huh. found it. The only second card I can think of for Bikini was a fancy reverse hollow deck promo. Interesting. They should make more psychic bikinis. I was gonna say, like, you can have, have so many more deck combinations and stuff and be able to have cool Pokemon in two different kinds of decks if they had multiple elemental types. Alright, up next, three packs of Bow Styles for Ariana. So, welcome, welcome. Thank you for the follow. Feel free to give me a pronunciation guide for your username. I am not sure. It would also be really, really cool to uh, have uh, like a deck where you have two different evolution forms or two different typing forms of every Pokemon. So you're like, ah, they're using the grass deck, so I'm not going to use the water volcano, I'm going to use the fire one. <laughs> I don't know if that'd be viable, but. Hey! Welcome, welcome, Lady Misses. Happy to be here. all. Oh, that's so nice. Thank you. Luxray Hollow. Oh, guys, can I just tell you how impatient I am for Chilling Rain? I'm so stoked. Sky, here to steal Adam's shuffle. Valid. Flapple V, Segoy! Segoy! Ghost was telling me, he's like, I didn't realize how popular Shuffle was. <laughs> Like, look at that face. Just like boop him on his non existent snoot. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Flap will be for Ariana. Indy Icy, thank you so much for the sub. Five months strong. Getting that entry into that awesome sub giveaway. Oh my goodness. It, it, at the same time, it feels like you've been here forever. It's been five months. Oh. Five guys. months subbed, so, you know, mm -hmm. I believe mean, they've been along a little longer than that. That's true. Oh, yes, your taco hearts are the best. Taco hearts, <laughs> yes. <laughs> Alright, so I'm just kind of, like, not going very fast today. Let's, let's keep it moving here. Come on, Colin. Victoria up again with some battle styles. Shuckle Ooh. VMAX when? <laughs> Is there a follow H command on this, uh... I think so. On the bot? Command follow age, one word. Yeah. I know my bot has one, but I don't know if, uh... Pretty sure. Alright, Battle Styles. Feel free to throw some surprises at us. We got Embor Hollow. Hey, it's that shiny shuffle emote. Love it. Victory Bell, reverse. Oh, twins. Twin pitcher plant. Oh, 
Oh, I missed it. Spectrum. Technically, Shuckle is the most powerful Pokemon in the universe. Well, dang. He's so, uh, unassuming. Very humble little guy. <laughs> is there a reason for this? Alright, looks like just our hollows this round. And no bulk. And I'm recovering what uh, pack wrappers we can. Oh. Did you have... Oh, I have them in my hand. Okay. <laughs> Ghost, I did it again. I know, I've already, I've already recovered okay, most of them. Okay, thank you. I've been Goodness skipping goodness. them if they're like badly torn or anything, so the numbers might not match up exactly, but... Alright guys, time for our first Morty Gym Challenge. Damien, going in with Burning Shadows. I already kind of spoiled his image earlier. What do we have for Damien? Um, Damien has Chikorita taking on Morty. Morty kind of looks like he's half asleep. That's fine. Just makes him easier to defeat. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Burning Shadows, be good to us. His ghost Pokemon are just that good at hypnosis, One, two, you know. Three, four, five, six. Has no trouble getting to sleep at night. You know, good constant regular sleep. Very dangerous gym leader. Uh, we had a question about the viewer giveaway prize. So our prize today is the little shuffle plushie in the background here. I've done my weekly burning shadows prayers. All right, well, here we go. Best of luck. We need eight points for Morty. Oh, and Moldy, guys, since you are here, um... I believe you were the one who requested the Shining Fates draft. That'll be our third draft of the night. Gyarados, reverse, rare, one point. So go. And let's see, non hollow. Shuckle, seriously more popular than Pikachu? Like, everyone's been like, yes, Shuckle. And I'm like, <laughs> I did not realize. Common, non hollow. Like, I always thought Shuckle was a cool concept, but not like. Rockstar level popularity. He just looks like he'd be your chill friend. Just down for anything, but also like a really good listener. Common. Oh, there we go. Full art, Colossopod. Sugoi. Sugoi, four points. Full art. I, I, I feel like he's a very good listener. Like he makes berry juice, so I kind of feel like he's like a little bit of a bartender. <laughs> Listens to your problems. Be like, man, that's rough. Here, have some juice. <laughs> All right, keep it, keep it up, Burning Shadows. What you got? Reverse rare Porygon Z. So One point. Going. And non hollow. <laughs> oh, Wooper, that's that's the line that uh, Brocka likes to use a lot. <laughs> We don't let him on stream, though. <laughs> yeah. uh, reverse rare, Pressinian, one point. Segoi. Hey, hollow, Porygon Z, two points. Segoi. Burning shadows, pulling through for the win. Plus one more. Benipede, common, and not hollow. Victory over Morty. <laughs> the prayers finally worked. <laughs> Yay! We got full art Glossopod as well. So boy. So boy. Oh, one thing we should probably mention: uh, with our new payment processor, it takes a little bit longer to give out refunds. So it's not that we can't give out refunds; it's just going to take probably upwards of 24 hours to get it back to you in your account. Or for us to be able to process it, I mean. So for things like extra gym challenges, um, we will definitely get you a refund. But sometimes we can't instigate the refund until the payment processor has settled your transaction kind of a thing. Basically, they don't see the money, so they're like, well, we don't have anything. We don't have any money to give back to them. So once they get it, once they see it and it finishes processing, then we can get you the refunds. So 
Our apologies <laughs> for the delays. But yeah, that applies to anything you use, like, a regular credit card for. I believe PayPal should still be pretty instantaneous. Um, but just want to give you a heads up uh, for everybody in that regard. All right, first prize card from Morty, Dawn Wings Necrozma Full Art. So, boy. One, one, seven, three, eight. But yeah, I am keeping a list of all the ones I need to go through, so once they clear, I'll go through and get refunds for you guys. I feel like Dawn Wings Necrozma has that, like, extra villain attire on. Like, look at my shoulder pads. They are pure spikes. She <laughs> just gives me that kind of vibe. Like, just so you know, I'm a bad guy. <laughs> it, it, it's Lunala's, uh, the Black Mamba. Yep. What? Oh, God, have you never seen Megamind? I've seen Megamind. Okay. It, it's his, like, super cape he gets at the end. The Black Mamba. I forgot he named it. Mm. <laughs> All right, congrats on our first defeat of Morty. He's so extra. <laughs> <laughs> Truth. Okay, up next. Um, our next one is a gift for Tyler from Jessica. Mystery bundle. Sounds like our neighbors are coming through the wall. Okay. Mystery bundle, where's our other camera? What is that noise, Ghost? I have no idea. <laughs> like, it's super windy out, so I'm hoping it's not like. Also, Junior's here with us. He's hanging out. <laughs> All right, we have drawer number 23. I like washing the side of the building or something. We've got Guardians Rising, Sword and Shield, Darkness Blaze, Crimson Invasion. Best of luck, here we go. Oops, spoiler white code. That's always a good thing. Kamala, Blissey Hollow. Gonna go run and grab dinner, but I'll be back. Sounds good. Hopefully it's good. BD reverse. So I'm trying to think 100% that the uh, slowdowns and stuff have been on Twitch's side. Okay. His uh, stream delay is up tonight. He ran hollow. To the point where it's like a pack behind almost. Oof. Yeah. It's usually a lot less than that. It usually looks like five, ten seconds maybe, but. Yeah. So, I think it's just they got hit by the internet outage. That would make sense. Angry Wigglytuff. It's like Mama Wigglytuff. Like, she's gonna mess you up. Oh, and you got the <laughs> note on this one, right? Yes. Okay. All right, well, hollows are inverses for this mystery bundle. Oh, and include bulk, so everything. Uh, here it is. Uh, oh, if you yeah, want to make a note for that. Yep. I was just about to do that. All right, I do believe we have more mystery bundles available if anybody is looking for those. Usually they go pretty fast, but today is a good day for mystery bundles. Um, Anton, up next, also with a mystery bundle. Ah, uh, drawer number 13 this time. Yeah, the Twitch might have had the, because I think it had affected Amazon, so I Twitch the servers are hosted on the Amazon cloud. Sun and Moon, Sword and Shield, Lost Thunder, and Champion's Path. Of luck. You know, Sun and Moon, we haven't seen the gold energies from you in a long time. I would love to see more of those. SP on GX! 
すごーいすごーいあ、ワッチュー says that's not quite how our video system works、oh. You know, it's nice to have somebody who knows how it works because I just speculate. <laughs> True. Frostmoth Hollow. Ooh, let's save Lost Thunder for last. Champion's Path. Hopefully, whatever it is, it gets resolved quickly. So we can all watch our Twitch videos in peace. Weedle and Altaria. Magirna, Jumpla Apollo. I definitely haven't seen that ho that hollow very much. Mmm, nice Jumpla, yeah. Oh, it's the kitty cat Quay Lava, the the liquid Quay Lava. <laughs> <laughs> you know when you, you pick up your cat and it's just like, uh -huh. right? <laughs> All right. Well, Hollows, Reverses, and Espeon GX. And we've got no bulk for Anton. Gym challenge and an exhibition match. Up next for Jared. Ooh, our first exhibition match. Um, and I think you you uh, talked to Jared about his note. Yep. All right, perfect. I'll take care of that. Same as always. Um, oh, wrong search. Jared right. has Chikorita taking on Morty. Oh, another Morty round. Excellent. Uh, Steam Siege. Going in with some Steam Siege. One, two, three, four, five, six. Alright, well, best of luck, Jared. Here we go. We need eight points. Pokemon Ranger, uncommon. Ooh, Gardevoir EX. Sagoi! Uh, three points for the EX. Another one for you to watch over, Shuffle. <laughs> <laughs> and Eevee, I suppose, but like, that's your job every stream, Eevee. We have a special guest, Shuffle, today. <laughs> C dot common, non hollow, spirit tune. Volcanion EX. Good boy. Good boy. Uh, three points. Another EX. I hope you guys don't mind uh, plushy giveaways because I am a little overstocked on plushies right now. <laughs> so we might see them a little bit more. Toxic Rogue Rare Reverse. Good boy. One point. I don't think anyone's gonna mind plushies. No, I haven't heard any complaints about plushies. I figure, you know, we always have the ladder giveaway for cards giveaway, so. Why not a little bit of both, right? Plus, we got some super adorable plushies, so. Very excited. Come in. B Sharp Hollow, two points! Good boy! That's what we needed. I mean, could you at least try, Morty? You're making <laughs> this look easy. <laughs> He's half asleep. He's still waking up. He'll be better at nighttime. True. And last one, uh, Galvantula, reverse, one point. Segoi. And not hollow. But I don't think anyone minds if uh, Morty's <laughs> a little sleepy today. <laughs> All right, hollows, plus Gardevoir EX and Volcanion EX. Segoi. Congrats. Um, we are including bulk for Jared, so hits and bulk. All right, prize card for Morty. We have Full Art Sable IV. Segoy. Segoy. It's got 
Chaos Emeralds is for eyes. I'm getting that, that's the Sonic vibe. The weird liquid guy who's also got Chaos Emeralds for eyes. I <laughs> do not know who Sonic uh, I played now. Sonic Adventure Battle 2 on the GameCube. I don't know. But Sableye, pretty sweet card. I think our sleeves are gonna fit back in the box. We got lots of prizes to give out. It's a little crowded in the box. <laughs> so we'll just put our sleeves off to the side. All right, congrats, Jared. But we're not done yet. We have an exhibition match. Our first exhibition match against B. All right, so we have battle styles for B. Also, ghost. Yes. Six packs uh, of battle styles. What is B's uh, point? What the level? Ten points. Ten points. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. So again, just a reminder for anybody jumping in: these are exhibition matches, slightly different from our gym challenge, but kind of the same point structure. So we need ten points to take down B this round. Uh, if you defeat B, you get um, a regular prize from her prize box. Uh, featuring Galar themed cards and then everybody who wins a prize card from B gets entered into the grand prize drawing for the Rainbow B uh, Rainbow B cards at yep. the end so good luck here we go let's see if we can take her down first try common non hollow and you were saying every time we have ten winners against B we'll do one of those giveaways so yep. we have three rainbow bees. Uncommon, non hollow. All right, come on, battle style. Do we have anything scheduled or figured out for the chilling rain release? Uh, we will definitely be live all weekend. Uh, we're gonna swap with Bari Bari Japan and be live instead. Uncommon, non hollow. Oof, come on, battle style. Actually, we can use the to sleep after uh, EV Heroes <laughs> release. See some points. Come in. All right, Colossal Hollow, two points. Hey, oh boy. I know you can do better than this, Battle Styles. Come on, Battle Styles. Big win, big win. You can do this. Just have to have good packs. Big points, big points. Uh, reverse Rare, Jellicent, one point. Hey, oh Not Hollow, Age Slash. One. Common. Oh, not on hollow bacon. Well, Battle Styles, that was not your best show. Ugh, oh, well, just our hollows from this round. Looks like B takes the victory. Here we are including bulk. Sequoia stream takeover. Uh no. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, as far as Chilling Rain goes, we are planning to be live Friday, Saturday, Sunday at our usual time, I believe. Yep. So that's 6 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. My apologies for having said that wrong for a long time. Eastern Daylight Time. Um, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Um, we're thinking we're going to go live again our regular schedule the week after, so Tuesday and Thursday. So Friday, Saturday, Sunday, then Tuesday, Thursday. Will we be taking a break next week before the weekend? Uh, we will be taking that Thursday off next week. So the day before set release. Um, yeah. I've updated our end of the calendar on the schedule page. I don't know if Ashley's had a chance to update the schedule, but as far as our streams go, they should be accurate on the schedule. Also, I think we were planning on having the items up for Chilling Rain a little bit earlier than normal, but we haven't really figured out when, because we need to confirm what we're getting on release day. Yeah. Um, our hope is that we can open up breaks, pre-orders, uh, early, 
and then probably open up personals um, at our usual time when we uh, reload the shop. So probably day of the stream. Um, our thought process behind that is that we would like to get a, give more people a chance to get in on the checklist so that we always do. Um, it involves a gift card giveaway. We want more people to have a chance instead of somebody going in and buying like 60 personal packs and then filling up half the checklist. This way, if we open up breaks early, mm, it's a larger group of people that have a chance on that. But we will have both group breaks and personal packs available, so no worries. Yep. How many we have up early and stuff just kind of depends on which packages are supposed to arrive by Friday and if the mail decides to be slow <laughs> kind of a thing. Yeah, Friday's really the only day in question. We should have enough packs to go crazy all weekend long once it arrives. Yep. <laughs> all right, but let's keep going. We got Steven up next with the gym challenge. What do we got? Um, taking on Bugsy, I believe. Um, Cyndaquil taking on Bugsy. And Rebel Clash. One, two, three, four, five, six. Legendary in chat, nice. Extra entries for the viewer giveaway. Best of luck to you, Steven. Here we go. I know you've been hunting Rebel Clash. I think we said supporters is what we're looking for, but regardless, good luck. Common Wingle, non hollow. Hair across, uncommon. Cursula Hollow, two points. Single point. I'm sure I'm going to talk about the legendary in chat. And then by the time the delay rolls around, it'll be gone. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, it's a legendary. I don't want my name around. No. <laughs> Barbarical Reverse Rare, one point. Single point. Twins, but non hollow. Common Boss's Orders Hollow, two points. Boy. Got a Trubbish Common. Hatterene Hollow, two points for the victory. Alright, Rebel Clash, one more. What you got? A Wingle and a Gyarados Hollow. Two more points. Ah, oh, Rebel Clash hiding the hits from us. At least you gave us Hollows for the win. All right, nine points total. Congrats. And no bulk for Steven. Hey, Shuya! You did win the viewer giveaway. Lucky, lucky. Alright, let's get Steven a prize card. We've got Baby Shiny Wimpod. Sigling! Shiny mustache. <laughs> so, is it like every couple hundred times you grow out a mustache, you get a shiny version? Ooh, that'd be cool. <laughs> or is that only when you be get right old? back? Don't shiny on TikTok. <laughs> only when you get old and it turns gray, and you're like shiny version. <laughs> 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 All right, there you go, Steven. Okay, we're gonna jump right into another gym challenge. This one for Marticia. All right, Marticia has. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Cyndaquil taking on Morty. Here we go. Going in with Rebel Clash once again. 
Also, welcome, local Isidore. One, two, three, four, five, six. Shoo, yeah, you want an Espeon giveaway with Ashley? Ooh, oh, nice. that's perfect. I think your uh, Espeon love is well known, so congrats. All right, best of luck. We need that eight points. Here we go. Common. We got Caparaja V. Segoy. Segoy. Three points. Ghost was brushing his shiny EV and then decided to take the excess hair to make a shiny mustache. <laughs> Would be uh interesting. Um, uncommon Metacham. Ooh, full art Malamar. So boy. Four points for the full art. All right, Morty, you got your work cut out for you, buddy. If you want to defend your gym, you know, gotta like, well, oh, step it up, man. Uncommon, Rillaboom, VMAX. Set so boy. Boy. We have four points for the VMAXs. I mean, that's a pretty powerful lineup to be taken on, so. <laughs> Stopping in to say hi, be back after my girls' softball games. Sounds good. Have fun, good luck, go yeah. win. Hopefully they did well. <laughs> We're cruising from here on out. We got Uncommon, non Hollow. Let's set a new record. <laughs> oh, I'm in love with these Rebel Clash package uh, wrappers. They open so nice. Uncommon, non Hollow. And any last minute surprises? Uncommon, non Hollow. All right, but not bad. Full art, V Max, and a V. And a victory over Morty. Marticia, congrats! And we are including the bulk. A lot of the big local Pogo battlers here have a gym battle system. You set up theme gyms and had pins if you beat them. So like they would physically give you a pin if you beat them? That's cool. Just like, like meetup style? Alright, Morty, prize box. Alex, welcome. Oh, we got gold spell tag for the prize this time. Sick boy. Rolling gold. Hmm, <laughs> so I've actually never read what this card actually does. When the psychic Pokemon this card is attached to is knocked out by damage from an opponent's attack, put four damage counters on your opponent's Pokemon in any way that you like. I love how the spell tag, like, powers up the psychic or ghost types when really spell tags are, like, used for, like, exercising ghosts and stuff. <laughs> but okay, why not? It, it, it's like weight training and stuff, you know? Mm, still no room for our sleeves. So they're getting all buffed right. using the, uh, it to repress their power so that when they, you know, use it, it goes overboard. <laughs> Let's see, Indy I see. Yep, the Pogo group here is pretty active. They give out pins for Silk Road card check ins at communities. Oh, that's so cool! Alex got my Eevee Heroes booster box two weeks early. Nice! And got gold. Right on. Alright, Ariana with some Starium blind boxes. Let's do it. Starium. Here they are. Alright, what will it be? 
much fun. Oh hey, we got homework Pikachu. Segoy. Segoy. Cute little uh, pillow top pedestal and stars in the background. Super good Pikachu uh, blind box, you know? I cannot remember for the life of me what you pulled. So hopefully that's not a dupe. Stariums are good because they have relatively minimal setup. <laughs> As I say, they mostly come back together. You yeah. have to just like maybe put the Pokemon where it needs to go and it's Especially done. like Gardevoir, you have to do nothing. It just, it's there. <laughs> Alright, second box. Ooh, we got our Espeon. Espeon the sun pedestal. the little dangly stars. They're a nice touch. Mm. They're rotating inner ring. It'll be fun. Congrats. Oh yeah, hopefully everyone had a good Gibble community day. I gotta admit, like, I was tempted, but I'm like, no, no, I don't want to do this. <laughs> I don't have the time to go run around for three hours at 100 degrees. Super warm art for our, uh, our community day. Mm. I didn't even realize it was happening. <laughs> I think I found out like an hour and a half late because I saw a Twitter post about it and I'm like, ah, crap. Mm. All right, Morticia up next, mystery bundle and then exhibition match. Let's do it. Starting off with our mystery bundle. Um, drawer number 17, Eevee drawer. Oh, nice. Rebel Clash, Sword and Shield, Guardians Rising, Battle Styles. I think in the entire year I played Pokemon Go, I found, like, maybe eight Gibbles total. So 13 shiny ones, definitely a good haul. <laughs> oh, Community Day is where it's at for shiny days. Mm -hmm. Alright, here we go. Good luck. That's true. There's a lot more options to, like, play from home now. That is true, yeah. We have a Magmortar Reverse. Bloop, 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 Dan. Cute Yamper. Paper, that's what I, I was like, I, I got up and I'm like, what did I get up for? <laughs> soon enough. Yeah. <laughs> Grumpig and Quaydol. Ah, mystery bundle being a little stubborn. Alright, hollows this round. And including all the bulk for Matisha. Alright, exhibition match time. Let's do it. Best of luck to Marticia. We've got six packs of battle styles. One, two, three, four, five, six. Here we go. We need ten points for that victory here. Good luck. BB, uncommon. Stoutland B, there we go. Starting off with three points. So boy. Segoy. Uncommon. Not hollow rare. Common. Not hollow. 
Kingdra, reverse rare, one point. Zagoy. And non hollow Drampa. Alright. Come on, Battle Styles. Here we go, here we go. Warming up. Let's see what you got. We've got Bruxish, uncommon. Non hollow rare. Alright, last pack. Scatterbug common. Octillery hollow. Two points. Ah. Ah, well, you know, we made more progress. That is good. We got Stalin V. And including all the bulk for this round. Well darn. We will get you, B. We will defeat you. We will defeat you and claim those rainbow wish they were autographed cards. <laughs> uh, Samantha up next with a mystery bundle. Um, Alex, are these the same as gym challenges? Uh, they are similar, but they're not exactly the same. They're kind of like a one-off gym challenge. So they're independent um, from like that gym leader ladder. Yeah, and you can challenge them immediately, and you can challenge them even if you win as many times as you like, so you can win multiple times. <laughs> hey, thank you so much, Fly Guy! Okay. Samantha's mystery bundle is drawer number 14. Pip up. Sun and Moon, Vivid Voltage, Battle Styles, and Breakpoint. Alright, best of luck. Also, Curse of Games, welcome. Eight, eight. Sarud V. Segoi. Segoi. What you got? Swana and Mega Gyarados EX. Sick oh, hey. Boy. All right, Mega Gyarados EX and Zarud V from this drawer. Breakpoint Gyaradoses. Hopefully, we should have some more breakpoint soon. I was gonna say we have some more breakpoint <laughs> that's in the three V bundles. If anyone's that looking for true. some, true, true. Three V bundles V two, which gets really confusing because now it's three and two in the same title, but you know. All right, Zelda Hime, your turn next. Mystery bundle. Number 18 for you. Hey, you're here. Awesome. Darkness Ablaze, Battle Styles, Sword and Shield, Roaring Skies. Nice. Pull some legendaries. 
Good luck. It's spectrum exactly. <laughs> Batch. We got Eternatus V Max. Savoy. slightly afterwards with like wasn't burning shadows one of the first rainbow sets i honestly don't know but we got rayquaza ex Segoy. we got snoodle so we'll be seeing a lot more of the snoodle in uh, august set when we uh, get the rayquazas that'll be fun rayquaza ex lapras v and eternatus v max and i'm going with all the bulk as well so it's kind of funny how every time Rayquaza's in a set, other than the amazing rare Rayquaza, it's just like, you know, here's six different Rayquazas. <laughs> Why not? There might be two gold, unless I'm thinking of Dragon's Majesty. I honestly don't know. I'll look it up. <laughs> All right. Um, did I skip somebody? Or did I put those out of order? No, we're good, I think. Michael Stern! Hey, Michael's here as well. Good luck on your mystery bundles. I have a drawer six and seven. I think it's gonna be pretty fun to have some more dragon trainers in. Alright, for drawer six. Dragons Rising, Rebel Clash. Steam Siege and Fates Collide. There are two golds. They are um, Energy Switch and Versus Seeker. Oh, nice. Battle Styles, Breakpoint, Rebel Clash, Steam Siege. They're the old style gold. Where they're ah, like that's cars. it. Here we go, good luck. Bless our pole, Shuffle. I feel like this dual set is the only way we will finally get a Lance Alert supporter. Yeah, you know, he'd be a good one to celebrate with all the dragons. We got Manaphy EX. Segoy. Segoy. Is there a Claire Full Art supporter? I'm trying to think of all the dragon trainers. Um, Claire V, isn't it? Gyarados Hollow. Should clarify that. Uh, oh, that was bad. Uh, uh. Glide score reverse. All right, mystery bundles. Remember what we talked about? Rainbows and golds. Oh, almost certainly I can give him a full art with that set. 
Like, they gave him a half art card. It'd be really weird if they did not give him a full art. Truth. Belt's all reverse. Spirit tomb. Alright, Pates Collide. What you got? You got Jigglypuff. I have a super cute Jigglypuff plush that I need to give away sometime. I'm thinking maybe during Chilling Rain. Mm. Uncommon. We got Genesect EX. Sugoy. Sugoy. But that is an adorable Jigglypuff. Genesect and Manaphy EXs. And of course, Hollows and such. I need to stop yapping and chat and work on my budget. Budgets are important, but. I mean, yapping's fun too. <laughs> um, ooh, we got a swing vignette for Marticia up next. Oh, I'm so excited to open these again. I've missed these. but I can't buy cards if I don't know what money I have. You know, fair. Uh, yeah, points. Points for that. <laughs> oh, Steven, you fell asleep. No worries. It sounds like you needed it. Okay, here we go. Swing vignette. Hey, Luna. Welcome, welcome. A reminder if you haven't seen these before they're super cool i don't think there's a bad one in this batch which is great mm -hmm. and like i feel like even the pikachu one's good because it's not butterfree <laughs> to make up for it oh did i jinx it we got pikachu and butterfree oh, hopefully that's a good one for you still get to figure out if it's uh, Pikachu catching a ride willingly or Pikachu like trying to do six seconds on the back of the Butterfree. <laughs> Hijack the Butterfree. Ah, oh, but this base, this base is super pretty. All the flowers. This thing is like solid though. Like you could, you could knock somebody out with this thing. I feel like so. <laughs> it's not going down anytime soon. <laughs> we don't advise using it that way, but you know. Ghost Dragon, I agree so much. Oh, these are such good ones. It's adorable. All right, getting the uh, Pikachu Butterfree for Marticia. Oh, Ralsei, well, that's why I buy first and check how much money I don't have later. Smiley face. <laughs> Ralsei. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, we've got Sky up next with Terrarium Collection 2. Uh-oh. Timestamps aren't working? Um, I will go take a look at that. Put it right to the live feed. Interesting. Alright, well here's uh, two of them. We need to get you one more. Have a good night. Hope you get some good rest. Hmm. All right. That one worked for me. Not sure what we're looking for, but I hope we find it. Good luck. some bubbles. What are ya? Ooh, that looks like a Charizard in there. Charizard. 
Charizard. Yep. Ah, we don't even have to try to pull Zards on this stream. Wah ha ha ha. If you want to give it a try now, Stephen, let me know if it has any issues. Oh, it's a tiny mountain in the background. <laughs> it looks like candy. <laughs> don't eat it, though. All right, Charizard. How much are these statues? Uh, it kind of varies depending on the set. But, like, anywhere from, like, 15 to 18 range. These ones in particular, what are these? The Collection 2s? Yep. Uh, do, collection 2 are 17. Alright, second box. Hey, Mama Bear! Love the blind boxes so much. Oh, I know, me too. Uh, Jordan, any thoughts if Chilling Rain will be in the gym battles? Uh, we are hoping to add them in later. We do need to open a little bit of it to make sure that it is fair according to the other sets and it's not like super advantageous or like a cheating set. But we are hoping to, but it might take us a couple weeks. Psyduck and Poliwag, cuties. Right? Does that sound about accurate? Yeah. I just have to take a look and make sure it's not like, oh, look, our full arts are being pulled in the reverse hollow spot. And I'm like, well, now I gotta deal with that for point scale. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Got some water type friends. We lag inside up. The good news is it's not a set like Champion's Path with a guaranteed hollow <laughs> that you just can't compensate for, so. Box. Sorry, which one was this one? Uh, Poliwag and Psyduck. Oh, hey, I think I see our poster child in there. There he is, little Squirtle guy. He's got like a whole scene going on, like his own personal little spa. Oh, cute. Featured Squirtle on the front there. Probably a little better view. All put together. In question two, they kind of went like all out with the backgrounds. They're like, let's put as much as we can in these. I like it. Can't wait for Chilling Rain. Full Art Zero Aura is so beautiful. Oh, I'm super excited to see that one in person. For sure. I'm excited for a new variety of alt arts. Mm -hmm. They're all so good. There's like, what, 15 alt arts or something in the set? Or 12? Or it's a lot. That Blissey. Blissey's adorable. So, Robbie White asked if you sell Cosmic Eclipse solo packs. Unfortunately, we do not. Um, the Cosmic Eclipse we have available is in the Lady Luck bundles. Which is a collection of packs that have uh, the female supporters. As well as quite a few male supporters, because every set that has a bunch of female supporters <laughs> has a bunch of males as well, but... Alright, Justin, your turn. Um, starting off with a blind box. Then we've got mystery bundles and gym challenges. So let's do our blind box. Swing vignette. so we can make those personals again, but uh, it's hard to find. Oh, we got a base. We got a base. Okay, a base that doesn't want to stand up. <laughs> hey, we've got the Mimikyu pair. Drifloon. Yep. Drifloon. I will get it right. Okay, the base is fine. The wrapper just doesn't want to cooperate. <laughs> oh, so cool. There 
you go. Drifloon can carry off Mimikyu in that creepy way that instead of children, you know? I feel like Mimikyu's like, yay! Fun times! Mm hmm. Isn't there like something creepy about Drifloon carrying off children? Yeah. Or Loon, Drifloon. What about. I mean. I don't know what I'm doing, Ghost. I'm sorry. <laughs> I was I like, just, okay, that's nice, but I need the box, too. Just handed him the figure and left the box. Drifloon is very distracting. Oh, Steven, you found it! Oh, good, oh, good. That one? Nope, not that one. I'm already had it, yeah. Oh, you stole it. <laughs> Alright. Hopefully that's a, a new one for you. Drifloon carrying Mimikyu seems kind of dark when you know Drifloon kidnaps kids. But, like, Mimikyu is kind of dark, so I feel like they... Mimikyu's already a ghost type, Yeah, so. I feel like they'd be friends. They're like, yay, bonding activity. <laughs> uh, I don't know if you can check on that one, Ghost? Steven, you have... Yes, you have defeated Faulkner and Bugsy, so you have two gyms down. Whitney is your next. Alright, Justin, we've got mystery bundles for you next. Uh, one and four. Come here. Bonk. Nope, that's upside down. Guardians Rising, Vivid Voltage, Battle Styles, and Champion's Path. If I could have like an extra two inches on my arms, that'd be great. <laughs> Steam Siege, Primal Clash, uh, Burning Shadows, and Vivid Voltage. Another option is you can... Uh... Switch bacon bug over to the other side, move the drawers two inches closer, and then boom. Wouldn't have him close enough to pet. Point. <laughs> Good luck, here we go. Steven, my mind is school tired. I have no idea which end is up right now. <laughs> that sounds fair. No worries. Were we able to get those timestamps doing okay? Yeah, I think they work now, so. Yawn Mega Break, Sigil. Sigil. I think I had a uh, slash after the numbers, so it was linking wrong. Mm. Bundle B, Reverse Hollow. Got some ancient abilities in the back. everywhere, and I was like, shouldn't you be in school? I'm like, wait, it's summer. <laughs> <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> Ooh, Jarampa Full Art! Sigoy! Sigoy! I really am getting old. It's like, ugh, children. <laughs> Being noisy outside of all places. <laughs> oh my goodness, so we live in an apartment complex, and there is one child it has a plastic recorder, like that musical instrument that they give you in like fourth grade. Think of it as like, kind of like a wooden flute if you don't know what a recorder is. Oh my goodness, it is their prized possession and they play it everywhere. <laughs> I am trying to be patient, but oh man. They don't even play songs, they just blow into it. I was going to say play might be generous. It's just <laughs> full lungs, one whistle, kind of a... <laughs> I'm turning into the crazy cat lady without the cats. That's my lot in life from here on out. <laughs> oh, Ralsei, you live next to a playground. Oh, boy. 
Oh my goodness, if that child would play Zelda music, we'd be best friends. Oh yeah. <laughs> Alright, um... We got our hollows here. We got full art, Drampa, and Yawn Mega Break. Also work nights, so sleeping during the day is difficult. Ooh, yeah. Just don't give the kids recorders. That's my number one advice. <laughs> oh yeah, it, it causes all sorts of interesting interactions, like... You know, the, the doorbell rang this morning. I'm like, oh, it must be a package or something. And it was just a little kid being like, you want a piece of gum? And I'm like, no, thank you. And he's like, okay, bye, and ran off. <laughs> and I'm like, all right, then. <laughs> all right, let's do some gym challenges for you. Um, we've got Bugsy, right? Oh, yes. Uh, Justin. Justin has... City Quill taking on Bugsy. Sounds good. We're going in with Crimson Invasion this time. And we have two challenges. Also, speaking of Crimson, we did get a uh, small restock of it, so there is uh, some of that available in both gym challenges and personals today. Ralsei, why? Are you serious? One has like a tuba, the rest just screaming. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> okay, don't give kids tubas either. I, I was very confused because we I had just woken up and then I, I, I hear the doorbell and so I'm like I look out like at eye level and I'm like where's the delivery person and I look down and then it's like, you know, they're like three feet tall and I'm like oh was not expecting you didn't see the you first there. rare type null one point Segoy. hey hey put that back Gyarados GX Segoy. Segoy. three points looking for that loosening all right mm. all right you know what to do Crimson. I'm sorry. Kids are wonderful. They're just not for me. That's all I'm saying. Common. Non-hollow. So I, I do apologize if it sounds like I'm bashing on your kids. I'm sure your kids are angels. <laughs> Xerneas! Reverse rare. One point. Non-hollow. If anybody has kids in the audience here. Although, Steven, being a music teacher, can probably attest that, you know, recorders really aren't used as a musical instrument outside of, like, <laughs> elementary school music class. <laughs> There's no points in that last one. Um, uncommon. Go Goat Hollow! Two points! Go so Goat! It's what we needed! There we go! Bugsy goes down! And we got one more. Exactly! The best pets are other people's pets. And you get to play with them and whatnot. Oh, they are! Reverse rare! One point! I guess I only associated them with, you know, every kid in our, you know, grade school music class having one. <laughs> Alright, we've got that Gyarados GX, hollows and reverses. Eight points for the win. I bet you when you know they're professionally played, I bet they're, they sound really good, but uh, I don't think anyone in my elementary school class achieved that level. No, I think they were just used as weapons outside of class. Just bop your friend with your recorder. Like, I can reach farther now. Mm. Alright, we were going uh, no bulk. All right, Bugsy Prize. Get the Jigglypuff? Absolutely. One Jigglypuff. Oh my gosh, the adorable Jigglypuff. Looks like Volcarona Full Art. So boy. The bug box has spoken. Like, I wasn't even fully awake. The kid came to the door and be like, I have a quest for it. I'd be like, that's nice, thank you, goodbye. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm hunting Koroks right now, so no. <laughs> Still a little full for that. In his defense, it was like, you know, 12, 30, 1 o'clock, but we, we sleep late just because we're up <laughs> so late, so... Uh... Alright, second gym challenge. Take it on Whitney. And Crimson Invasion as well. 
One, two, three, four, five, six. Best of luck, we need seven points for Whitney as well. What do we got? We got Diggers being uncommon. Oh, it's a rainbow day! Sugoi! Sugoi, rainbow guzzlord! Rainbow guzzlord alone? Oh, wow. Uh, five points. I think it's the first time we pulled, like, Guzzlord alone. Like, we usually see the Guzzlord Nagatadel. But I guess that's Hidden Fates. Maybe? I'm uh, confused. I don't remember. <laughs> Guzzlord looks sweet, though, as a rainbow. Alright, that's a great start. Uh, that's probably an okay link to post, Steven. Common and a low and executor GX. Sick boy. Three points. Well, boom. Crimson, doing well. Is it only battles right now or opening anything? Yeah, it's basically we just go down the list and whatever is on our next up next list or on the queue is what we open. So if you want to place an order for anything, we can open it. Common and non hollow. Oh, speaking of, uh, we have our draft up. I forgot to mention that earlier. Okay. We got an 80 pack hit draft for battle styles up currently. First rare, Agron, one point. Sugoi. Oh, dang, a little Golem GX. Sugoi. Sugoi, three points. Still two packs to go. This is nice. Uncommon. Angry Wiggly Tough. Last one. <laughs> Getting a blind box, Frozen Bolt. Oh, they're so tempting. I love them all. Common. Oh, no way! We've got a gold card! Wishful Baton! We were just talking about things that people can bop each other with. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> I grant your wish. Whack! <laughs> Alright, how about a rainbow and gold day? That's what we need. From Crimson of all packs. I'm impressed! Sugoi, 17 points. Dang, poor Whitney. Never saw it coming. Alright. Wishful Baton, Rainbow Guzzlord, the Alone Executor, and Alolan Golem. And noble. Alright. Oh. Winter sparkles! Deploy! <laughs> <laughs> Whitney's crying in the corner. The mill tank bopping baton. Like, no. Bad cow. Stay away. <laughs> Can we explain how gym battles work? Yeah, sure. Let me just uh, get this prize card and then we'll jump into that. Looks like we got a full art double. Sigoy. Sigoy. Go, floofy sheep. Another rollout farm animal. <laughs> true, true. All right, so what we just saw here was a gym battle. Um, gym battles are kind of like personal pack battles. So every hit that you pull corresponds to a certain point level. Um, there's the score posted there by Professor Bari Baribot. Um, you're trying to pull a certain amount of points to defeat whichever gym leader that you're on. Uh, you have to start off with Faulkner, who is, I believe, six points. Thank you. you get six packs every gym battle, and you're trying to pull that certain amount of points from your six packs. Uh, the gym leaders get harder as you go, and you can't move on to the next gym leader until you defeat them. Um... You do get to choose your pack type in a gym challenge um, from what's available in our store. What else am I missing? Well, if I missed any points, uh, feel free to chime in chat. Uh, but yeah, they're just kind of a fun personal pack battle 
with a Johto region theme this time. Alright, did I miss anything in chat? Uh, sorry uh, for the amount of questions, but when checking out, what does spot number mean? So spot numbers are usually in group breaks. It's basically just re reserving your spot in the break. So if there's 10 spots, that means there's like 10 people or 10 little slots in the break for the break to be divided up into. Um, so you can purchase more than one spot. Um, how do we explain spots? But yeah, but basically on group activities, the cards are divided amongst everyone. So when you are purchasing into that, you do not end up with all 36 or all 80 of the packs to yourself. You get some proportion of them depending on the break. So like random type breaks, you get either like fire, water, some kind of like elemental spot. If it's a draft break, you get one spot in the picking order. And in like rotations, it's one spot in the random hit order kind of thing. So if you were looking for things to be opened immediately for you without having to wait for the entire set of spots to fill, which is what we have to do for group breaks, then you might want to look under the personals tab and get one of the three pack personals or stream games, that kind of a thing. Those we can open right away. All right, up next we've got Hunter also doing some gym challenges. Best of luck. What do we have for Hunter? But yeah, never feel bad about asking questions. We're more than happy to answer them. Uh, Hunter, Totodile, taking on Morty. Totodile. I don't think we've seen Totodile today. Represent. Alright, going in with battle styles. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, good luck, Hunter. Here we go. Um, H slash reverse, one point. Let's go, me. So in the gym challenge, all reverse hollow rares are worth one point. So I might let you know if it's a common or something, like Zubat common just so you know why I'm not awarding points. And then non-hollows, no points for that. Also, Shine on Dirgy, thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome. Shinx, common. Hollow or beetle, two points. Hey, Mr. Bacon Bids, welcome. from Stoutland and Morty. I think it's like the scarf mustache kind of a thing. <laughs> yeah, no, I can see that. <laughs> um, Galarian Slowbro, reverse rare, one point. Segoy. And not hollow. And for our gym challenges, a tie does count as a victory. So you just have to get at least that many, if not more. Frozen Bolt. Apparently my sneeze was lucky. All the lucky sneezes. <laughs> Alright, we got a total of nine points. Congrats. And a mustache doggo. Um, no bulk. Alright. Alright, prize card time. What do we got? Dragapult, baby shiny. Sorry. All right, baby shiny. 
All right, and Hunter, you have caught up. We had two gym challenges for you, but since you've defeated Morty, we don't have any more gym leaders for you to face at the moment. <laughs> so we will give you a refund for that second one. Oh, I'll make a note of that. Another thing, just to clarify for those not familiar with the gym challenge, uh, we release a new gym leader every week. So currently, Morty is as far as we've released. So if you get up to Morty and you defeat him, um, if you purchase another gym challenge, we'll just give you a refund since we don't have any, <laughs> any other gym leaders to offer past that point. But next week, next week we'll have Chuck. That's who it is. Yes. The fighting master out on the Whirl Islands. <coughs> Kazuntai. 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 Oh, excuse me. Where's Rick? Rick and Morty. Eh, eh, yeah, uh, eh. They're probably on the other channel. <laughs> <laughs> also, thank you. Blue Ribbon, thank you for the follow. Alright, who's up next? Um, Tavita with a mystery bundle. Mystery bundle time. Here we go. Morty box in the way. We've been looking for drawer number 24. Sylvia on drawer. The Pokemon on the drawers, they don't actually mean anything. They're just for fun and to be cute. Battle Styles, Primal Clash, Darkness Ablaze, and Crimson Invasion. Best of luck, here we go. Here on my wifey's phone, phone died. Oh, red phone. Well, best of luck. Ponyard. We got Flapplebee, Sigoy. Sigoy. We're just like. Increasingly getting off center as we go through the pack. Uh, Pokemon. With Cash. Ooh, Primal Kyogre EX. Ooh, Sago. Hey. Do not pull the Primals. As much as we need to. <laughs> They're cool cards. Okay, over. Sounds good. I was lamenting to Ghost the other day how I missed Darkness Blaze because I want to pull more Rainbow Scorches. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I love Shiny Scorch, but I miss Rainbow Scorch. <laughs> Hopefully sometime this summer they'll uh, finally get that fabled reprint of Darkness out. Mm -hmm. And we got Beware Hollow. Alright, Primal Kyogre EX and the Flapple V, plus all of our hollows. Segoy! And no bulk. Alright. Excellent first drawer luck. And we've got Charlie up next, also with the mystery bundle. So just a quick reminder, if you are new to the shop, be sure to read the Shipping Explained page and learn how we do shipping. Alright, growing for drawer 15, or Lycanroc drawer. So I'm being nice to Colin and not making her do the shipping spiel today. <laughs> Fly home, thank you for the host. Welcome to anybody watching from Fly Home. Fates Collide, Darkness Ablaze. Fates Collide again, and Crimson Invasion. Oops. Oh, welcome, welcome, Raiders. Or hosters. Um, Is there a term for 
You, I guess. Sorry, real quick. Yeah. Um, Poke, if you wanted a, I, we can swap this out for battle styles if you'd prefer, since we've got two fates collides in here. Um, oh, did I do that? Ah. I think we could probably do like battle styles or sun and moon if you wanted either of those, or if you'd like two fates collide, more than welcome to them. We'll start with your other two until we hear from you. Okay. Good luck. Hey, thanks, Fly Home. Were you streaming? Hopefully it went well, if so. Got Pinkerton Hollow. Going for the fates. Sound good. Sorry, you didn't mean to call you out, Ghost. No, that was totally fine. Like, it was my bad. I did not shuffle them well enough and then pay attention. Make sure they were all unique. Snivy, White Kiram. Who knows? Maybe we'll pull an Umbreon. It could happen. Kiram twins. <laughs> All right, looks like foils and uh, just that round. Can I get the deerling? Sure thing. Deerling. Okay, you're grabbing it. Here we go. And there was no bulk. Sounds good. Well darn, hoping for a little better luck, but sometimes the mystery bundles are stingy. Um, uh, Max, your turn next. We've got some swing vignettes. Somewhere in the tower of blind boxes. I was gonna say. <laughs> the tower has grown over the past couple days. <laughs> stock the line boxes, I tend to order like a whole bunch all at once, so it comes in and just like, boom! Tower times two. <laughs> Alright, good luck, Max. Hey, cool boy. Welcome, welcome. How's everybody's day so far? Or night? I think ours is going well, well except for like children being <laughs> children. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but stream has been good so far for us. Mm -hmm. Ooh, we got Chandelure in this one. That's spooky. I want to say it's like a tree, a tree branch curling up. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm not sure, but that's my interpretation. It's like a foggy forest kind of a thing. It's one of those like yeah. creepy, like gnarled trees that. Chandelure! Found the same yet. It's the first one. They could have done like extra points and had it been like a Trevenant with like the branch holding Ooh, the little That would have been spooky. Oops, I forgot the gum. Um, and second box. At least the swing vignettes are from this year, so the gum is likely to be fresh. <laughs> Who knows? It's cheap gum. Ooh, Flygon! There you go! Flygon! The sandstorm swirl base somewhat reminds me of ice cream. <laughs> it's like a caramel flavored soft serve or something, you know? <laughs> then again, I'm always thinking about ice cream because I'm obsessed. Flygon for the second box. You know, I still feel it's, like, really weird to have, like, chewing gum in these. Like, it just, like, you know what people who collect figurines really love? Chewing gum. We should give them some free chewing gum <laughs> for their figurines. It's just so odd. They must have a weird contract Maybe with the chewing gum Maybe it's a Japan thing. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> All right. Up next, we've got Samantha, Mystery Bundle. Too far. Do, 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 do. 
do do. Drawer number 20. 20, we got our Lucario drawer. Stretch. Roaring Skies, Shining Fates, Battle Styles, and Primal Clash. Love Roaring Skies, favorite card, Shaman Full Art. Ooh. That is a nice one. I am partial to all the Rayquazas in Roaring Skies. He's a cool dude. I think, is there been another Shaman card recently? I guess there's like a cute, couple cute, like, half art cards, but. Not really. And Powder on Hollow. There's a lot of legendaries. They can't give them all love every set. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, there we go. Mystery Bundle. There's a Shaman promo. That's true. Mm. Back to Sky with a Collection 2 Terraria. No problem, Mover. Shaman in the Chilling Ring, so that's not even crazy. Oh, but it's still pretty cute. Look forward to seeing that. More art to appreciate. Oh, Chilling. <laughs> Hurry up. Soon, soon. Alright, good luck. Here we go. What do we have for this one? Oh no. Oh no, I think it's a dupe. Oh darn. I mean, it's a good dupe. We got Charizard. Sigoy. Oh, Charizard from Collection 2. Oh, he's got a little flame. A little flame. Hey, Van, welcome. Lunar Mystery Bundle and Gym Challenge. Uh, let's do Mystery Bundle first. Um, draw number 19. Let's see. Rebel Clash, Cosmic Eclipse. Darkness Ablaze and Crimson Invasion. Hey Groot! Forgot to name my Cyndaquil for my gym challenge journey. Oh no! That's okay, we can help you out. Well, uh, do you have a name in mind? Good luck, Lunar. Uh, the first partner packs seem to come out random times throughout the month. Ours always seem to be a little bit slow. Yeah. We'll do Cosmic Blast. I do know we are getting some in, and I think we're getting in a few more than we usually do, so that's good news if anyone is uh, looking for those. Alright, 
Cosmic, what you got? Do we have confirmation for uh, Evolving Skies that it's got the EVs and and such? I mean, I'm assuming everyone's assuming, but I'm just curious if they officially came out and said it yet or not. Let's see if they have any confirmation on Oak of Beach, because they usually know. All right, looks like just our reverses this time for the Mystery Bundle. Noble. seeing anything on Poke Beach, but they're not always the first. Alright, well, let's do our gym challenge. Alright, Chikorita taking on Morty. Hey, Dongo. Welcome. All right, we're going in with Battle Styles. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Groot, I was thinking along the lines of Spike or Shula. No, well, you got some time to decide between those <laughs> two. Good luck, Lunar, here we go. But I can always make that note on the uh, bad sheet whenever you decide. Uncommon. Non hollow. I mean, everyone's assuming that it's going to be in AV Heroes, but I don't think we've gotten the set list from from the set yet. Yeah, so. no, it's going to be a while before we hear the exact set list on that. Common and non hollow. I mean, if they didn't, if they named it Evolving Skies and didn't put the EVs in, I think everybody would be face palming real hard. Yeah. But, you know, Pokemon Company has done some interesting things in the past, so. I mean, honestly, I'm really hoping it's in the August set, not only because I get my EVs sooner, but, uh. There we go. Reverse rare, one point. Zagoy. Bronzong Hollow, two points. Zagoy. But because they uh, don't have a lot of collection boxes announced for this next set for Evolving Skies. So that means a lot of those promo EVs, if we got those, will be actually pack bowls. Uncommon. Which would be nice. Not hollow. Oh, hey, pack bowl. Nice. Do we already open EV Heroes? Um, yes. Our Japan stream team has opened a lot of EV Heroes. King Drum Reverse, one point. Sigourney. And I'm sure they're going to be opening even more this weekend. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, last one. Come on, here we go. Did they manage to complete the checklist? I think they probably, like, two weeks. I think they've probably gotten the checklist done, but maybe there's a holdout EV illusion. No! Oh. Shoot! Oh, Morty taking his first victory. How rude. Ah, oh, just our hollows and reverse hollows this round. We got halfway, four points. Uh, no bulk. Ugh, well, I guess Morty woke up. Go back to bed. Go back to sleep. We liked it better. Get some more hypnosis going, you know? <laughs> And actually did finish the checklist. Yay! Nice. Roger the Dodger. I hope Evie never comes to English. Good luck. I'll have to Good disagree luck. with that. <laughs> Ghosts like you want to fight? Strongly disagree. You want to fight? Ah, <laughs> oh, we got our pack goal. Let's update that. Um, let's see. Where are we going next? 500 packs for Gardevoir EX. The EV Heroes in Japanese has been this crazy, like, oh, it's gonna be uh, a wild ride in English. Alright, where did we get to? Alright, Paul, your turn for a Starium. Also, Art, Alt Art Espeon, that's a sweet one. Don't jinx it on me, Frozen Bold. I think I might die. Imagine the chaos if Eevee Heroes became a special set. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> okay. 
Here we go. Here's our blind box. Ghost Colin Ash and Ginko should be the Elite Four. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, that'd be great. I'd probably be like 25 points and make it impossible to defeat me. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> She's going to go five points beyond our record to beat Colin. Okay. Yep. Yep. That's she has boss. to hand draw rules. you a rainbow card if you beat her. <laughs> Alright, what do we have? Ooh, we've got Lapras this time. Segoy. Segoy. Cute Lapras. All the crystals for decorations. And a little water bowl. Alright, well hopefully you like Lapras there, Frozen Bolt. This means whoever wins this fight over Iggy Heroes in English gets to sleep in the bed and the other has to sleep in the doghouse. <laughs> Wait, what? I'm sorry, I don't understand. I mean, I can sleep pretty much anywhere, but... <laughs> I don't want to open Iggy Heroes. And up next, we've got Matthew with a gym challenge. Cyndaquil taking on Morty. Going in with battle styles. One, two, three, four, five, six packs. All right, good luck. We need that eight points. Here we go. Uncommon. Artillery Hollow, two points. Oh boy. Now I can think of ghosts sitting on a throne built out of Eevee plushies. Ooh, that's a good idea. <laughs> Tyranitar V, Segoy! Segoy! Tomorrow, a whole bunch of EVs show up in the mail. <laughs> that goes. I bet you could do it with those low EVs. Oh my goodness. They, they work really well for like building blocks for a throne. Alright, Battle Styles, we're doing good. Let's keep it up. Common, non hollow. I also thought a way to get more EV heroes home from Japan should we ever go. <laughs> Just like, sir, there wasn't a seat in that area before. It's like, this is always the seat. Like, you know, this is this is a normal airline seat thrown in EVs. <laughs> <laughs> totally not me trying to get more EVs back to the US. No, totally not. Cherubi huh. oh. common. There we go. Rapid Striker Shifu V. Segoy. Three points for the victory. <laughs> no, Groot, no. Come in and Ente Hollow for two more. Segoy. All right, congrats. We got 10 points. With the Rapid Strike Bear and the Tyranitar Vs. There we go. And no bulk. What's the point system? So this is the uh, the point system for like a pack battle for our gym challenges. Every hit card that you pull corresponds to a certain point value. And we're trying to get enough points to defeat the gym leader on the left side. So we got 10 points. It's a victory. Yep, and there's the uh, command that shows all the different uh, point values. Alright, prize card for Matthew. Oh no, Mr. Big Bit, your cat's eating plastic. Glad you caught it. We have Full Art Bliss. <coughs> Excuse me. Full Art Bliss Cephalon. Segoy! So what happened when you and your mom went to the pet store? Did they have free pet treats? Was Actually, I think that's kind of standard. 
juicy, cute animals. Did you teach a parrot to say Pokemon words? <laughs> that would be pretty impressive in a short amount of time. <laughs> there we go. And Morty goes down. Alright, Groot, your turn. I'm not sure if I would ever want to get a parrot that's been like hanging out in a pet store, because then you won't be like the only person training them with words. <laughs> I don't know how easy it is to untrain a parrot to stop saying something. <laughs> uh, I don't think it's possible. It's probably like it's probably not easy anyway. Alright, we've got Groot going in with Cyndaquil. Alright, we got a name for the Cyndaquil Groot. I think uh, they said Shula. Alright, uh, I will make a note of that on the sheet. Here we go, taking on Faulkner for the very first... Ah, uh, their very first gym challenge. Just here across the house. I choose you! <laughs> Clean up aisle six! <laughs> the dog's loose again! There's one, two, three, four, five, and six packs of Sun and Moon. Best of luck, here we go. I'm gonna get fish, get the water test first, waited for someone to be free. Fell in love with a fancy hamster, so we ended up going home with a hamster. <laughs> <laughs> nice. We got Hollow Dug Trio, two points. There go. I missed Groot's comment. Oh, uh, I'll scroll back up. This paper goes to buy out all the seats in an airline so we can stuff as many seats full of easy to bring back to the US. <laughs> we go through being like one or two lines either, Sir, is there anything you would like to declare? Or, Sir, do you need to fill out a citizenship slip for each TV kid? Uh, Alright, sorry, I think we froze for a minute, oh. but I think we're back now. Oh, I did see your comment, group. Reverse rare, Arcanine, one point. Say goodbye. Non hollow. Common, not hollow. Pokemon does enjoy both extremes. Like, here's an animated keychain, and you know, here's a dragon. <laughs> no, uncommon. We got Vicavolt Hollow, two points. Segoy. Oh, baby bear, that's a cute name that's for adorable. hipster. <laughs> also, my apologies for missing the follows. JK Figgy, and now Kyle the Snowman. Welcome, welcome. Common, not hollow. Also, is Fancy Hamster a, like, is that like a breed of hamster, or is it just they were very fancy? <laughs> Do they have a little patch of fur that looks like a bow tie? Next one. There we go, reverse rare, one point. Segoy. And Flirt Sogaleo. Segoy, Segoy. <laughs> Four points for the full art. Faulkner defeated. It's a breed. Okay. I want to be a fancy human. <laughs> All right. Congrats. Getting the full art and enough points to take down Faulkner. And let's see. Do 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 do. No book. Faulkner prize box. I'm already a fancy human. Yes. I mean, you do have your fancy silver nails this week. That's true. They're very sparkly. We've got Celestila Full Art. Segoy. I was going to say, I was thinking the math on that was wrong when it said 310 days, and I'm like, August isn't almost a year, and then I'm like, oh crap, it's already June. Uh, <laughs> Uh, do we put the hollows in the bulk pile? Uh, no, you're always, you will always receive the hollows and reverse hollows. If you, oh, oh so did you I? Make a bolt. Oh, my bad. Okay, well, I'm not supposed to. Let's let's go that way. Uh, I'm gonna double check the score on that one since it was a gym challenge, just to make sure. Um, I had ten points total. So we had four, five, five six, six, seven. Uh, 
Nine. Did it, was it Wait, there, there are two diglets. Uh, hollow. Oh, hollow, yeah. So that's two points. So yeah, we're good. Okay, cool. Wait. Yeah, because one's hollow, one's reverse, so ten points. Yep. Cool. Alright, well the points were right, even if the piles weren't. Good catch, good catch. <laughs> My bad. Okay, let's see. Up next we've got Rousey with a gym challenge. Taking on Morty this time. Oops. Um. Um. Cindy Quill taking on Morty. Perfect. What are we battling with? Crimson. It's been good to us today. Mm. And Ralsey in particular. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, here we go again then. Good luck. Regirock, reverse rare, one point. Segoy. Oh, cutie, Alolan Raichu Hollow, two points. Segoy. Hollow, two points. <laughs> Common, non hollow, odd money until my bank processes my government piece of paper that says $600 on it. <laughs> all good, all good. Hopefully, that processes quickly. Common. Come in. Go Goat Hollow, two points. There you go. Super close. Down to the last one. Hey, slugs, welcome. All you, Crimson, what you got? You can do it. So Lazzle reverse, one point. Segoy. And Agron Hollow, bonus points, two points. Crimson tearing up the gym challenge. Bill Tank's like, it's my day off. It's Morty's turn. Just going three for three today. Wow, that's awesome. Well, the Hollow's pulling through for the victory, ten points. Congrats, slugs. All our Umbreon on V immediately first pack. Let's see. Your boy Gravy also paid for shipping. Awesome. So that'll head out um, probably this weekend. Yep. Monday. Packaged up Friday and Saturday and in the mail on Monday. Oh, we got a mail tank for Rousey. Oh, yep. I can grab that. Beat you to it. Cute little mail tank. Have a nap on that tree. Alright, uh, Morty prize box. We've got, ooh, Age Slash. Segoy. We've got an alternate art, Age Slash. EX. Segoy. Segoy. Very imposing uh, art there. He's like, hmm? You talking about me? Uh, uh. Let's see, Groot. I mean, I could spend it on things called essentials, or I can beat all remaining gym leaders. <laughs> I vote essentials. Those are very good. <laughs> Budget comes first. Alright, up next we've got Jessica with a mystery bundle. Love that blue with the Aegis Lash? Or are we talking about the box again? <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Let's see. Mystery bundle camera. Oh, no. 
always stick the box in the way. <laughs> drawer number 11 this time. Gengar drawer. Evolutions, Crimson Invasion, Darkness Blaze, and Sun and Moon. Might pull a Lazard. Randomly out of Sun and Moon error packs that somehow contain evolutions again. <laughs> Alright, good luck. Here we go. Gone. But Pokemon is an essential to life. Sometimes. Sometimes. You gotta make sure you have your grocery bills and stuff and you know your power on so you can enjoy watching screens of Pokemon guards. <laughs> and once you have those essentials covered. We got Butterfree V. Yep, everything we open on stream has been purchased by our viewers. We do have an online shop. If anybody is curious, command shop. That will get you the link. We are the USA store. We sell English cards in our shop. And we are including the bulk, so everything for Jessica. Later, I got orders to place. <laughs> Multitask! There you go. <laughs> you know that why I have all those Pikachus and uh, Sphinxes? Shinx? So they can power my house. <laughs> uh, if you get that to work, you let me know. Like, hook me up. <laughs> Alright, Noe, your turn for some gym challenges. Alright, taking on... <laughs> Chikorita, um, I just need to do a quick check because I have Bugsy, but I might not have... Yeah, so we had a close battle, 7-5 to five against Bugsy, so we are on Bugsy first. Alright. And we can tackle Whitney. Nothing you have to do on your end, we can easily change that on ours. Here's one, two, three... Four, five, six. All right, best of luck. Here we go. Be good to us, battle styles. Uncommon. Cricketune V Savoy. Savoy. We got three points for the V. Importance. Please don't starve. No points there. Crons. Uncommon. Uh, non hollow. Alright, okay. Come on. We got two packs left. Let's Come on, Battle Styles. Remoraid, common. Kingdra Hollow, two points. Good boy. Last one. Can we do it? Let's We've go. Battle got Styles. Horsey, common. A Hollow Meow Stick. Savoy. Savoy. Bugsy. 
Woo. Defeated. Exactly what we needed to. That was close. Coming away with Cricketune V. Paper's nutritious. No, it's not. It tastes funny. Um, no bulk, okay. Well, if it tastes funny, you should probably stop eating joke books. What? If the paper tastes funny. Oh, boo. Terrible jokes. Uh, Terrible uh, jokes. All right, victory over Bugsy. Congrats. Nope, nope, nope. Knocking stuff over off camera. All good. All good. <laughs> All right. Uh, prize card for Bugsy's Gym. Looks like. Oh, full art butterfree. Segoy. Segoy. Said it was nutritious, not tasty. Fair, fair. Lots of fiber. <laughs> All right. Full art butterfree for Bugsy's defeat. Definitely not my A game for jokes today. <laughs> Welcome, Zephyr. <laughs> I am the bad joke generator. Uh, let's see. King, the Gardevoir and the Leonard, do you get off TCG player? Probably. That's kind of my source for most of our singles. I do check them for quality and such before we give them away, so... Should be fine in that department. All right. Oh, wait, we got another gym challenge. What am I doing? No, he's still up. <laughs> All right, well, let's reset and move on to Whitney. Taking Whitney on with battle styles as well. All right, here we go. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. Am I secretly a Pokemon because you are using knockoff? Oh, because I'm knocking things over. <laughs> uh, you know, I'm just inspired by Pokemon so much that I just make a mess. <laughs> Good luck, Noe. Here we go. Tapu Bulu, reverse rare. Point points. Non hollow pack shards on my ear. The links reverse rare one point. Segoy. All right, uncommon. We got Houndoom Hollow, two points. Alright, keep it up, Battle Styles. Let's do this. Luxio, uncommon. Oh, we got a V, single strike. Segoy. Three points. Whitney and her mill tank, no match. Segoy. Two-pack victory lap. Nice. All right, Minky, common, not hollow, and one more. Hey, feel free to like throw in a rainbow or something, battle style. Ooh, yes. <laughs> Make it a rainbow we'll day. Just some icing on the cake here. Um, uncommon and non hollow. Also, Stacy, Stacy Small. Thank you so much for the raid. Welcome, Raiders! Welcome, guys. Hopefully your stream was fantastic. What you been up to? Alright, we've got that single striker, Shifu, and all of our hollows. Congratulations, though. Seven points, what we need. I'm an elven mage. You know, I'll take that. I am not mad about being an elven mage. 
All right, no we prize card from Whitney. We've got Galarian Linoon, Baby Shiny. Sega Oh, nice. You think I'd be a good elven mage there, Spectrum? All right, all right. Points for Spectrum. <laughs> mm, mm, mm. What is Ghost, then? Hmm. That's a tough one. I don't know. I tend to change up what class I play a lot in all the different RPGs. All right. So, well, we have another gym challenge to do right up next. Couple rounds for Sebastian. Oh, sorry, just one round for Sebastian. Taking on Morty, since we're already on the screen, might as well. Alright. Uh, Totodile, taking on Morty. Totodile. What are we <laughs> battling with? You're a summoner or maybe a necromancer? Okay, I can see that, I can see that. You just have a, lot, a bunch of ghost wolves that you summon as familiars. Yes, there you go. Studied a lot of your streams and videos to learn how to open Pokemon cards. Oh uh, man, it, it is definitely an art, you know? A uh, very unappreciated Colin has the skills. Art. <laughs> but hey, glad you've been watching this stream. That's, uh, I'll take that as a compliment. Thank you. Mm. All right, we've got Mouse Styles. Here it is one, two, three. Four, five, six. <laughs> I didn't Good even luck. realize what the catch game Pokemon was until you mentioned. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck, Sebastian. Here you go. Come in. Ooh, all wow. tired. So Dang, single strike, V Max. Sebastian! Beautiful! So the alt art VMAXs, they fall under the secret rare category, so five points. Oh, we haven't seen this card in ages. I was gonna say, we pulled way more of this rapid strike. Oh, yes. So good. Battle styles, it's about time. It's about time. You've been a little uh, standoffish lately, so. Alt arts, fantastic. Let's keep going, shall we? <laughs> Uncommon, non hollow. <laughs> One pack magic, there you go. You're not quite to the victory yet, but hopefully soon. Me and Chow, reverse rare. One point. So go on. Eh, okay. I, I take it back. Two points. Houndoom Hollow. Sigo. <laughs> Victory. <laughs> oh, I spoke too soon, but hey, in a good way. Mm -hmm. Well, you know, just three packs left, that's all. <laughs> Licky Licky Reverse. Uh, rare, one point. Sigo. Oh, this is a good round. This is a good round. Uncommon. We got Mimikyu V. Sega. Three more. Oh man, can you imagine how awesome, awesome like a Mimikyu alt art would be? Common and non hollow. All right, well, you know, just a few points there. 12. <laughs> Sebastian, congratulations. Altart. Altart and the Mimi QB. And we're going with Audible. Of 
course, prize card from Morty. Which is Galarian Cursula. Segoy. Segoy. Ghostly Coral. Her ghostly coral with what looks like a sleeping mask on. Uh, great, you posted it in the Discord? <laughs> Alright, I'll have to take a look after stream. Okay, uh, we still have a mystery bundle for you to do now. A nice blurple box. Are you starting up again with me, Spectrum? <laughs> you wanna go? <laughs> Here it is. Oh, one of my boxes. My boxes are in the way. Bugsy and Whitney. All right, drawer number 22. Vivid Voltage, Battle Styles, Sun and Moon, and Fates Collide. Oh no, now everybody's on the blurple box train. <laughs> yeah. uh, oh boy. Good luck, Sebastian. Here we go. You'll be in the off topic channel. Sounds good. Is Whitney's box salmon or pink? Definitely more pink. Aegislash okay, Slash Hollow. <laughs> I'm gonna leave it alone until the Pope brought it up. Troublemakers, all of you. Ooh, Solo Galeo Full Art! Sigo! Popular today, I nice! Was gonna say. Solo Galeo! Very good, very good. Stubble and Grumpick. <laughs> Poke whistles innocently. Yeah. Mmm, yeah. super innocent there. I'm on to you. Do the... Doesn't really work with the camera, but... Water Tribe. <laughs> yeah. All right, Sebastian getting that full art soul glow. Andy Hollows reverses. Of course. And uh, include bulk. All right, so all this for you as well. You're not a troublemaker group. But. Uh, I'm gonna be giving Colin a break. Not that it had anything to do with this segue, so I don't know why I said but, but. <laughs> oh, that's true. We had our Battle Styles wish list break. Uh, that one is full. Thanks to a certain someone, Zephyr. which we appreciate. Troublemaker in his own right. <laughs> Alright, so, enjoy your dinner break, and I will open some packs. Oh no, the horror. I have to go eat food. Ugh. <laughs> All right, let's get some things set up here. Do do do. Uh, where is the break sheet? Do 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 do. There we are. Oop, let me uh, slide this over a little bit. All right, we've got our wish list break. Oh no, I'm here. <laughs> you told me to do the thing, Zephyr. You knew I was here. <laughs> All right, well, I'm gonna get the 36 packs counted out first, and then we will get going. One, two, three, four. 
4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, three, six, nine, twelve, yep. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Your boy Gravy, um, just one quick uh, check back on the up next list. Um, you, so we're doing the wish list break because we had some spots picked up at the top. Um, and so if your order is still on the up next list, we haven't gotten to you just yet. If your order is not on the queue, then we did it and you can check the timestamps. Okay, I have no idea how to answer that one, Groot. <laughs> Best gift you ever bought yourself for your birthday, Xmas, etc. Hmm. I think that was that would probably be the six Nintendo 64 I bought myself on summer break to play the original Pokemon Snap. And then I proceeded to play like a hundred other uh, uh, N64 games. All right. Time to grant some wishes. Here we go. All right, we've got Zephyr with Fighting, Fire, Water, Grass, Electric. Uh, sorry, Fighting, Single Strike, Fighting, Rapid Strike, Steel, and Psychic. And then we've got Steven with Supporters and Dark. And then colorless and items will go to the low hitting spots. Also, I have a my mouse on the other computer. I need to move. It's gonna bug me. There we go. Okay, yeah, we haven't gotten you yet. Whenever we have a break spot, we go on the first order that has a purchase spot on that break is where in the order list it falls. So sometimes if we pass that first order and the break fills, we instantly do the break kind of a thing. Can check out the gym battle for my first one on Faulkner. It says sold out. Um, is it sold out of that particular pack type? Which pack type are you trying to uh, check out with? I can have Colin look at that as soon as she gets back. Game that you had an ending that you that left you confused, wanting answers. Uh, I don't know if there's a game that I had uh, an ending that I was confused on. There's always those games where you're like, oh, they're setting up for a sequel and they never get a sequel kind of a thing. Rebel Clash, um, Carco Hollow. Sorry, what's up? You wanted to check to see if we have any Rebel Clash in stock for the gym challenge? It said sold out. Oh, yeah, let me check. I don't think we had a huge stock pot. Actually, you know what? We may have opened all the Rebel Clash we had. I don't know. There might be one on the up next list that also has it to... Trying to remember how many I loaded this week. Verse per ugly meow stick. This was God. What would be one wish you'd grant you from either family, friends, or viewers? I don't know. I think we have one left. For the class. Is it in the up next list? So I was gonna say, I think we had three, and we've done two, and then that would be it for our Rebel Clash stock for until I find some more. Reverse Bruxious. Marowak. Hmm. That's weird that it says sold out. Uh, when Jordan was trying to check out with it. Did you ever go back to finish Dishonored 2? No, I never did finish Dishonored 2. 
Honestly, if a game is one that I've been playing for a series, I very rarely will ever play that game in my own time kind of a thing. So, it is... Progress is exactly where you saw me leave off. First, Carnivine and Luxray. Hmm. I was able to add Rebel Clash to my cards. I didn't check out the fix. So... Oh, if you were buying three, yeah, yeah. There's only the one left. So... But if you want us to open the rebel first, you know, just leave a note in the mess or in the uh, order, and uh, we will make sure we use your lucky packs for the first one. What game sequel didn't lead, lead up to the hype? Um, Tales of Symphonia. The second one on that was ooh, full art, rapid strike, mustard, so Oh, with the crybaby. Yeah, it just it just wasn't very good. Like the characters, like they just they weren't terribly interesting. All your lo beloved characters from the first game like came in, and you could use them for like three battles, and then they left. And it's like, no, I want my team. Like I used to have eight characters that I could select my team for, and you're not letting me do that. <laughs> Go into Steven. It was cool that there was, like, a taming system, but, like, they just, like, any monster you could tame was just not nearly as cool as the actual, like, character with story. I feel like they were just trying to, like, cash in on the, oh, hello, full art, Vic Tinny V for fire, Sugoy. Going to Zephyr. Skyrim didn't live up to Oblivion, Golden Sun 2 didn't live up to Golden Sun. Oh, the Golden Sun games were so fun. I forgot those existed. I really enjoyed the fact that on the Golden Sun 2 you could play as the villains for part of it. I really thought, like, I liked the story of Golden Sun 2. Like, I, I think I actually enjoyed Golden Sun 2 quite a bit. I think 1 might have been better, but... I, I did enjoy seeing the rest of the story, because I'm like, wait a second, you have these six elemental lighthouses that are getting lit, and you stop the game at 3? Like, no. <laughs> The Golden Sun games were one of the fun ones. I enjoyed, like, wandering back through early areas and finding the rest of the, oh, whatever they call the elemental djinn, so that way I could use the bigger summons. Yeah. Yeah, they were like the, the, the cute little uh, Celebes, almost. I loved all the combinations, because you can combine two of the same, one of the same, three of the same to get different things. It was super fun. Corviknight, VMAX, Sigoy. Going to Zephyr in the steel spot. I don't know if I ever finished that Tales game. I, I just... It was just a lot of grind. Like, the first one had, like, an amazing story, and the second one was just, like... Yeah, I'm gonna kind of go easy on the story for this one. Stay. Movie franchise that has done video games before that you would like to have a soft reboot and one that has never made games you would like to see. Um, I don't know if I enjoyed any video game movie game. I'm trying to think of one that I did enjoy. The one of the Legend of Korra's looked really, really good with the fighting system. But the game looked very unfinished, because there was, like, a lot of just, like, open zones. Like, it looked like a college project. Apparently the combat system was fantastic in it. It just didn't have a lot of, like, scenery detail. Oh, there's another Tales game coming out? I mean, I guess there always is another Tales game, but... Reverse. Colossal. Ooh! Alt art. Rap. Or single strike. Urshifu V. Sugoi. Ooh, more alt arts? Man, battle styles with the alt arts today. That's going to Zephyr in the single strike fighting spot. That sounds like 
Well, you wanted a rainbow or a gold day. No, you get an alt art day. Hey, I'll take an alt art day. It gets us ready for uh, chilling rain, where we should have alt art days on a regular basis, hopefully. Stoked. Old Lord of the Rings games weren't too bad. Thought Return of the King was pretty good. So the one Lord of the Rings game that I really, 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 really want to play as a uh, multiplayer series was that one with uh, the three characters. I think, actually did, I think, I don't know, maybe that was one we played for fun, but I think it was one like Crit and, was it Crit and Dawn? Who, who did I play? Anyway, that was, that was a, the three player one looked really good. Oh, chat just flew by, but first pull of the stream was something. It was an alt art. Oh, yeah, I remember that one. First pack of a, a gym challenge or something. Groot, you said you need to stop watching Apocalypse. Uh, post Apocalypse. I can't chat, but. You need to stop watching those movies so it stops ruining songs for you. Post Apocalypse. Well, is there post Like, did Mad Max ruin songs? Or what? Um, he was watching that. New Year's song. Ah. I like the post apocalyptic theme stuff. Depending. Yeah. First like ball the, toy. Like the soft versions of those. Like, I don't like totally realistic, like, horror. Everyone hates everyone at each other's throats. Like. You gotta give Kipo another try then. That one was a really good one. It's like, yeah, we're better to survive. Yeah. No, I think you'd really enjoy it. Since we're, like, watching, like, a thousand different things right now, you know? <laughs> mm -hmm. It just looks like a kid's show. It, it was a little mix. It, it's like Fallout Light. Like, it wasn't the horrors of the post-apocalypse, but it was solid. Yes, you did slap the bass. <laughs> It was one I binged. Like, I watched the entire thing in, like, three days earlier this year. It was super good. I never actually did a good track, so I should probably at least give it one episode. The characters were excellent in it, and it was very good world building. It was one of those ones where you knew they had the entire story and everything written out from the first episode, not one of those series where you're like, wait, were they just kind of like trying to fix their mistakes in the original writing? Ghost recommend right now as far as watching. Um, Tom and I have been watching... Well, we've, we watched one episode of Escape the Infinity, and that one's on the list of ones to watch, but we've been watching Jujutsu Kaisen? Uh -huh. Which is a pretty fun one, as well as the uh, My Hero Academia and uh, Spider. Yeah, Spider is so good. Um, as far as like live action stuff, Shadow and Bone is a f that one was fantastic. Like I was not expecting that. I can't wait for the next season. War of the North, that's the name of the game. I could not remember the name for anything. Versala Weeping Bell. It's just, like, surprisingly well-developed for one of the new animes. Like, it just has a lot of detail to it high quality like art and animation like they got a good studio to pick it up verse bronzor and set scorch can PM you the names of what we're watching sorry what, what were you after Zephyr? yeah so the jujitsu kaizen the spider all of those And, uh, Shadow and Bone. Like, I was not expecting Shadow... Like, I was expecting Shadow and Bone to be, like, desert pirates and stuff, and I'm like, I'm here for this. And it's like, this is not what the show I signed up for, but it was still awesome. Considering the entire show is, like, what is it, like a 12-episode long heist kind of thing on a side story? Like, it's amazing. 
take your best shot and <laughs> show, show called Sweet Tooth. Reason it ruined the song for me. There was this gated community singing the song as they purged the house of the sick. Oh, well then. Yeah, I can see how, you know, songs and things would have new associations, depending on what you uh, watch that uses them. I, I feel like that is a good spoiler-free, uh, you know, kind of general description. No, yeah, that's fair. Like, a lot of it, like, well, some animes, like, you know, definitely look more polished and stuff. Depends on, like, you know, how long the animators had to do it. But... Ooh, full art. Stoutland v. Sugoi. Alright, this is a colorless hit. So it's gonna go to one of the lower hitting spots. We'll randomize that at the end. But, uh... Like, you can always tell, like, which shows have, like, basically movie-level production quality on, like, their first episodes. And then you can also see the, the ones where they had, like, a low budget at the beginning, and then they picked up. Like, Ruby is a high, high example of that. Like, the first few episodes of Ruby were, like, not even full FPS on the animations. Like, everyone in the background was just a faceless, you know, silhouette kind of a thing. And then, you know, recent seasons of it, like, you can tell they've got the budget. And then there's also these anime, like, you know, some of the, uh, we gave it to a secondary studio in Naruto during some of the fight scenes, because the main studio was so overwhelmed getting the regular episodes out, then you're like, well, this is not exactly human proportions anymore. <laughs> Like, the art quality was vastly different. If anyone saw the pain fights in Naruto, you know what I'm talking about. I'm totally hijacking Ghost's account to send you messages, Zephyr. Ah. <laughs> He's logged in over here. I mean, that totally works. <laughs> I do not know. I never actually finished Naruto. <laughs> I stopped in the middle of the, like, 1,000 talky episodes in the middle of the war. It's like, come on, let's see some action instead of dialogue for 25 minutes for 15 episodes in a row. And I'm like, alright, I'm bored now. I'll come back to this when they finish it, and then I forgot to come back to it. I feel like if High School of the Dead was a little bit less fan servicey, it would have become a classic. It was just a little bit too much fan service. So I was like, there's never a good anime with zombies in it. But, uh, yeah, I wouldn't really, uh, I don't know. It's a hard one to recommend because you're like, that one really kind of went off on the fan service side of things. I just want to watch zombies. First Sly score. All right, come on, Battle Styles. Let's see a few more hits here. I mean, it was just a very different, like, the animation on other fights was a lot less stretchy warp. Like, they, they went overboard on the movement on that one, but it was a different studio. They didn't have the same team, so it's, of course it's going to be a different art style. I'm not saying it was bad, but it was definitely less budget than, you know, had the main team animated that one. I have seen Helsing. That one was pretty good. Oh, the creator died right after the first season. Okay, that explains it. Versus Gligar. It's like, I was like, I quite enjoyed the premise. You know, you're like high school kids surviving a zombie apocalypse. And, you know. 
then the hormones got a little bit out of control on the animator side of things, and I'm like, eh, it's not enough zombies. Like, that's what I really want to see. I want to see a zombie show where the entire v plot is you are surviving against the zombies. The zombies get cooler and crazier and stuff. It's not, okay, well, there's zombies around, but it's this psychopathic dictator who's running this town and killing everyone who opposes him is your villain. It's like, no, no, no. I want the zombies to be the threat. Like, oh, no, now we have new zombies that spit acid. That's our new thing we have to deal with and figure out a way to survive, you know. Oh, look, it's a tank zombie. Like, give me that show. So, Left 4 Dead, but... Yes, Left 4 Dead, the show. Yes, 100%. <laughs> Take me to weird, wacky locales, fight me through a shopping mall and a carnival, and, you know, random crazy places that you can think of, like... You know, give me zombies coming out of a cornfield and, you know fighting through the city streets and stuff. Like, give me that show. That's what I want to see. And that tearjerker episode where, the, where your dog takes the zombie hit for you. See, I can, I can see that, because then the zombie's the villain. It's not some random, you know, oh, we trusted this survivor group, and then they shot my dog. Like, I absolutely loved the first season of Walking Dead, because it was all about surviving in the city and stuff like that. And then after that, The Walking Dead was just like, oh, now the humans are the bad guys. I'm like, well, just take the zombies out then. Just make the humans the bad guys the whole time. That show was a hot mess. Perfect anime. Oh. That's so hard. There's so many good anime out there. I just like seeing anime. Here we go. Empoleon v. Sigoi. Going to the water spot. I just like seeing anime with just, you know, different premises and stuff. I have not seen Black Summer. Is that a live action or is that an anime? I will. I'm always up for a new uh, zombie show. Have you not played Last of Us? Have you not realized we are the monsters? But that's the plot of every zombie one. I want the zombies, the, the monsters, to be the monsters. <laughs> it's like, yes, you take us out of, you know, our normal world to show us how terrible people are. Well, it's like, oh, Empoleon V back to back. Penguins. I haven't yet to see Ancient Magus Bride, but I have heard excellent things about it from Loki. Good. I feel like there was probably more info in the manga. Mm. It's just like a lot to cover, so sometimes it feels a little rushed. But the premise is, is good. Admittedly, The Walking Dead is a really concise new way of saying zombies. Like, it, I can see why they use it as the title, even if they take a different route. Timber and Luxray. Alright, come on. Let's get one more alt art into this battle styles. Let's get something cool. Reverse Aegis Slash and Drampa. I feel like the Ruby game, like, that one, I played it when it was in, like, Super Beta, and I quite enjoyed it, and I just never played it again. Like, I feel like that game should not have released when it did, and they should have waited till it was a little bit more on the polished side, but I don't know how it was on full launch. I feel like they were just really excited about their IP, and like, oh my god, we're video game people who... We we used to play video games, and now we're making one. Let's put it out as quick as we can. And it just lacked a little bit of polish at the beginning. All right. So, 
hollows and reverses will go to the spots. It's the normal random type break after we do the randomization of the wish list. So, we have a Stoutland V to randomize to a hit list spot, so now we need to find which spots are the hit list spots. So, we've got Full Art, Rapid Strike, Mustard for supporters. So, I'm going to make a little star next to supporters. We've got Victini V Full Art for our fire spot. We've got Corviknight VMAX for steel. We've got Alt Art Rapid Strike Urshifu V for, or sorry, Single Strike Urshifu V for single strike. Was it single or rapid? Uh, single strike. You marked rapid. Boy, my brain is just not not fully fully there. <laughs> There we go. And then a pair of Empoleon Vs for our water spot. So now um, I'm going to hand things back to Colin, because you know how to do the uh, random.org. Oh, yeah. right. And then we'll just randomize the full art Stoutland to one of the remaining spots. And then any other spot that went hitless, we will also get you seal packs. Mm -hmm. Okay. For anything without an asterisk. Oh, look, they are conveniently all next to each other. Oh, nice. Copy. Alright, so we've got Grass, Electric, Dark, Rapid Strike, and Psychic vying for our Stoutland. Good luck. Uh, here we go. Randomizing three times. Here's one. Here's two. And then here is three. Going to our psychic spot. Who's got psychic? Zephyr. Alright. So that is a hit for psychic, which means fighting rapid strike, electric, and grass went hitless for Zephyr, and dark went hitless for Steven. So I'll be getting you some sealed packs for those. So that wraps up the Battle Styles wish list. So back to our up next list. Um, okay, back to some personals. Our other Hidden Fates wish list is still not quite full yet. So Noe up next with Shining Fates. Oh, I need to take down the uh, Battle Styles draft. Also, we have a Hidden Fates draft up currently. Or should. Uh, looks like we have at least two spots down in it. Nice. Give those two donate packs. Alright. Alright, Shining Fates time. It's been a minute since we've done some Shining Fates. Here's one, two, three, four, five, six packs for Noe. Best of luck. Let's pull some shinies. Let's see. Folk, have you ever gotten any packs with like a red tape line in the middle of it before? If so, did you know those packs are for when they get to the end of a printing sheet and is considered an error pack since those normally don't get released to the public? Interesting. Is there like, is the red line on the pack or the cards? I mean, I've had packs where I've probably had like a a different colored line up at the top, but I haven't had it like through the middle or anything. I haven't been fortunate enough to get one of those. That's cool. Didn't know those existed, but something to look out for. Yeah, 
Delmice V, Segoy. Segoy. Water type. Intellion, Delmise, and Morpeko. And this is no bulk, so our hollows, reverses, and hits. We've got Colby jumping in on a mystery bundle. Um, here we go. Colby's got drawer number 16. Looks like Rebel Clash, Roaring Skies, Steam Siege, and Breakpoint. Good luck. Here we go. Starting off with Milotic V. Segoy. Segoy. Or is it Milotic? I feel like... I've heard both ways. I think both are acceptable. I feel like I was playing Pokemon Snap and they said the name Milotic and I was like, really? Really? Much more of a, a fan of Milotic, but to each their own, I suppose. I, I feel like I want to pronounce it more like melodic, you yeah. know, like melody kind of a thing, mm -hmm. so not Milotic and separating out the <laughs> parts. Ashwa, Reverse, got Inferni, Apollo. Looks like he's about to do a serious belly flop. Or in the process of it. <laughs> Alright, well, getting the. I'm just gonna say Milotic. Milotic V plus our foil cards. No bulk. Feel oh, like... ye, you like the Milotic. It's so pretty. Mm hmm. I feel like with Pokemon names, as long as you are close enough that no one ever mistakes what Pokemon you're talking about, your pronunciation is good enough. Kind of thing. <laughs> okay, up next, Sebastian. We've got a stained glass blind box. Scaleheart, you are welcome. This time, let's find out. I remember trying to get Milotic in Pokemon Pearl. It was a pain in the butt. Oh yeah, because it's like to evolve it, you had to like do the contest thing, right? The Phoebus. Lugia! We got the Lugia stained glass. Sigoy. Very nice. Also, wasn't it like only available in like one small little pond or something? Yes. 
I graphed that whole area. <laughs> Yay, Lugia! It's a nice one. get its beauty up. Mm. Okay, so you didn't have to actually compete with it, you just had to raise the stack. It's been a while, but... Back in the day... Ah, oh, it goes to all the moat. <laughs> Alright, Van, with the gym challenge, up next. Let's see, who do we have for Van? Van, do 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 Cyndaquil taking on Bugsy? Uh, yeah. Um, battle styles. Let's do it. One, oh. two, three, four, five, six. Oh, yeah. I hated poffin making as a kid. Like, it was, like, designed to only be good if you had four other people kind of a thing. Good luck. Here we go, Van. I think the explanation tutorial was very good either. <laughs> Come in. Necrozma V. Sigoy. Sigoy. Three points for the V. Uncommon. Embor Hollow. Two points. Sigoy. sleep there. Common. Not hollow. Seems to be the trait with the Choho region gym leaders. <laughs> okay, Bugsy looks like he's got too much caffeine, but still hasn't slept. Ah, <laughs> Morty, well, he's just like, he's chill. Uncommon. Not hollow. Alright, come on, we got one more. Bugsy's like, my house is filled with bugs and I love it. <laughs> oh gosh. Here we go, Battle Styles. What you got? Claydol, Reverse Rare, one point. Sigoy. Oh, Kingdra Hollow, two points. Sigoy. Woo. Last pack. All right. through with the victory. Necrozma V and enough hollows for the victory. Woo, I'm gonna sweat here, Battle Styles, jeez. And no bulk. All right, Bugsy Box. Prize card will be. Looks like Pheromosa, Baby Shiny. Let us dance. Gym battles get me so anxious. Such a fun thing. I love it. <laughs> they definitely do have that effect. You're like, oh, will it be? Will it? Won't it? I don't know. sleeves again yet. There we go. All right, there we go. Congrats. Shuya, what's up? Judging by the megaphone, I'm assuming something Espeon related. <laughs> Alright, Sky. Going in on collection two. Once again. No dupes this time. No dupes. <laughs> oh my gosh, 
that was the best comeback uh, in elementary school. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Good luck. Come on, new one. Oh, oh, this looks promising. I can't tell though. Oh no. No, no, we Oh, Psyduck and Polywag! Oh, Sky! We're having some rough luck. Psyduck and Polywag with the little pond and the grassy plain. <sighs> yeah. Oh, I did. I was right. It was Espeon related. <laughs> They're super cute, but like, dupes, man, dupes. Your SBI box showed up today. Oh, have you opened it yet? It's exciting. All right, Tavita up next with a gym challenge. Oh, first time gym challenge, excuse me. Oh, <laughs> uh, best of luck. We got Totodile and Steam Siege. Keep well, on being a little bit elusive today, for sure. Oh, ghosts. It's a warm day. He's probably like hiding in the sand. Stay cool. Probably gonna need more of this. I can certainly do that. I'm, I'm good for right now, but. Yep. One, two. I was just being lazy. I knew I'd have to shuffle Five, eventually. <laughs> It's true, yeah. I'm torn between ripping it apart and never touching it. Oh, I was one. wondering what your take on that one was. All right, best of luck. Here we go. Looking for that six point. Here we go, Steam Siege. Hey, Runny Boy, welcome. Uncommon. Not hollow. Uncommon. Not hollow. It also came with nuts. Why did it come with nuts? Was it sent via ginkgo? Oh. <laughs> or is that just something Pokemon Center Japan does nowadays? Mm, no points there. Come on, Steam Siege. You got this. Uncommon. We got Cling Cling Hollow. Two points. Segoy. Uh, reverse rare. Probably pass. One point. Segoy. Oof. Non hollow Pyroar. Down to this. Here we go. Come on, Steam Siege. Steam Siege, let's go! Skip Bloom, uncommon! No! Non hollow! Ah! Oh man! Just not quite the hollows we needed. Rough. Alright, uh, no bulk, so just my foil cards. We do have a mystery bundle as well for you up next. Hopefully all the hits are hiding in your mystery bundle. Mm. Um, here we go. Too far, too far. Boxy box. Straight. Uh, yeah, a little bit. <laughs> Here we go, drawer number five. Yamper drawer. We've got Vivid Voltage, Breakthrough, Rebel Clash, and Roaring Skies. Here we 
we go. Ooh, that was close. <laughs> All right. Yeah, now my foot just caught on the light cord. Luckily, it was very, very long, so it didn't actually oh. trip me or anything. Fun. Not a gym challenge. Mystery bundle. Marowak breaks the goalie. Sigoy. And Glalie EX. Nice. out of four packs, I'd say the mystery bundle was hiding some hits. Um, two packs, because it was two for one. Oh, okay. But still, pretty good, pretty good. Glalie EX, Milotic V, and the Marowak break. Sego! Going with no bulk. Alright, uh, Van, your turn next. Mystery bundle and gym challenge. Do the uh, mystery bundle first. Oh, please hold. Move to the camera. There we go. Draw number nine. Also, welcome, welcome, Matthew. I think we're doing pretty good today. Hello to one half of my favorite streamer channel. Aww, that's super nice. Welcome. Yeah, we're good. We're just kind of sitting here, twiddling on our thumbs, waiting for chillin' rain to come out. Mm. Sun and Moon, Primal Clash, Burning Shadows, and Steam Siege. So we're good, but impatient. <laughs> you want some all our birds? It's gonna be a fun set. Mm -hmm. Good luck, fan. Like a million full art supporters and rainbows and golds. <laughs> all the things. Drowsy. Gumshoes full art. Sego. I honestly thought it was going to be another Sogaleo. We have been very Sogaleo -y today. So. Yep. But we got Gumshoes. Cash Benji, welcome. Stay. Only nine days left. Oh, I feel like it gets longer the closer we get. <laughs> Most definitely. Got the last mystery packs. Ooh. Last the best, maybe? Hopefully, some good luck in there. Hopefully, some good luck with that Hidden Fates pack giveaway as well. That's true. Do I? Oh, Pokemon Ranger Full Art! Sagoy! Sagoy! Bundles took a little while to warm up today, but man, they are pulling well. Got that older look, full art supporter. Very nice. I never realized that, yeah, the old full, full art supporter had more of a top border. Oh. Two full arts. Not bad. Uh, no bulk. Sounds good. Uh, Cash Benji, what's your name? Uh, my name is Colin, and this is Ghost. Hey. Welcome, welcome. All right, gym challenge time. Uh, sorry, what was Van's start? Uh, Cindy Will. Taking on Whitney. Mm. 
All right, going in with battle styles this time. One, two, three, four, five, six. Shuya, Shuya, don't start. <laughs> 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 Come on to you. Here we go. Good luck. Common Mawile. Hollow Sandaconda. Two points. Sick boy. Nice to meet you as well. Before the chat game rolls through. <laughs> well, are you new to the channel? It's the chat game. Catching Pokemon with the Pokeballs you can... Uh, Earn points for while watching. Uh, get your hollow. treasures in the beer good way. Also, it's a good way. Two points. Thanks your giveaway for that cute shuffle you see in the background. Reverse rare, Jellison. One point. It's a good And Cricketune for the win. It's a good Three points. Three packs up. Gym leader down. Yep, Ashley and Kinko open Japanese cards and they open on the weekends typically. No points from that one. And we are usually live Tuesdays and Thursdays with English. Reverse rare, Conkleder, one point. Sugoi. Oh, full art supporter. Sugoi. Single strike mustard for four points. Gotta say, I'm excited to get some good supporters in Chilling Rain. I mean, Mustard. Hey, not my fave. Not my fave. Hey. I mean, Cheryl and Karina, both guys are nice. But it'll be nice to get some new faces and a new set. I think a lot of it's because Mustard has two cards, so... Common. We see him a lot more often. Not Apollo. True. All right, total of 13 points. Getting that full art supporter, Mustard, and Cricketune V. Segoy. Uh, no bulk for Van. All right, well, prize card time. Hey, we got that Pokemon breeder with the super happy mill tank in the corner. Segoy. It's just so excited. I'm on a card. It's a full art too, <laughs> finally. What do you mean I don't get my own card though? <laughs> there we go. was your first ever full art. All right, guys, we got a, mm, two more gym challenges to do. First one for Smokey and second one for Vincent. So we're just going to hang out on this screen for a bit. All right. Uh, next up, Smokey. Smokey has... Doo -doo -doo -doo. Toe dial taking on Morty. And we are challenging with Breakthrough. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, Smokey, best of luck. Here we go. Haven't had a Breakthrough challenge in quite some time. Hopefully it goes well. Common, Gengar Hollow, two points. Segoy. Anything you could do, I could do better. <laughs> Throws Gengar at your face. Such a good Gengar card. Uncommon. Non hollow Halucha. 
just has so much style and personality in that Gengar. Come in. Raikou Hollow. Two points. There go. Alright. Making good progress. Gengar Reverse. One point. Sego. It's not Hollow Halucha. It's, it's, it's ruining my vibe. Ralts has like the vibe of it's always that kid that's starring in a horror movie that's like, Mommy, I see monsters. <laughs> She's like, Go back to bed. Cue horror movie. Chestnut breaks. Segoy. Segoy. One point. Oh, Mewtwo EX for three points. Segoy, Segoy. There we go. one pack. Are we looking forward to whenever the Gengar VMAX and Inteleon VMAX alts appear in English? Oh, definitely. I have a feeling those ones will be a special collection box, but I'm hoping they're in the set, because that'd be kind of fun to pull those on a regular basis. You're welcome, King. I just have to uh, share my thoughts, however random, <laughs> uncommon, and non hollow. I must suffer with my thoughts, now you must suffer too. <laughs> Alright, we've got nine points, congrats! Get the Mewtwo EX and Chestnut Break for our hits. We did it! Segoy! Let's see, Matthew, don't own any gold cards yet. I'm watching another streamer doing her own. <coughs> Excuse me! <coughs> Personal opening. <coughs> did a giveaway for a pack for a few people on marbles. I came dead last and won a pack. In my pack was Galarian Preserker Gold! Hey, nice. Getting lucky! Alright, here we go. Smokey prize card. You've got the Full Art Delmise! Delmise Sir, want to confuse its type for like three other things than what it actually is. It, it is a tough one to place, <laughs> like... Is it steel? No. Is it water? No. Is it... I don't know. Normal? No. Mm. <laughs> Alright, up next, Vincent! Taking on Bugsy, I believe. Yep, with Totodile. Go. What are we using? Battle styles. One, two, three, four, five, six. Just have to wait a fair bit for it to come to USA. Uh, wait. Coming from, from US USA. To okay. Gotta love shipping, you know? International shipping, especially. Good luck, Vincent. Here we go. Uncommon. Non hollow. My boy Gravy had to battle the gym one more time. Alright, best of luck. Um, common. Hey, T Tar! Tyranitar V, Segoy! Segoy! Three points. Let's see. Hey, Colin, I think Waylord is like the whale from Pinocchio. <laughs> is it eating people? Or puppets? Beetle Hollow, two points. Oh, guess what? Some people showed me today on the Pokemon Center. They have a Waylord floaty. Oh yeah, I saw this this morning. <laughs> I meant to tell you. I forgot. It's about so that. cute. 
I can have my own Wailord floaty. Like a tongue common. Not hollow. Waited a month to get stuff in the US, but PSA 10 Charizard V Max from Darkness was worth the wait for $20. Nice. Congrats. Come in. Oof, not hollow. Alright, here we go. Last pack. Come on, Metatiles. Make it a good one. Full art, rapid strike, alt art. <laughs> Uncommon. Mm. Not hollow victory bell. I was too bad at guessing today. <laughs> Ah, oh, well, darn. We've got Titar V and our hollows, and let's see, including the bulk, so everything for ya. <laughs> I don't have access to a pool or anything. If I did have, like, my own pool, I would definitely buy it, but I do not have a pool to use it in. All right, well, uh, let's do some mystery bundles for you, Vincent. I was gonna say, they have the other ones and stuff too, like the Lapras ones, they got like the Pokeball Beach Balls, like there was a lot of good summer themed stuff today. Do I have a bath? Uh, not big enough for the both of us. <laughs> <laughs> Wailord and say, I. That's like what a five foot float or something. <laughs> I don't know. I didn't look at the dimensions. Um, okay, we've got drawer three and twelve. I will give them credit though. It looked like a very, very sturdy float. Like it was not a cheap to make one. Why doesn't Pokemon Bari Bari Japan say Sugoi? <laughs> you would think that being over there, they would. They say cool card. <laughs> no, they're mocking sense. us. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's because we started out as a Segoi stream and carried it over from that. Vivid, Guardians, Sun and Moon, and Unified Minds. Uh, your boy Gravy, could you do my gym challenge first when it's my turn before the mystery box? Um, yeah, let me just look ahead. Vivid, Battle Styles, Champions, and Breakthrough. It's eleven seven ninety and eleven seven eighty eight. Oh, okay, yeah. If you're back wanna, to back, so. If you want to just put a note on there oh, yeah. for me, because I will probably forget. All right, let's uh, see what we got. We got some good packs in here. Go. Let's see, my first CGC set shipped. 31 of 50, got nine and a half, slow screed was an eight. Solid, solid. That sounds like a success. I'm surprised, I'm, that's kind of cool that they give you the stats and stuff before shipping them. I always just assumed that whenever you got great cards graded, they'd be like, it's a surprise in the box. <laughs> she got inflatable Wailord couch? I mean, if they had an inflatable Wailord couch, I might be tempted. It's just a floaty, though. Yeah, exactly. Like, the mega cards use the opposite wording. The Japanese megas have the tack <laughs> in English, and in Japanese, they're, uh, or in, in English, they're Japanese. Nice. We can give you pictures of them. Oh, oh wow. Drapion full art, Sugoi. All right, Vivid being nice to us. He'll use it as a couch, but he doesn't have like a backrest. He's more like a bed. <laughs> well, or the air mattress. I almost been so windy, I'd say, like, you know, sit out on the balcony and just, like, lay back on it, but, like, you'd get blown away as windy as it's been lately. <laughs> Ooh, two spots left in that Hidden Fate wish list break. Ooh, can we fill it? All 
Alright, last one. Unified Minds. Looks like we got two spots down in the draft. Paxer is hollow. Segoy. Hey, Roland. Just opened a hidden fancy TV. Nice. Pincer Wiggly, Gyarados. Um, Baby Rowlet, Magnezone, Typhnol. Lots oh, of hits. Of hits I was yeah, say. nice. All right, we're including all the bulk. And full our Drapion. Oof, the leak. That doesn't sound good. Also, my girlfriend won't let me get the four foot slow poke. <laughs> That thing is massive! Is that another one of those floaties or is it it's a It's a, a life-size plush. Oh, jeez. She doesn't want to be the meme. Alright. Um, Jordan, your turn next. <laughs> oh, that's... Man. I, I, I feel like that would not go well, man. Oh. Alright, what are we doing for Jordan? We have uh, first time gym challenge. All right, Cyndaquil. Take it on Faulkner. All right, so I'm assuming the first one we wanted was Rebel, and then we'll go into battle styles after that. Yes, yes, because yeah. Rebel was the lucky packs, yes. I'm glad you remembered. Here's one, two, three, four, five, six packs of Rebel Clash. Best of luck to Jordan. Here we go. Uncommon. Oh, full art toxicity. Okay. Segoy. <laughs> Segoy, four points. Lucky packs for sure. New Zelda. What new Zelda? Have I missed a new Zelda? Or is this the Skyward Sword remake? I think I saw something on that. Common, not hollow. You know what you have to do, Shuya? You find out her favorite Pokemon. Get a four-foot plush of that one and the Slowpoke in the same order. Uncommon, not hollow. Be like, well, your your Pokemon needed a friend. A life-size friend. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like it would still go poorly, but it might go slightly better. Don't buy the plush. Buy the uh, mascot suit. The Slowpoke, Slowpoke <laughs> mascot suit. Common. Flapple hollow, two points. There go. Like the one that's like an honorary mayor of Japan. Or something. Was that a slow I don't know if it was the mayor. Maybe it was a mascot or something. I can't remember. It should Some be like city. a town mascot. But Some like... city adopted Slowpoke as something or other. Uncommon. Not hollow. Alright. Any, any more secrets for us, Rebel? common and not hollow all right well we got exactly what we needed plus a full art toxicity congrats did breath of the wild 2 come out I, I finished breath of the wild 1 at like 135 part series like on my channel i would know if, if part 2 came out i don't know i mean it's the latest one yes But no, that one was a super good game. Enjoyed the crap out of that one. It is the mayor. Okay. Alright, here we go. Prize card. Looks like Mega Pidgeot. Sigoy. Sigoy. Oh, are we still having timestamp troubles? Uh, nothing was working. Let's see. 
weird music happening. All right, congrats, Jordan. The numbers on the link look right. And you click it, and it goes. It might be some weird thing with Twitch is if you have the stream live in one channel. Why is it at 0.75x speed? Weird. Um, mine went to your 777 order just fine when I tested it. All right, Jordan. Uh, another battle for you. Take it on Bugsy with battle styles. Maybe give it another try. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six. Best of luck, Jordan. Here we go, once again. But yeah, definitely weird that timestamps are acting up today. I'll have to see if I can figure out what's going on. Uh, no points there. But you're not the only one having issues with that, so... Uncommon, not hollow. But yeah, the uh, timestamp links look correct technically for my end, so I don't know. Mm, uncommon. Ooh, B Max. Segoy. Single strike. Segoy. Uh, four points. What? Uh, Noe, by the way. Um, you're only allowed to beat a gym leader once, and then you have to move on to the next one. Um, and if you beat everybody that we have available, um, unfortunately they're not re-challengeable because we don't have enough prizes. I'm not sure how far along you are in your gym challenge journey, but... Um, they've defeated Whitney, so Morty would be your next one. Kingdra Hollow, two points! Certainly. Alright, well, we just have three chances to beat Morty. <laughs> Yeah, and if you ever choose the wrong gym leader, like, we'll just keep you on the normal progression track and stuff like that, so not Here a... we go. Reverse issue. rare, one point. Segoy. And single strike. Segoy. Segoy, segoy. All right, three points. Yeah, so you need to be Morty anyway, so if you defeat Morty before using all three challenges, we'll refund to the ones you need. And then you can challenge... Chuck next week. Yep, there will definitely be more leaders though. Um, uncommon, not hollow. He wanted right. to call him Bruce, and I don't know why. He's uh, elite four. Ah, okay. So he's. No, that's Bruno. My bad. Yeah. All right, but we got a victory for Jordan. Segoy. Segoy. V and V Max matchy. All right, Jordan, no bulk. All right, prize card time. Oh, we got rainbow, Volcarona. Segoy. Uh, shoot. <laughs> I love how it's usually like Rick that starts off the joke, but this time we have Morty. <laughs> I feel like uh, Rick is a more common name than Morty. True, true. All right, my friends, but Jordan is not done yet. We have one more challenge. Taking on Whitney. Ah, again with Bow Styles. One, two, three, four, five, six. Use all, I'll use that money to challenge the next leaders coming up if I ever beat Morty. I have a feeling you will. You got this. All right, once again, good luck, Jordan. Artillery reverse rare. One point. Segoy. 
And Mimi QV. Segoy. Segoy. Three points. Has it ever been revealed what a Mimi Q actually looks like? Nope. Common non hollow. Mian Chow reverse, one point. Segoy. Non hollow rare. I think it's one of those things where if you uh, see its real form, you die or something. <laughs> I feel like that's like the Pokemon lore behind it. Or you're cursed or something. No points from that one. Alright, come on, Battle Styles. We're so close. We got common, non hollow. Down to one. Here we go, come on. Big hit, big hit. Okay, full art hit! Sagoy! Sagoy! <laughs> was going too fast. But hey, it worked. Four points. Vic Teeny B, full art! If you try to see it, it ceases to exist. Oh, that's a new one. <laughs> Congratulations, nine points! Three for three, nice. And one more prize card. Let's take a look. We've got the shiny Indeedy full art. So good. So good. Just ate dinner. Why does Indeedee's hair look like croissants? I don't know, but now I'm hungry too. <laughs> but I might have been hungry before you mentioned that, but... I mean, they are purple croissants, so a little less appetizing, but... Still. Well, that was a very successful round of gym challenges. <laughs> JK, we got more to do. This one's for Stanley, though. So, let's see. Um, I believe we're taking on Morty for Stanley. Um, two. Started out strong last time, but then Giovanni. <laughs> Cyndaquil and Morty. Yep. Geofunny was a bit of a bully. Hopefully, hopefully we can do, be do better with Claire this season. Guardians Rising. Oh, I know I moved you. Where did I put you? One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, good luck to Stanley. Here we go. Sure, you take with my initials. I bet you have fun with that one. <laughs> you know, it explains so much. Ooh, ouch. <laughs> Uncommon, not hollow. Took me seven attempts. Ooh, Giovanni, man. Glad we can put that that guy behind us. Common. Wheelord. Wheel. Steven just opening Cosmic Clips packs on the PC PPCTO and pulled a gold heart card and Pikachu character in the same pack. I think the character rares are in the reverse spot. Yeah, so. I think so. Reverse rare, one point. So good. Shark. Yeah, I think that it's that's an insane luck regardless, yeah. but yeah. So 
Cloak come in. Chandelure Hollow, two points. Signaling. Alright, Guardians. Here we go. Let's let's pick it up a little bit. Beware uncommon. Mimikyu hollow, two points. Oh, that's a cool hollow. Very spook. Wait, the gold was in the reverse spot? I mean... Here we go, Maybe? last one. I don't know if they change up the order of the cards in the online packs. But awesome. Reverse rare or a choreo. One point. Segoy. Ooh. No, non hollow. Should have been a hollow. We could have had it. Darn. Well, hollows and reverses for this round. And we are going no bulk. Go back to sleep, Morty. All right. We do have two more mystery bundles for you. So let's get those going. Drawer number 8 and 21. Wait. Huh? Who? No, 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 you're good. Never mind. Panic. I'm sorry. <laughs> I was getting ahead of myself by two orders, so oh. no worries. <laughs> Steam Siege, Guardians Rising, Sword and Shield, and Rebel Flash. Siege, Primal Clash, Guardians Rising, and Sword and Shield. Welsh Drew, thanks for the host! Segoy! Alright, so let's get these open. Good luck! Four spots. Four spots? Four spots down. Did they track? I thought we only had two left. Uh, no, four left in the draft, two left in the wish. Oh, list. gotcha. I'm confused. King draw hollow. Poke, thank you for the host. Uh, where's Ashley? So she's not streaming today. Uh, she usually streams on the weekends, but I am her cousin. And we stream usually Tuesdays and Thursdays, doing English cards. Fingar Hollow. Stream. Uh, I don't know about that. It's a little hat now, apparently. Gardevoir EX out of these bundles going no bulk. Excuse me. Alright, so we're still looking to fill those breaks. Hidden Fates wishlist and the Hidden Fates draft, right? 
Mm -hmm. Yep. Okay, so here's everything we're trying to pull. fill. Anything in blue is a break that is not quite full yet. Oop. There we go. Oh, there we go. Wish list is full. Alright, well, I'm gonna grab Resh's mystery bundle. Yeah, and I'll get the sheet set up for the wish list. Then we will get going on that break. <laughs> Jordan, what a champ. Okay, draw number two. King, thank you for the host as well. Well, the Hidden Fates prize is still up there. It just fell over. Sun and Moon, Vivid Voltage, Battle Styles, and Breakpoint. Good luck, Rash. Here we go. Then we got a spoiler. Bouplant. Necrozma full art. Sugoi. Sugoi. Uh, Christine the Phoenix. How much is a mystery bundle usually? Ah, oh, brain. I want to say twenty four seventy five. Does that sound accurate? Something in that ballpark, plus or minus a dollar. I think is pretty much where it has. Yeah. Very nice. Pulling full art. Here we go, break point. Esper. Great behind. Well, no secret Gyarados, sadly. But we do have a full art. I hope that helps. And no bulk. Um, all day beast, have we ever pulled a god pack? I don't think they make god packs for English, but Ashley and Ginkgo on the Japan side, they have pulled many god packs. I was going to say dozens and dozens of them. Someday English will do them. Someday. Alright, we good to go for the wish list break? Should be all good to go. Awesome. Uh, that was for Resh. Oh, yeah, okay. sorry. Alright, let's do the Hidden Fates wish list. Go. Ooh, lots of competition for fire. A little bit for dark as well. We haven't opened up any hidden fates today, have we? Um, yeah, no. Party time! Let's do it. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Yeah, we have pulled the English equivalent of God Packs, where we get all those reverse hollows, but they're they're not, not quite the same. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. There we go. Thirty-six packs. Of Alright, we've got our packs counted out, so let's uh, get some types going. Good luck, everyone. There we have it. Looks like Jordan taking that coveted fire spot. Uh, Matthew oh. and supporter. What? I'm sorry. I didn't fix the spots. Oh, we gotta do it again. Ugh. I was like, why does it say dark only? It should be dark fairy. I didn't set up. Oh, I'm so sorry. All right, I'm going to delete this from now on so it'll just like, I don't know if it has an error or something if there's no spot set up. I'm so sorry. 
<laughs> Sorry guys, a uh, little bit of a technical difficulty on our end. Bye bad. Okay, um So can I just like control Z that? There we go. Oh okay, um give me one second, because I know how you just control Z my paste. Okay. Um you have is did it control Z everything? I mean, I'm back, back to normal. Okay. All right. I have corrected the spot, so it'll now read the right ones. I'm so sorry. I usually double check that. All right. Here we go again. Good luck, guys. Jordan, you got fire again. Oh. <laughs> Yay for two spots. All right, Matthew, supporters items. Victor with Electric Dragon, Michael Water, Steven Steele, Victor Psychic, Stanley, uh, Dark and Fairy, Steven, Colorless, Jordan with Fighting and Fire, and then Michael again with Grass. Whoop. All right, types are assigned. Here we go. Sorry for uh, increasing the anxiety on that one. That was my bad. Do you need turtle noodle things, do you? Do you need chuckle? I'm assuming. Chuckle's pretty cute. Now pull three zarts. Uh, I mean, you know, <laughs> it's a party trick I can't pull off every party. Um, Wiggly Tough and Reverse Water Energy. All right, Hidden Fates, here we go. Let's see those hits. We have good things to find. That's what I'm going to start doing, because then I'll be like, ah, they're blank. I need to put in the spots correctly so it works. I mean, I guess if we try to do it blank, that's a lot better than if we try to do it wrong. Well, I mean, it would still come out the same, because it would be oh. like, no names detected, and then it wouldn't know what to give anybody. Or it might break entirely. And then, just and then the world will explode. It's all good. Gen 2, so of course you need it. Gen 2 is so good. Alright, hidden fates. I'm ready. Whooper! Baby shiny! Sigoi! Sigoi! Happiest little pink whooper! Shuckle luck for these packs. You're right. We definitely need some shuckle luck. Next pack. Mm. <laughs> I don't know how to grant shuckle luck. Boop. Boop. <laughs> there we go. Shuckle attack. <laughs> whoop whoop for the whooper. Chuckle's head. Good share now, buddy. <laughs> that goes hollow. We need some Eevee luck as well. There's lots of Eevees in here.
。タイプのベイビーシャイニー。すごい。すごい。Welcome to Ride. Stop it. Alright, hidden face. Don't make me pull out Will or. Because I will. Our GX. Segoy. Segoy. Are heavy, right? Spectrum didn't realize how pricey Sabrina. Oh, there we go. Full art Zygarde. So Sorry. Oh, shoot, yeah, I missed yours as well. Uh, I saw a red shell and I wanted to paint it blue. Shiny shekel? <laughs> didn't realize how pricey Sabrina was in English. Yeah, she's a. Uh... One of those nice and pricey supporters. Magnemite, Sagoy, baby shiny. Sagoy. Baby shiny. So boy. So boy. Hit for grass. Curlia, so boy. I feel like we pull a lot of Ralphs, but not as much Curlia. So、boy, for fairy. Steel energy, we got Eevee Hollow. Out the big guns. It's gotta help, right? <laughs> Onyx GX, so boy. Boops. 
for the win, we got Mewtwo. Sugoi. Sugoi. Full art, shiny Mewtwo. Oh, good pull. Diancy, baby shiny, Sugoi. about the uh, Whalord floaty. It's so great! GX. Popular Onyx. <laughs> oh, nope. Go back here now. Love how the shiny grass energy looks so pretty. Dark green is my favorite color. Reverse energies. Mm, good stuff. I would have to agree. One more. there. Last pack, Leafeon. I can't even tell Leafeon is shiny, but you know what? Still super pretty. <laughs> ah, I love it. will be distributed according to type in this one. <laughs> oh, Michael, I'm so glad you got something good. Leafeon and Baby Scyther. So cute. Our water spot with Baby Wooper. Supporters items getting the Jesse and James. Fighting spot with Zygarde and its entourage of Onyx. <laughs> Three Onyx GX and the full art Zygarde. Psychic, getting the Mewtwo full art. Very nice. Steel spot with Baby Bang Baby Magnemite. Our Fairy and Dark. Uh, looks like no Dark. We do have Diancie and Curlia, plus the really Tough GX. Colorless with Type Null, Baby Shiny, and the Birds Trio. And then our fire spot, Charizard GX. Alright, so it looks like Electric Dragon went hitless. So we'll get the seal pack for you. And then fire was the only spot that did not get a top loaded hit. So I'll throw in a little bit of extra for you as well. Shuffle 
Cool. Posture, my friend. Posture. There you go. All right, wraps up that break. So let's see where we're at now. Ah, uh, looks like back to Tavita with the mystery bundle. Oh, gym challenge first, and then your mystery bundle. Can I timestamp out of order? I'm gonna try it. I think you can. Cause you can. Yay, it worked. Okay. <laughs> gym challenge first. <laughs> I am a winner. Three onyx heads. Come on. <laughs> Absolutely. Onyx entourage. For sure. Alright. Totodile. Taking on Faulkner. Rematch time. What are we battling with? Um, Crimson. Crimson. Faulkner? Yep. Yeah. Okay. Alright, where are you at, Crimson? Yep, gym leaders do have to be challenged in order. We had a 6 to 3 battle against Faulkner previously. Six. Or, sorry, 3 to 6. Challenger always has their score listed first. Gotta remember that. Good luck, here we go! Or is it the away team? I don't remember. Alolan those. Marowak, one point for the reverse. Sigoy. Go Goat Hollow, two points. Jordan, heading out for the night. All right, well, have a good night. Shallows common, not hollow. Jordan sent you a whisper when you have a minute. Alright, then I'll take care of that. Uh, reverse rare. One point. Camera. Sigo. Common. Non hollow rare. <laughs> nice, Buttercup. It's official now, right? Common and non-hollow. Ooh, Crimson, you're making me nervous. Last one. What you got, Crimson? Got Houndoom. Our Hound Hour Common. No, non-hollow Crawdont. Ah, oh, Crimson. We were so close. Oh, Crimson, you have been so good to us tonight. Not this time, though. How rude. All right. Uh, no bulk, so just our hollows. with our gym challenge taking on Morty. He's up here. What do we have for Noe? Oh, sorry. Um, do, did you do the mystery bundle? Dang it. <laughs> ah. Oh, shoot. Well, I timestamped it. All right, so... uh, we can, we'll do the gym challenge, and then we'll do it. It's still after your gym challenge, but... All right, my apologies, Noe. <laughs> um... Chikorita and Morty. All right, but mystery box first. Okay, um, my bad, guys. <laughs> I got all confused. Last one for the mystery bundles. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do the drawer for Tavita. 
Then we're gonna do Noe's gym challenges, then we'll come back for the giveaway. That Sounds way good. we can fulfill all the things in a timely manner. Rebel Clash, Steam Siege, Sun and Moon, and Feats Collide. Alright, good luck. Here we go. I'm not sure how you want me to handle the timestamps on these guys. I don't even know. Okay. What you got? And a buzz. And Rotom. Alright, nothing too crazy in this bundle, but we got some reverses. And going no Volk. I will just timestamp the mystery bundle, or should I do that later? I don't know. Uh, okay, so you just did the mystery bundle? Not yet. I did the gym challenges, I haven't done the mystery bundle at all. With the timestamp, yeah. but you just opened the mystery bundle. I've only timestamped the gym challenge for knowing because I skipped the mystery bundle. Okay, so what I'm going to do is, let's see, I'm going to go into the timestamp sheet. So, whose gym challenge is it? Sorry. It's Noe's gym challenge. Noe's up next, yes. Okay, I have deleted Noe's, okay. timestamped the other one, I'll rewind it by three minutes, then times, oh, you already timestamped, hold on one second, don't touch, don't touch. Hey Scream, welcome! Put these over here real quick. Breaking things. Okay, now I've deleted it, so now you should be able to timestamp. Alright, so there's the mystery bundle that needs to be edited. Okay, and then I will put the timestamp. Uh, I can, what, I is, can... what is our current uptime? Uh, 4.44. And then I'll rewind this one. All right, we should be good timestamp wise. Oh, you have to do the custom one, don't you? All right, just do just do a custom one for Noe. Okay. Uh, one one seven nine three. Sorry, I got confused there. <laughs> Here we go. What are we using? Battle styles. Here is one, two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> Absolutely, Steven. Absolutely. Technology, it'll get you sometimes. Here we go. Good luck. We need eight points. Shouldn't be echoing. It may just be the uh, 
You might have the stream up in two tabs. Reverse rare, one point. Sigoli. Non hollow. <laughs> oh, man, what is that? Uh, it's uh, huge. <laughs> Got uncommon. Non hollow rare. Styles. Uncommon. On hollow. Oof. Here we go. <laughs> Stupid. I now understand why the older generations don't want to learn the new technology. After this year, I'm done trying new things. Alright, there we go. Sandaconda hollow. Two points. Alright, last one. We need a big one. Sun, reverse rare, one point. Sigoi. Ooh, not even a hollow. Age slash, are you even trying? <sighs> well, you're right, we do have some more chances. <laughs> but darn, just our hollows this round. Alright, and no bulk. All right, well, let's reset and go once again. Uh, are we all battle styles? I think all three were exactly the same, yes. Okay. He just slash was in defense mode. <laughs> Fair. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, here we go. Good luck. Brutal style strikes again. Oof, accurate. Drampa, uh, reverse rare, one point. We got full tonned. Mr. Rhyme, reverse rare, one point. Sigoi. Oh, full art, Empoleon. That's a nice one. Sigoi. Sigoi, four points. Like every week, my district was like, Here, try this new thing, it'll help. No, no, <laughs> just makes me overwhelmed, confused, and more tired. Oof, try this new thing that doesn't come with an instruction book. Like, good luck, bye. <laughs> All right, keep it up, Bow Styles. You got this. Come in, not hollow. Also, we wasted two million of the school's budget on it. Bye. <laughs> uh, your boy, gravy, when do we ship? So when, once you do ascend my stuff, oh, Hollow King draw two points! Uh, once you do ascend my stuff, we will package everything up on Friday and Saturday and get it into the mail on Monday. Alright, we got two packs left. Bonus round. Uh, no points there. Yeah, this week is a normal mail week. The next two weeks will be slightly altered mail weeks. I just we gotta account for the chilling rain set release. Found Doom Reverse, one point. Sigoi. Uh, yep, you're correct. Just gets refunded. All right, nine points, and that very nice full art penguin. Boom. Prize card. Let's take a look. Alright, cool. Steven, do I have a lot of cards to show you guys? Can't remember when I last did to send my stuff. I can take a quick peek. Ooh, we got shiny bandettes. Oh, 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 thank you so much for the sub. We're going on five months now. Time flies when your wallet hurts, but you're having fun. 
That's what matters, right? So we're having fun <laughs> sometimes. Let's see if we can get somewhere between, you know, like 70 and 200 cards with us. Sorry for the like wide range, but it's like about maybe 10 to 15 orders worth of bags. All right, so I said we would come back to our mystery bundle giveaway, so that's what we're gonna do now. Gravity, you know? How about you stand up for yourself? Yep, good job. <laughs> Okay, uh, so this Hidden Fates pack here is going to be given away for free to one person that bought into our Mystery Bundles today. Ooh, time stamp the Mystery Bundle giveaway. Good call. It's heavy, must contain his art. <laughs> uh, mystery Bundle. I don't know if sellout is one word or two words. It's, Either or. It's one word today. Okay, let's find out who our mystery bundle people were. All right, Jessica was first, down to Tavita at the bottom. I'm gonna copy this over to random.org. Pasting in, we've got Tavita at the bottom and Jessica at the top. So good luck, guys. Randomizing three times. One. Two. And three times. Congratulations, Zelda Hime! Sugoi! Sugoi! I need to hack <laughs> random.org one day. Oh, look! There's Van's name at the top. Very not suspicious. <laughs> All right, well, Zelda Hime, if you're still hanging out with us, let me know if you want this opened. Um, if by chance you're not online, we'll just give it to you sealed. But yeah, we do this Hidden Fates giveaway every Tuesday, so long as we sell out all of the Mystery Bundle drawers. Oh, and hey, Dream It! How's it going? Alright, well, uh, let me know. I'm more than happy to come back to it if you are online. regular list. There we go. Okay, who's up next? Steven! Right? Yes. I'm gonna give you that one because I don't need it. Alright, Steven, good luck! Gym challenge time! For Steven again. Uh, I guess I just printed out the label for the mystery on the back. Um, Steven. Cyndaquil taking on Whitney. Nice, nice. And going in with Steam Siege. Pokemon booster costs. So it really depends on the set. 
I would suggest checking out our store. All the prices are listed there. We are Bari Bari USA. Uh, reverse rare, one point. Sigoi. Uh -huh. It's kind of hard to say exactly. But yeah, check out the shop. Uncommon. Non hollow. Hey! <laughs> Spell the Hime! Uh, you won the Hidden Fates Pack giveaway from the Mystery Bundles. Come in. Not hollow. Come on, Steam Siege. We need a little more from you. Here we go. Veltal reverse. One point. So no way. Toxicrogue non hollow. Come on, Steam Siege. Let's see something big. Steven, only four points. Uh, one thing to know, uh, Deoxtrum, we do have a $10 international shipping fee. Um, just keep that in mind when you're, if you're considering purchasing with us. Yep, be sure to read over the shipping explained, it explains the whole shipping policy. You don't necessarily have to ship your cards right now, but eventually that will be the uh, cost to do the shipping. Uh, Zelda Hime, if you want your Hidden Fates Pact opened, we can do that right now for you. Um, or if you'd like to just enjoy it sealed at home, more than welcome to do that too. Totally up to you. delay today, so I'm not sure. Yes, please. All right. Here we go. Good luck. Let's see. No, once you ship in the U.S., it should take like two to five days, right? Uh, I mean, depending on the postal service, roughly. Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes it can take week, week and a half. Ooh, Ooh. nice one. Baby shiny Charmander. So we got Zapdos Hollow as well. Cute tap dancing Charmander. That's my head cannon. Head cannon. Mm -hmm. He's like a little orange creamsicle. <laughs> <laughs> He's got that color. Well, I, I, I believe that <laughs> might be a uh, well desired card. <laughs> uh, but we can give you the whole pack if you want it. It is a free giveaway, so. We'll give you the whole pack unless you don't want the bulk. But congrats! Nice pull! Segoy! Chibizard! Exactly! And thank you for buying in the mystery bundles today! <laughs> oh, that was a fun pack! Alright, uh, Nicholas up next with the gym challenge! Ooh, I'll take her Okay. I forgot I had a gym challenge coming up. I don't like it when the plushies look directly at me, so we have to, like, angle them. <laughs> Looks up at Artist Evie. Ah! <laughs> I wonder if I can get that, like, on camera. I need people to understand what I have to go through. <laughs> You see this? This it stares at me the whole time. So here's like my computer screen right there. It's just over the top of my computer screen. Look what Ghost <laughs> has done to me. <laughs> She's like, I'm watching you the whole time. Anyway, it's hard Cindy to Quill and Morty. <laughs> All right, Cindy Quill and Morty. Oh, we didn't 
reset our points. There we go. Now I'm dealing with PTSD from Annabelle. <laughs> RCV horror movie vibes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we are using battle styles. It's not red paint. Paint. It's a tube of blood. <laughs> Shrieking noises. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, Nicholas. Best of luck. Here we go. Reverse rare, one point. Sorry. Trampa, not hollow. Oh, frozen bolt. Look away and a Pokemon spawns. Trampa, reverse rare. Sorry. One point. Oh, 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 gold level ball. So gold. Sorry. Going for gold, I love it. Five points. Snazzy. All right, well, any other crazy hits for us, Battle Styles? Slowpoke, common, non hollow. Colossal, reverse rare, one point. Segoy. There we go, we got Morty. Battle Styles, please spoil me more. I said please. <laughs> Last one. Victory Bell, uh, reverse rare, one point. Segoy. And TTRV, Segoy. Segoy. Three points. Nice! Alright, getting gold! I think that stole the show today. Sorry, T-Tar. Gold level ball and Tarantar V. Congrats. Uh, going for no bulk. Bridge Cooper, welcome. Morty prize card. Oh, was that TTR good? Oh, perfect. We got gold and a wanted card. Coming away with the Marshadow GX. So goy. So goy. I feel like Marshadow and Beware can like relate. They don't have fingers, they just have hand blobs. They're cute, but like, will punch you in the face. 10 out of 10. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, congrats, Nicholas. need Bruno and Mimikyu and that'll be all the Battle Styles cards. Nice. So close. Okay, who's up next? We got Noe with some Shining Fates. Alright, Noe, this time I can pull some Shinies for you. One, two, three, four, five, six. Of luck, here we go. Oh, I'm not crazy. I'm like, I feel like the packs are usually folded in that direction, and this one is folded in this direction. I was like, what is happening? Okay, 
So when you open as many packs as I do, that's actually a weird thing. <laughs> <laughs> Half the time I'm just going off of the feel. Yeah, Indeedy, Hollow. I bet you could open packs in your sleep. Could probably do it with my eyes closed, but I don't want to risk anybody's pack. This is fair. <laughs> Hatena, baby shiny, so boy. So Start off with the party hat. Supporter card ever. Or a top contender for sure. <laughs> Pokey Kid. Wacky, Baby Shiny, and Rainbow Cake. Oh, Crummy V Max. Sugoi, Sugoi. Sugoi. Two for one. with you. It's a giant cake. <laughs> oh, that's a fun one, though. Alchemy VMAX. Such a cool design. You didn't eat King Rainbow Cake. <laughs> <laughs> supporter and one rainbow. Ah, oh, Shining Fates, you are so much fun. Okay, also we have the uh, hollows as well. Next, picking up an exhibition match. Sounds good. Also, a gym challenge afterward. All right. Exhibition match first. Yep. Okay. All right, we're taking on B. We need that ten points. One, two, three, four, five, six. Noe with the gift sub! Segoy! That was super nice, thank you. Gift sub going to, I want to say, Bachel? Very nice. Alright, Van, here we go. Or Beetle, reverse, one point. Segoy! Strike Bear. Sugoy. Sugoy, four points. Nice, nice. Thank you. King Drahalo, two points. Sugoy. 
magic panda. <laughs> Uncommon, non hollow. Thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome. All right, come on, Battle Styles. Stay strong. Carnivine, uncommon, uh, non hollow. Let's go, Battle Styles. Last one. All right, here we go. Spiro, common. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh my goodness! Wow! Sigo. We've got the Altard Sleepy Titar! Sugoy! What a way to end! Sugoy! That is four points right there. Dang, man! That's insane! We haven't pulled Sleepy Keytar in forever! That's the way to win! Oh, oh wow. B's just like, yep, nope, you win. Two very nice looking cards. Congrats! Tranitar at a disadvantage against the fighting type, so it's like, alright, eating contest. Tranitar wins. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, immediately passes out. <laughs> same, Titar, same. Oh, dang, that's fun. That's fun. Okay, well, we have our first victory in our exhibition match. Congratulations. Sugo. On top of everything else. <laughs> okay. Oh, wait, where's my winter sparkles? Yay, winter sparkles. <laughs> Here we go. All right. So, uh, once again, exhibition match. This uh, prize theme is the Galar region. So it could be a Galar region Pokemon, maybe a supporter, or like a VMAX Pokemon. Let's find out. We've got... Oh, no way! <laughs> We've got a matching bear for you. A single strike full art this time. I feel like your, uh, your T-Tar now has escorts. Single strike, <laughs> rapid strike, T-Tar in the middle. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Oh, they're even looking at him! It's perfect! <laughs> no one shall disturb sleeping T-Tar. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, well, congratulations. Uh, you are now entered for the grand prize as well. That rainbow bee... Yep, we'll be doing that drawing every time we have 10 winners. Oof, that was fun. That was fun. Hmm, it's a better color than brown to highlight the winners in. Um, <laughs> she's like orange. Orange works. I, I used orange for me. She's got orange on her uniform. Okay, uh, well, we're not done. We got a gym challenge as well. Let's do it again. All right, we got Cyndaquil taking on Morty. Hey, we're using battle styles. Who knows? <laughs> it could happen. You know, just maybe uh, Artalt and Polion or something, you know? Artalt, yes. One, two, three, four, five, six. Alt, art, yes. <laughs> My brain is like, wait, how do I say words again? I'm sorry, I gotta give you a hard time. No, that's totally fine. <laughs> All right, man. Best of luck. Here we go. This time we're taking on Morty. Uncommon. Corviknight VMAX. Oh my gosh, I had a heart attack. I thought it was another altar. I was like, <laughs> I can't handle this, man. Sego. Sego VMAX. Four points. Steamboat, you've been called out. Good start there. Common, 
Gligar. Non hollow rare. Battle Styles is treating people right right now. Sure thing, sure is. I mean, uncommon, non hollow. Loves me. If I get one more of it, I may quit Pokemon altogether. Out of the Dodger. Alright, have a good night. Take care. Uncommon. Hollow Steelix, two points. Alright, one more. One more. Stay strong, Battle Styles. What you got? What you got? Got B Sharp, Uncommon. B Max, Tapu Koko, Sagoy. Sagoy. All right. Once again, a clear victory. And we didn't pull any alt arts this time, but you know, we won. A couple of B Maxes in there Tapu and Corbin Knight. Taco arms, yes. Uh, no bulk for this round. Battle Styles is playing favorites. <laughs> All right, Morty's prize box. Prize box, yes. Let's see. We got Rainbow Blacephalon, Sagoy. Sagoy. This guy creeps me out a little bit, but he's kind of cool at the same time. There we go. We're all set for next week. Take on Chuck. I think he did his arms like tacos on purpose. <laughs> Alright, so let's see where we're at. Uh, looks like Samantha is up next with a couple of gym challenges. And then Lunar after that. So let's do it. Um, Samantha, gym challenge? Yes, um, that is not the right search that I need to do. <laughs> Um, to Totodile taking on Whitney. We are with Battle Styles. Alright, one, two, three, four, five, six. Samantha, best of luck. Here we go. Comment. Necrozma V, Sigoy! Sigoy! Starting off with three points. Um, uncommon. Non hollow rare. Cinderace, Scat Promo, Old Reverse Rare, one point. Segoy. And Tapu Coco V, Segoy, three Segoy. points. Apparently they found a Cinderace Staff Promo in a Build and Battle Kit. Weren't they discontinuing Staff Promos? I thought they were. Yeah, me too. Maybe they were only supposed to be for the in crowd. <laughs> I don't know. It's just like, it's a stamp, right? Yeah, that's the right one. 
Oops, wrong one. <laughs> Uncommon and Doom Hollow, two more. Sigourney. Last pack. Ooh, this one's got some lines in it. I wonder if I can get that. Can you see that down there? Like print lines? I have to wait for the stream to catch up. It's really hard to see on camera, but it's a little bit more obvious in person. Cheruby with the lines. And on hollow bolt up. Okay, yeah, you can definitely see it on the stream once you get the angle right. All right, nine points for the victory, Necrozma and Tapu Coco. were confirmed to have been stopped after Vivid. Huh. Yeah, that's what I thought. I wonder what they're doing. Messing around. Maybe they're messing around while the boss was away. Some people are thinking it's an error. I mean, I'd believe that. Let's get a Whitney prize card. Looks like a Rangaroo, Baby Shiny. Sigoy. Sigoy, he's very pink. Very Whitney esque. <laughs> Where's that pile? Oh, sorry. All right, we had two challenges for Samantha. So moving on from Whitney to Morty. All right, Morty is eight points. Let's do it. One, two, three, four, five, six. Once again, best of luck. Uh, common. Hollow Inte, two points. Segoi. Vibe into the song in the back. <laughs> it's like kind of beachy, but also kind of techno. <laughs> like it. Styles, what you got? Let's see something crazy. Laurentis, reverse rare, one point. So go on. And non hollow. Yamper, come in. <laughs> non hollow stone journey. All right, you can do it. Stay strong. Here we go. Last one. Will it be Battle Styles? Flinks, reverse rare, one point. We're going. Down to this. Oh, oh, we've got a chance. Hey, Tyranitar V, three points. We're going. So going. Woo. Barely sliding under the wire there. Stress me out, Battle Styles. Very nice, eight points with the hollows and the V. Congrats. And a Morty prize card as well. Looks 
like Baby Shiny Shuppet. Segoy. I love how he goes green. Cute Baby Shuppet. Frantar is really saving people tonight. Good guy, T-Tar. <gasps> Phantom Girl, is it your birthday? Sego Honey. Oh, happy birthday. Glad we could get some wins for your birthday. Hope we can get the command right. Weird B-Day song, go! No, I got it wrong. Is it birthday, maybe? I don't actually know. Just B-Day? Someone chat, help me out. <laughs> <laughs> there we go, birthday song. <laughs> the weird birthday song. All right, uh, Lunar. Lunar up next with the gym challenge. What do we have for Lunar? Lunar. Chikorita taking on Morty. Battlestyle, please be nice. I don't want another Whitney situation. <laughs> you hear that, Battle Styles? Be good. One, two, three, four, five, six. Best of luck, let's get that eight points. Uncommon, uh, non hollow. Um, uncommon, non hollow rare. Reverse, one point. So going. Uh, not hollow. All right, come on, Battle Styles. We got this. Um, yes, Conkledur, reverse rare. One point. Conkledur twins. Minus the hollow. Carnivine Uncommon. Hey, Flapple VMAX. Sigoy. Sigoy. Four points. I feel like gym challenges are the one place where VMAXs are like a really good thing. <laughs> they are quite powerful. Okay. We're still in the running. We can still do this, Battle Styles. Last pack. What you got? Lick a tongue, common. So going. Oh, non hollow. Ah. Uh, oh, lunar. I'm sorry. Well, we did get that flapple V Max. We got our hollows as well. Darn. That was super nice. Ordered some packs for Phantom Girl's birthday. Uh, Steven up next with some battle styles, personals. Steven. Near, near, near. Fan of Wave. 
Graves, we got Sandaconda, Hollow Snake. Hey, Big Nikki, welcome. Corviknight V, Sigoy. Sigoy. Oh no, was it Corviknight or was it Tapu? I can't remember which bird Steven was like, no more. It might have been Corviknight. Do do do. <laughs> Got Kingdra. It's an altar night. <laughs> it certainly is. Wow. Sicko. Oh, dang. Rapid Strike or Shifu VMAX. Alternate art. Right here. Oh. I love it. I love it. Did Steven head to bed? Oh, Steven, you're here. Yay. <laughs> Overcome with excitement. No time to type. <laughs> oh, so good. I love how Cramorant has to have a fish as well. You know, it can't just be Cramorant. It's got to be Cramorant and the poor, like, Aracuda getting eaten. Oh, so fun. That's awesome. So good. So good. Okay, we got two more. Two more. I was eating a yogurt. <laughs> uh, hopefully you didn't spit it out. <laughs> <laughs> Ball toy, H slash hollow. So much alt art left tonight. Consume Arakuda for nutrition. Alright, well, hopefully the alt art covers the rest of the packs for you. Corbin IV and the star of the show. Rapid Strike or Shifu VMAX. Alt art! <laughs> oh, so exciting! Let's see, we're doing bulk, uh, no bulk. Oh, thank you for the reminder, Poke. Um, so right now, the Shining Fates hit draft is up on the shop. Oh, right. Yep. <laughs> also, Victor, if you are still around, I could leave that Hidden Fates one up as well. As you are the uh, only one with the spots down in that one. But totally up to you. We seem to get those Hidden Fates drafts filled quite a bit more at the late night time. So if everyone is still around, we can keep that going. Up next, Nicholas doing a 3v bundle. Okay. We got Breakpoint, Sun and Moon, and Guardians Rising. Here we go. Best of luck. Let's find some EVs. Also, uh, Noe, since yours are up next, just confirming that those packs are a gift. Is that right? Ooh, Mega Scizor EX! Sigoy! Sigoy! Not an EV, but still cool. Damn. Wanna test your luck for Umbreon or Espeon? Those are some sweet cards, for sure. Got Palosand. Okay, just wanna confirm. Those are for Samantha? Yes. Joshua Flybys, thank you so much for this sub. Segoy, three months. All right, looks like we're getting Mega Caesar out of that batch. Got 
some reverse hollows. All right. All right, three packs of battle styles up next. It's a birthday gift. You know what, Mega Scizor is cool. He is, he's got like, scissor hands it's kind of you know i don't know <laughs> Battle styles. here we are that's it that's good true true here we go through October. Segoy! <laughs> wow, thank you, thank you. I can't even calculate how many different <laughs> uh, sub giveaways that gets you into. Let's see. September, October. Let's see, depends. through October, but it's in October, so it's, it's either eight or ten sub giveaways between US and Japan sides. <laughs> wow. Oh, come on, Battle Styles. Oh, darn. It's hoping for a little bit of birthday magic. Got some hollows in there. All right. Ban! Back at the exhibition match. Let's do it. match against B. One, two, three, four, five, six. Best of luck. Here we go. We've got Colossal Hollow. Two points. Segoy. match. Oh, yes. Stalin, um, three points. Um, basically, just kind of a, a summary. I'll have it. It's uh, similar to a gym challenge, but it's kind of like a one-off type of battle, not connected to anything. Lux Ray, reverse, one point. Same point systems, um, but sometimes there's better prizes. Also incorporates a grand prize. Yanshao reverse one point. Oh, I got spoiler in there. Silver border. No way, Altar! <laughs> what is happening tonight? Single strike or Shifu V. Alternate art. Segoy. Wow. What a night. We got four points for this one. A victory. It was just an all dark kind of night. <laughs> Titar wasn't enough for you, I guess. Oh, so good. Single strike, full art. Beautiful. Wow, okay, one more pack, too. We don't pull alt arts for weeks, and then all of a sudden they're just like, hello, we are here, in mass. One point for the Licky Licky, and Entei Hollow, two points. Steven, I'm still on Cloud9. Well, well-deserved Cloud9, for sure. 
we've had what two or three three alternate art or shifus and the sleepy tea tar today what madness Stoutland V and the alternate art uh, single strike congrats also the victory <laughs> we got the B box. I have way too much fun saying that. No, the space adds a, char it's a character limit. Um... B box, B box. All right, let's get you a prize. <laughs> Um, for this one, we've got Rainbow Rapid Strike Mustard. Segoy! Segoy! Pulling a rainbow for the victory over B. Colonel Mustard in the billiard room. Just adding that onto your pile of alt arts. No big deal. <laughs> oh, man, congrats. Tonight can't be real. <laughs> oh, well, if it's a dream, it's a super fun one. All right, up next, Lunar. Shining Fates and a Gym Challenge. Sounds good. Starting off with your personal packs. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, I have a typo. <laughs> good luck. Here we go. There we go. Sidurai Hollow. Casey, thank you for the follow. Ooh, sounds fun, sounds fun. All right, well, have a good night. Have a good flight, too. Indeedy Buddies, Indeedy Baby Shiny, and the V. Sigo! Also, welcome, welcome, Casey. Best of luck on your pulls, Rico. Oh, that's true. I didn't even notice. We got the male and the female. <laughs> um, Real Boom Hollow. Junior Bacon Bug. We got Sizzle P, Baby Shiny. Getting our hollows, of course. Uh, no bulk. And then our hits. We got two baby shinies, Sizzlepeed and Indeedy. Plus the, excuse me, Indeedy V. All right. And then, of course, <laughs> man, no way I wouldn't be a third time, right? And pull an alternate art? I don't know. 
Uh, we do have a gym challenge for Lunar up next. All right, Chikorita taking on Morty. Rematch time. Final styles. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. But yeah, as a note, you are more than welcome to challenge uh, exhibition leaders as many times as you want until all those prize cards from their vault are gone. I believe we have 30 prize cards for B. Yep. And Go. three rainbow Bs for the grand prizes. The only... Uh... Only thing I will say about that is if you could just limit your exhibition purchases to three at a time, just so we uh, can get through the list. That's uh, all we're really asking. Kingdra Hollow, two points. Segoy. Kind of the same with gym challenges. We just say up to three at a time, just to give other players a chance. But if you want to place a separate order, that's fine too. Alright, come on, Battle Styles. Let's do this. Let's do this. Okay, big common. Ah, Artillery Hollow, two points. Segoy. Funyard, common. Cricketune V, Segoy. Segoy. Attack the camera with my hand. All right, last one. Come on, uncommon. Oh, Aegis Slash, non hollow. Oh, we were right there. Oh, don't leave us with one point. So mean. Cricketune V from this round. Darn. <laughs> oh, sad day. Three losses against Morty. Alright, um, Sebastian going in on an exhibition match, and then some blind boxes afterwards. Oh, no worries, Muslim. Uh, it's very similar. The scoring style is the same. Um, exhibition matches are set in the, t the pack type, so there's a required pack type, you don't get to choose. Um, and they also have the uh, incorporation of a grand prize. So every time you win, you get a regular prize, but different from the gym battles is that everybody who wins a normal prize gets entered into the grand prize drawing. So the grand prize for this exhibition round is the Rainbow B card. So it's kind of like how when you win on the gym challenge, you get entered into your plushie drawing. It's instead of the plushie, it's their like full art trainer card or something like that. Um, it's also different from the gym challenge because you can re-challenge it as many times as you want. Win or lose, you can win multiple times and win multiple prizes. Uh, gym challenges are only win once and then you're done. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, Sebastian, best of luck. Here we go. Upon your common, non hollow. Joshua, is the gym challenge over? Um, our Johto season is not over, still in progress. Uh, we've released all the way up through Morty. Octillery hollow, two points. Zero. Exhibition is just kind of like an extra add-on. So 
we are running both right now, gym challenge and exhibition matches. Yep, there's no re no prerequisite for challenging the exhibition matches. You can do it if you've done Sogo. TVB, Sogo Boy, three points. If you've done no gym challenges for the season, or if you've finished them all, you can always enter the gym chat or the exhibition matches. Oh yeah, our Kanto season did wrap up, that is true. Yep, that one wrapped up at the last week in May, I believe. Somewhere in that area. Marowak, reverse, one point. Segoy. Alright, come on, battle styles. Let's do this. Cacturn, uncommon. Mimikyu V, Segoy. Get three points for Mimikyu. Yeah, ten points is about on par with our second to last gym leader in the gym challenge. So it's it is tough, but can be done. All right, last one, Carnivine Uncommon. Oh no! Oh, we just needed one. Oh, the pain. Carnivine, I think you were a rare in a different set. Why couldn't you be rare in this one? Oh, Sebastian, I'm so sorry. Victini and Mimikyu, though. Wow, B. That's uh, not nice. Oof, oof. Um, do you have label for that one? Oh, sorry, I'm behind on labels. Well. Victory Bell is not giving the victory. Rude. Agreed. I knew I never liked Victory Bell. Un Victory Bell. Oh my goodness. All the best puns. Alright. Uh, well, let's get you some Terrariums Collection, too. Here's one. And here's two. Good luck. All right, let's see. Oh, I see Pikachu in there. <laughs> All right, Pikachu and friends, we've got Togepi as well. Building a snowman! Cute! A little evergreen tree. In the snow! <laughs> little group of friends. There they are. Oh, Togepi's on top of the snowball. Nice. Cubone. Alright, well, good luck. Ooh, I know Sky was hunting that Cubone too, so. Maybe good trade butter if they have something you want. Oh, I see sand. Ooh, I think this is good news. <laughs> if I could get the tape off. Is a hot commodity. Why is there two tapes? That's not fair. <laughs> I did not sign up for this. Oh, JK, it's one tape. It's just three miles long. Ugh. Well, maybe. <laughs> maybe we'll get it out. <laughs> right! 
Cubone and Sandshrew in this one. A little palm tree. Segoy. Definitely not an Alolan Executor palm tree. A little small for that. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it wouldn't be able to fit that in a drawing ring for certain. Aw, playing in the sand together. Super cute. Next, we've got Noe with some more battle styles. Six personal packs. Aw, thanks, Muslim. The stream is very entertaining. Thanks for all the work you both put into this. One, two, three, four, five, six. It's definitely a lot of work, but it's so worth it. You guys are such fun to hang out with, and we got Pokemon, man. Doesn't get better than that, right? Good luck, Noe. Lick tongue. We got VMAX. Single strike. Segoy. Segoy. Last order for the night. Something good. Alright. Well, start off with a VMAX. Battlestyles ladies in quite a while. I was gonna say, there's a few cards that have been uh, hiding for a little bit longer than the others. Karina and Cheryl and... We did have Karina Phoebe. last week, I remember, but Phoebe... Phoebe and Cheryl then. Yeah, they've been hiding. Or like a rainbow bear? Rainbow bears are snoozing on us. That is also true, yeah. Is that Discord Reverse? Big bug. Um, the Digital Mutant! Thank you so much for the follow! Welcome! Thank you! And Embor Hollow! Alright, our big pull coming away with the VMAX single strike. And all of the hollows as well. Okay, up next, Samantha doing an exhibition match. First time here, love watching people opening packs. Does anyone do this for the new Digimon TCG? Honestly, I don't know. Uh, we unfortunately do not. Uh, I wish I knew, honestly. I, I... Does anybody else know if someone breaks uh, Digimon? I know Ashley and Ginko did it. Did they do Digimon Day? They've got day? Japanese Digimon. Um, our uh, streaming partner, Bari Bari Japan, they do Japanese Digimon. One, two, three, four, five, six. Have a good night, Noe. All right, good luck to Samantha. Here we go. We 
got Trampa Reverse Rare, one point. Segoy. Oh, Juan's got it? Oh, nice. So, uh, Dream It Collectibles, perhaps? Flapple VMAX. Segoy. Segoy. Got four points for VMAX. Probably just watch on my phone in bed. Gotta see Van do this again. <laughs> ah, nice. Hey, and there's our pack goal. Segoy. Segoy. Lorantis reverse, one point. Segoy. Cherim Hollow, two points. All right, this is good progress. Keep it up, Battle Styles. You got this. Hound Hour and non hollow. Uncommon, non hollow. Okay, all right, last one. What you got, Battle Styles? Tisaru, common? No, non hollow. Oh, come on. No, we were on a roll there with the V Max and all the hollows. So close, so very close. All right, Flapple V Max, though. to update our pack counter. So we've unlocked our Gardevoir EX at 500 packs on to Alakazam at 800. There we go. All right, who is up next? Oh, Van, there we go. Another exhibition match. Exhibition matches have been very good to you. Let's let's see what happens this time. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's stick to the script. <laughs> okay. Oh no, what is that? It is an alt art. Fan, you are amazing. <laughs> good luck, here we go. Embor, reverse rare, one point. Segoy. Tapu Coco V, Segoy. Segoy. Uh, three points. <laughs> Uncommon and not hollow. Make it look more difficult. Mm, could it be? That one is not an alt art. It is uncommon. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing, man. <laughs> Just rip things open and things happen. Uncommon. Not hollow. Alright, but seriously, battle styles. Come on. Battle Stars is like, let's crank up the uh, anxiety a little bit here. Uh, the Enfu common. <gasps> Full Art Victini! Segoy! Four points for Victini. Alright, alright. Still coming down to the wire. Nothing Just need like, a hollow. Nothing like stressing out over your last pack. Here we go. What do we got? Prime Ape, reverse rare, one point. Segoy. 
Stress. <laughs> okay. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, you lucky duck. So <laughs> go, 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 twins. Three points for the V. Did that work? Yes. Wow, Ben. Okay, well, I guess we can't go three for three alt arts, but three for three victories. So go really away. <laughs> oh, I love it. I love it. Ah, oh, we've got no bulk. Oh, let's get our hits. We didn't tap a Coco Entourage this time. And that full our Victini. It looks like I won. Hmm. Indeed. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Crazy. Another Victini. <laughs> hey, Buttercup. <laughs> All right. And we got a prize card. What'll it be, Charizard? It'll be Oleana, full art supporter. Segoy. Segoy. <laughs> yeah, so they're not all battle styles prizes. Just, you know, the first few happen to be. Yep, all Galar region themed. Which includes battle styles, but, mm -hmm. you know. Lots of other cool stuff, too. <laughs> Congrats! <laughs> Waifu! <laughs> Alright. Another fun round. That one is a little more stressful, but also good. <laughs> Where are we at next? Nicholas! We have a Stariums for you, and an exhibition match. Starium first. Also, here's a good question. Did Oleana ever get more development in any of the DLCs? Because I think she had like four lines in the entirety of the game. Unless I'm like remembering wrong. No way four times? I don't know, man. That's on you. Currently up to three entries for the first of the Rainbow Bees. Alright. Uh, Nicholas, best of luck. That must be stopped. <laughs> <laughs> He's too powerful. Ooh, we've got Jirachi. Segoy. And all the stars. All the stars. She had no lines in the DLC. I was gonna say, like, everyone loves Oleana. Like, there's there's like a huge fan base for her, and I'm like, I, I don't know her character. Like, she didn't have a role. She's just like the responsible half of Rose. Alright, getting the Jirachi. Like, I think she said half of her lines when she was introducing you to Rose while he was in Dad Bond mode. <laughs> or is he or is she even there? I feel like she came and was like, Rose, no, stop that. You child. <laughs> there we go, Jirachi. Um, okay, time for an exhibition match. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Best of luck to Nicholas. Here we go. It was at the restaurant. Go beat the gym, then come find us. Yeah, like. <laughs> Uncommon. Not hollow. I mean, she was a very competent secretary. She, you know, like handled the business and stuff, but like, she didn't really have a role. <laughs> In the story. How do you reverse? One point. Segoy. Not hollow. Uh, Drapa reverse. One point. Segoy. Come on. 
Come on, Bastiles. I think you might have said like one line when you met her at Rose Tower, and that was it. <sighs> Dronzong, reverse rare, one point. Segoy. Luxray Hollow, two points. Segoy. All right, we need some big hitters. Let's see them. Uncommon. Vic Teeny V, Segoy. Segoy. Three points for Vic Teeny's three fingers. <laughs> <laughs> My champ does not count as 20 points. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> My Mario song? Is this a Mario song? Oh, okay, now I hear it. <laughs> Alright, time to stress. Last pack. Here we go. What we got? Four fish, common. <gasps> it is Phoebe! Well, we just so haven't seen her in a while, so go away. Yeah, look, we even got Cheryl, too. <laughs> Ballard Phoebe for four points! Segohoy! Wow! Battle Styles! You're giving us anxiety! <laughs> oh, so good! So good, Phoebe! I love all the flower petals in the background! Also getting Victini! Total of 12 points! Very nice! I know my non-copyright EDM. <laughs> fair, fair enough. <laughs> Honestly, I don't even know half the things on this playlist. I was like, is it copyright free? Okay. Uh, let's see, no bulk. Steven, all right, friends. Thank you so much for the amazing poll tonight. I'm off to bed. Eight more days of the school year! Ooh. You're so close. Have a good night, Steven. Alright, let's get Nicholas a prize from the B Box. What will it be, Charizard? Ooh, let's turn it this way today. Ooh, we got Baby Shiny Inteleon! Segoy! Segoy with its pink cape. Fancy guy. My favorite gym leader is Marlin. Wish there was more of him in TCG. Oh, I'm drawing a total blank. Uh, what, what gen is he in? Uh, I do not actually know. It's probably in one of the games I didn't play, let's be real. Because there were a lot of those. It's what happens when I, you know, didn't I played all the games back to back. It's like <laughs> I don't know what gen leader, what gen anything is. I know first gen, second gen, and then second through sixth gen or third through sixth gen. Gen five, oh yeah, I was uh, definitely absent for like the middle of Pokemon. <laughs> but yeah, I feel like they should feature more more gym leaders because they're cool. By the way, I need you to get Forest Collection 3 so I can get more Ah, uh, As much as I would love to do so, I doubt that's going to happen. <laughs> Alright. Um, who's up next? Lunar! Lunar, going for revenge. We got a gym challenge against Morty. Is it Chikorita for Lunar? Um, I believe so. Let me double check. Do, do, do. Chikorita. All right, Marty, you're going down. I will have the Tree of Friendship, though, when it releases and ships to me. <laughs> All right, battle styles time. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right. All the good luck. Here we go. At this point, I am doing the challenges for the memes. <laughs> Uncommon. Not hollow. Until I lose. Let's see how far we can push it, man. You never know. 
suddenly all the B prizes are gone. Um, common. We got Rapid Strike or Shifu V Max. Segoy getting that four points. TCGO, and I see your Shifu is very wanted because it's the meta right now. It's true, right? I feel like the uh, single strike, rapid strike thing kind of switched things up. Common. Meow Stick Hollow, two points! Segoy! Woohoo! Morty defeated! Oh, well deserved victory. One more. I'm really surprised how much like the single rapid strike shaped the meta. Marowak reverse with a little bit of a crimpy crimp on top. Sick old. Don't ask me why I said it that way. It's just one of those nights. <laughs> Show us the crimpy crimp. A little bit. There you go in the light. <laughs> but yeah, there's actually not too many like single or rapid strike specific cards. So like. I'm really glad Chilling Rain's coming out so people have more uh, deck building options. More options! Alright, getting that Rapid Strike VMAX! Plus our hollows. Segoy! Oh, we are free! Free from Morty. Alright, and for a prize, looks like Dragapult Cold Art! Segoy. Segoy. And bonus three piece. <laughs> oh, I believe in you, Muslim. You can do it. Pull that Zero Or Alt Art. So beautiful. I guess we'll see. Oh, you did it, Lunar. Congrats. Okay, that's not gonna fit. Oh, nice. You collect the uh, the crimps van. That's cool. All right, who's next? Uh, Lunar with more battle styles. Sounds good. Too many trays of it, so. <laughs> Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, now we can just relax a little bit and open battle styles at our leisure. No pressure involved. <laughs> Except on new battle styles, so bring us the hits. <laughs> I was gonna say, yeah, I was like, hopefully you've seen the Chilling Rain ones, because the uh, Chilling Rain gold energies look awesome. Poor Beetle Hollow. I love the extra, like, shine sparkles they add to the energy cards. English Booster Box is not guaranteed hit, right? I don't know if there's a guaranteed rate, but there's usually, like, an average hit rate. There's usually at least one secret rare, I feel like. Sometimes two in a box. Yeah. I, I feel like a lot of it is because there are so many packs in there that probabilistically you were very likely to get one or more, but... I don't think they've ever come out and said, we guarantee it. Yeah, but you don't hear very often, like, I opened a booster box and got nothing. So... Okay, Battle Stars, come on. Last one. Big pulls.
Boo. Oh, we got some hollows. Hollows this time. And go with no bulk. Six packs for me. I certainly can. Okay. Labels caught up, so. Alright, I have not time stamped. Okay. So, Noe up next. Alright, some shining face for Noe. Let's do the time stamp before I forget. Because I always forget that. One, two, three. Four. Five and six. All right. Best of luck. Oh, I need to scroll up because I need some chat. Um, do, do, do. But yeah, I, I feel like, you know, you're at least going to get four or five V or four or five kits in general out of a booster box at like the worst possible luck. Oh, come on. Oh, we had some lag. Hold on. What are you doing? You were doing so well until I started opening and then you're like, I'm going to pitch a fit OBS or OBS is pitching the fit. <laughs> All right, let's get some cool stuff. First more Peko. And cute little Manaphy playing in the waves. This legendary is causing some trouble in chat. <laughs> hard to be and hard to catch. Hey, baby shiny Bottleby. I didn't even call it a reverse holo today. Look at me being on top of my job. As I once again proceed to not find the opening of the sleeve. Every time. It takes me two tries. Back in there. All guys coming out with the code card. <laughs> We've got Reverse Hollow Lux Ray, Volcanion, and then Ball Guy. Evital, amazing rare, Sugoi. I just put all the rest of the cards in the wrong pile. Ooh. I'm doing good tonight. I'm doing good tonight, Colin. <laughs> I'm proud of you. <laughs> I believe in you. Yep. Dominoes. Stay, stay, stay. There you go, ball guy. Come back as a reverse haul if you want in the reverse hollow pile. Yeah, I really wish they would do more amazing rares. Hopefully there'll be more in future sets. It just seems like such a weird thing. Like they spend all this time like breaking out of the frame with rainbow swirls and stuff, and then they're just like, Yeah, we're only gonna make seven. That's it. Reverse Indeedee, and Indeedee V, Sugoi. It's been a night for double Indeedees. I 
Also, I definitely feel like they have to make more amazing rares because they make one amazing rare per type, but with the uh, August set that they're bringing the dragon type back, they don't have an amazing rare for dragon. Oh yeah, we're only six and a half hours in, Alex. We typically go 10 to 12, so we are still opening. Reverse Rillaboom and Dreadnaw. All right, coming away with, careful now not to knock them over. Amazing Rare Yvetal, Baby Shiny Bunnelby in DDV. And Hollows and Reverses. Soon you get hundreds of in DDV, gotta start a book of them. You know, that'd be a cool collection. Going no bulk. I know Colin has some awesome pages of, like, Pikachus and, like, a whole bunch of other cards and stuff that there's, like, a whole bunch of different ones of. It looks really sweet in a binder. Alright, just in time for an exhibition match. retro game shop and you found vintage packs jungle and rocket honestly like that vintage they're probably still worth something even if they are damaged that's like stumbling across buried treasure all right uh samantha's turn oh excuse me got the hiccups going on exhibition match time And then we'll do some personal packs afterward. Okay. Here we go. All right, let's get six packs of battle styles. Best of luck. One, two, three, four, five, six. Here we go. good first step. Do you guys think you would want to sell them or like keep them for a collection? All right, come on, Battle Styles. Let's see those big ones. Uncommon, not hollow. Come on, Battle Styles. But yeah, I don't think being in the storage and heat would hurt them too badly. Like, every other pack of those sets has been around for, like, 20 years, so... Krigatoon v. Sigoy! Sigoy! Three points. I definitely don't think it would uh, lower their value any. It always amazes me, like, so, like, were they, like, in a box somewhere? Like, under another box? Or, like, they fell behind? Or... Your bell, not hollow. Well, one more. Um, if you wanted to post them in the Discord, that'd be a good place. Yeah, I'm sure people would go crazy to see those in Discord. You might even get some opinions on value. I'm not sure. Uncommon and non hollow. Uh, oh, battle styles. Half asleep over here. Oh, well, Cricketune V from that round. Darn, that was rough. You were in a cardboard box with baseball. Well, that would be how you would lose. Like, I'm always wondering, like, how people suddenly discover these ones. I'm like, I, I would know what I had, but yeah, no, if it's in the wrong box, that would definitely do it. All right. Well, six packs of Sun and Moon for you as well. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, Sun and Moon. 
Your turn. Let's see something awesome. Here's your board. Thanks for the follow. I think the three best ways of trying to sell vintage packs. One, check eBay sold listings to kind of get an idea of what the value is. Sold exclusively, there's a little checkbox down there so you can make sure that they were actually things people paid for and not people, one million dollars a pack kind of a thing. <laughs> um, checking TCG players, also probably a good one, although those are maybe out of the range TCG players are useful for, because they're not exactly a uh, common thing to find. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure they're on there. Yeah. And then I think I've heard of several, like, card expos, trading card expos kind of a thing happening now, so that might be an option to... I mean, it uh, sounds like they've got a shop, so they yeah. probably just sell them at their shop. Yeah, that would work, too. Eagleith Hollow. Come on, Sun and Moon. Aw, cute emote. Cruiser board. Oh, nice, King. Awesome. Your Yu-Gi-Oh collection is worth more than you thought. <laughs> that was me in my childhood collection. I was like, <laughs> oh, what do you mean I actually have something of value in here? Pre-Marina GX. Segoy. Segoy. That's super cool. All right, looks like Pre-Marina GX and the Hollows for that one. Kino, thank you for the follow. I think the biggest thing that he does to the cards is you'd be able to tell through the packaging because I think it does the potato chipping or warping or what's the other term for it? Waffling. I don't know. <laughs> but basically where the card like bends. They like curls. They look they look like Pringles. That's the best way to say it. <laughs> Zelda Hime, time to go to sleep. Sounds good. Have a good night. Thanks for being here. Alright, Sebastian going in on an exhibition match next. But because they're sealed packs and things, they, they're protected from a lot of environmental conditions. So they're often really well off regardless. One, two, three, four, five, six. Best of luck, here we go. Uncommon, not hollow. In. Hollow Steel Linux, two points. Alright, we gotta give somebody we got, somebody's gotta give Van like a run for his money. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Punch Crow Uncommon. Colossal, two points. Hey, Whooper. Uh, let's see how long have we been gone. We've pulled a bunch of alt arts. Uh, Van is just like cleaning up the exhibition match. Uh, <laughs> what else have we done? Nicholas has given Van a run for their money, though. Oh, that's true. Flapple V Max. So uh, going. Four points. And Sebastian. Working on it. Up and coming threat. <laughs> <laughs> But yep, so far, four B prize cards have been claimed. When we hit ten, we'll be giving away one of those rainbow bees to one of our first ten prize winners. Uh, no points from that one. Last pack. What do we got? I think pulls is a pretty solid section to put them in. You pulled them out of a box. Brooks-ish. Uncommon. Come on. Uh, hello! Segoy! I don't know what that noise was that I just made. It was like, oh! Excitement scream <laughs> of intelligibility. Two points, Segoy! 
Woo! We did it! We got that 10 points. We also got this flap will be max. And yes, Finfreak, we will have the newest Jumbo cards on the site. We actually got a little bit more of them than we normally do, but we have not received them yet. We so. always seem to get them slower than other stores for whatever reason. <laughs> ah, but as soon as we have them, we definitely will put them up. Yep. All right, Sebastian, congrats. Let's get you a prize card from the B-Box. Um, yes, our exhibition matches are similar to a pack battle, except for it's like a one-person pack battle. So you're kind of fighting an NPC. In this case, it's uh, B, the gym leader. All right, for your prize, Ooh, Rainbow Stonejourner! Segoy! Segoy! Stonejourner VMAX, I should say. Oh, look at his little rock hat. It's very cute. <laughs> <laughs> Congrats! You did it! You did it! Alright, Sebastian also entered into the running for that Rainbow B. You go over there, you go over there. Oh, you got some gym challenge packs too. Nice. Alright, Van! Time for another round. Let's go! Exhibition match. Yeah, most of those, those packs look solid. Like, those do not look damaged, so. One, two, three, four, five, six. Definitely update us when you, uh, if you do find buyers for those, because that is cool. Time to actually strike out. I guess we'll see. Here we go. Good luck. Ente, reverse rare, one point. So go on. Uh, not hollow. My luck does not hold out like this, does it? Uh, common, not hollow. <laughs> if anyone wants to buy them, let me know. <laughs> nice, nice. Uncommon, hollow steelix, two points. There you go. Single strike or Shifu, Segoy. Segoy. Uh, three points. <laughs> We're not done yet, man. Uncommon. Yon Hala. All right, Battle Styles, you can do it. <laughs> All right, last pack. We got, we've got Shinx coming. Oh, well, I guess you were right. Looks like we are ending up at six points. Getting that single strike or Shifu V and the hollows. Well, darn. I wanted you to go crazy, keep on going, but it was super fun. In the script, page 32. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh no, Van has struck out. It's been a good run. <laughs> <laughs> All right, um, it really has been a good run for you though tonight, Van. I'm super happy for your polls. Um, okay, Victor, you are up next. Oh. Don't know where that one is. Oh, yeah, no, I already have it. Should be 818. Oh, I must not have printed that one. Okay, that makes sense. Alright, Victor's got 3, 6, 9, 12 packs of Hidden Fates. Um, Kratos, do you still get to keep your cards? But no draws. 
Yes, that's correct. So all the packs that you open, you get to keep all of your hits, or all the bulk if you so choose. Um, yeah, you just don't get extra prize cards. What did I say? 12? Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Yeah, and ties do equal a win for the challenge. Hidden Fates time! Let's do this! Alright, well we pulled Leafeon and Mewtwo from our last batch, so that means... Umbreon and Charizard, maybe? <laughs> I don't know. Onyx GX! Sugoi! The Onyx Uprising. Also, if any of you follow Steven, SJM, on Instagram, you need to go look at his post. And also notice, like, the perfect shuffle in the background. It's very funny. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow! Full Art Mewtwo! Sugoi! Oh, Victor! Congrats! It's been a good night for Mewtwo's. Mm. Good card. Pricey guy. Very nice. Getting our green Mewtwo. All right, what else you got? Hidden Fates, that's exciting. Magnezone, baby shiny. So good. I mean, they were admittedly like half of a rainbow all together normally, so you know, <laughs> more colors just as better. What are the entries for again? So that's for our free viewer giveaway. So our little shuffle today. Oh, down they go. Stay, please. What you got? Pincer GX. Savoy. Savoy. Last pack. Water, reverse energy from that Savoy. last one. Mewtwo takes the cake for this round. Such a good one. Congratulations. We got Pinsir. We got Buzzwool, Baby Shiny. 
Onyx GX and the Rainbow Birds Trio. Sick boy. Lots of good things. Uh, we got your hollow pile as well. And let's see, no bulk. Okay. And up next, Noe. Shining Fates time. One, two, three, four, five, six packs. Best of luck. Luxray Hollow. <laughs> I was wondering. I said I was done two orders ago. Ball. All right, come on, Shining Fates. We are shining, hun shiny hunting. See the good stuff. <laughs> Man, oh, Galarian Rune Regus. So boy. Baby shiny. I just wanted to say thank you, Colin and Ghost, tonight. So much fun. Oh, I'm so glad. We had a blast pulling, too. Oh, yeah. You're giving me, like, a panic attack here with all your good pulls there, man. <laughs> in a good way. In a good way. Last one. <gasps> oh my goodness! Oh, no, wait. no way! Oh, tonight oh, is amazing! Wow! Oh, Noe, I'm so glad you went for this order. That is such a good pull. Oh, wow. Well, that's where all the luck in that set <laughs> went. Wow, 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 wow. Okay. Suck. Oh. I, just, I don't have any words for this. It's so, it's that awesome. Been chasing Charizard. Sorry. Your first Charizard. Right. Oh. Now, if you can calm down, you can go to sleep in peace. You might have to wait for the adrenaline to die off. But... I was going to say, yeah. <laughs> oh, no, you did it. All right, um, let's see if we can get him straight. Oh, go okay. Not really. Let's see, how's this centering? Um, he's not perfect, but he's beautiful, so that's what matters. Best stream ever. <laughs> ah, shucks. So go Ah, oh, we got the shiny Charizard VMAX from Shining Fates. Charizard, ever the drama king or queen. Wanting to, be, wanting to be the uh, last pack. <laughs> oh, Spectrum's got our Charizard counter updated. Thank you. Also pulling that Galarian Runarigas. Slightly less exciting, but, you know, he's, he's kind of weird in a cool way. <laughs> oh, congrats, congrats. Oh, goodness. I am so happy for you. All right, go in no bulk for that. I spoke too early saying not my best. You have no idea how much I enjoy stream lag sometimes. It's like, I just pulled a Charizard and he has no idea. Yeah. Oh boy, here it comes. <laughs> for the next 15 seconds, no one but us knows. <laughs> It's fun though when I have good surprises for people. I was like, hee 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 hee, good things are coming! I wonder if this is kind of what like parents feel like on Christmas. They're like, I have a good thing for you, you're yeah. gonna love yeah. it! I can see it, I can see it. <laughs> Alright, whew, that was fun.
When the shining fades out, glass hidden fades. You know, sometimes. All right, Mike, your turn next for a gym challenge. All right, let's take a look and see what we have. Cyndaquil taking on Morty. There we go. We are going in with Battlestar. Been free five months. Resubscribing with Prime. Thank you. Let's go. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six packs. Here we go. Good luck. Seems to be the uh, the least favorite this season. Oh, we got a few. Uncommon. Hollow Cherim, two points. Steelix, reverse rare, one point. Did you open the door or the fridge? The fridge? Oh, I swear I heard you open the door. No. I'm like, where are you going? <laughs> Just opening the fridge. I'm hearing things. Common, non hollow. Alright, here we go, Battle Styles. Need a few more points from you. Big pulls. Uncommon. Oh, non hollow rare. Come on, Battle Styles. Last one. We've got Mr. Rhyme. Reverse rare, one point. Sigoy. And. Octillery hollow for two points. Oh, no. Oh. So close. We were getting there. Sadly, ending off with six points. <sighs> Rough. Let's see, up next, Jose. Gym challenge and uh, terrarium as well. Yes, that question. Um, will the gym leader challenge be in season during chilling rain? Uh, yes. We're not sure when we'll be able to add chilling rain packs to the gym challenge, if that makes sense, like having them as an option to fight with. Hopefully after like a couple weeks, but we will be running the gym challenge during chilling rain. Yep. The season that ends, I think, just before Evolving Skies comes out, early uh, August, so. We just need to open a few packs of Chilling Rain and make sure that the set is still balanced and fair with the other sets as well. And it doesn't just, like, pull like crazy and we're like, oh, you buy Chilling Rain, you automatically win. That's no fun. Okay, uh, what do we have for Jose? Uh, Jose has... I believe this is their first challenge. Oh, hello. I'm not reading. <laughs> Jose, we've got Cyndaquil for you. And Battle Styles. All right, very first gym challenge. Um, I said Battle Styles, didn't I? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, and more. Six. I heard something fall. Where'd it go? It might be underneath the. Oh, I'll get that later. What's but that? all the sets that we have for the gym challenge have pretty much the same like hit rates and score rates and stuff like that. Um, things like Champion's Path, because you're guaranteed a hollow every pack, like, those are guaranteed 12 points. Those don't appear in the gym challenge, because those <laughs> are unbalanced, mm -hmm. so. Alright, good luck, here we go! Uncommon, 
uncommon non hollow. Common. Corviknight V. Segoy. Segoy. Three points. Sets, I believe we've had every set beat every, like, first through eighth gym leader at some point or another, so. Uh, no points there. Steelix Hollow, two points. Good boy. What you got? Reverse rare, sent to scorch, one point. Sego boy. And Empoleon V, three points. Sego boy. Well, this sent to scorch was not disappointing, sent to scorch no, this time, earning like the winning points. <laughs> reverse bacon is good. All right, last one for you. Uncommon and non hollow. Corviknight V, Empoleon V, and of course the win with nine points. Segoy. Noe with the gift sub. Thank you so much. Segoy. Let's see. Um, no book. Gift sub going to Muslim. That's super nice. You win! <laughs> <laughs> yes. Alright, um, prize card for ya. Looks like Wombat, baby shiny. So goy. So goy. It's all green. Love it. Say, now you get access to all the Segoy emotes, and you have <laughs> Gengars, and all that good stuff. Alright, um, we also have a Terrarium for Jose as well. Collection 2. Also, with that gift sub, you also now have access to this month's sub giveaway. That Sabrina and Alakazam pair. Here we go. Oh, well. Looks like our figure coming out first. We've got Articuno for this one. Segoy. Oh, so pretty. It's just the decorative ice inside here. But, getting our Kuno, congrats! But it looks super cool. Yeah. I feel like the exciting part is Articuno. And also it works as a pun. Oh. <laughs> ah, ghosts with your puns! I haven't said one for a while tonight. <laughs> We've been building up inside of you. All right, uh, Samantha up next. Shining Fates and an exhibition match. My joke output tonight has been a little underwhelming. No. <laughs> <laughs> Start off with your Shining Fates. Best of luck. Hey, full art double. Segoy. Segoy. Shiny sheep. Also, not only um, do we have one sub giveaway for those two cards on the USA side, but I believe Ashley, a 
on the Japan side has a sub giveaway this month. Is it a, one of the DV boxes this month, or is it a card? I honestly do not know. <laughs> I think I heard someone mention it was one of the EV boxes. Oh, nice. That That's might be cool. another giveaway. We do a lot of giveaways here. <laughs> uh, but yeah, if anybody hasn't met our um, our sister stream team, more like cousin, she's my cousin. Cousin stream team. <laughs> but we do have two stream teams streaming to the same channel. We have us here with Bari Bari USA, and then we have... Ashley and Ginkgo that stream on the weekends that do Japanese cards. So if you're subscribed to the channel, you're automatically entered into both the sub giveaways because we each have one. Um, but yeah, if you like Japanese cards, uh, highly recommend tuning in on the weekends. Uh, they live just outside of Tokyo, so they have uh, first person access to all the Japan cards. It's fun times. All right, getting that filler, double, and no bulk. Okay, so it's the Espeon VMAX Alt Art promo that's from the special box. Ooh, that is a good giveaway. All right, I think Samantha needs some justice against B here. I think this is your third time. Gotta get you a victory. Revenge! <laughs> Alright, let's do this. Six packs of Bat Styles. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold up, is that, is that an alt account for that follow? Rico Swap. <laughs> mm, mm. Is that you, Jose? Thanks for the follow, regardless. <laughs> All right, here we go. Good luck. Orbital reverse rare, one point. Segoy. Yeah, stick hollow, two points. Segoy. Ooh, and then Kratos coming up has a first time gym challenge or first time exhibition challenge. Oh, nice. Carnivine Uncommon. Hollow Snake, Sandaconda. There we go, hi. Two points. Galarian, Mr. Rhyme, Reverse Rare. There we go, hi. One point. Not hollow. Chisaru, common. Tapu Koko VMAX! Segoi Revenge! <laughs> Four <laughs> points for the VMAX! With a two-pack victory lap, even. Yes! There we go. That's what we need. Taco Arms, saving the day. The follow wasn't you? You have a twin. Well, then, welcome to the new Rico. Thank you for the follow. Also, let me introduce you to our other Rico. Empoleon V, Segoy! Segoy! Three points. All right, we did it! Empoleon V and Tapu Koko VMAX. Plus the uh, hollows as well. Congrats! All right, that brings our total winners of B prize cards up to six. Ooh, we're getting there. We're getting there. Four more victories, and we'll give away Rainbow <laughs> B to one of you. All right, let's uh, get you a prize card. Ooh, full art Zamacenta V. Sagoy. We got Shield Doggo. Let's add one more to that. Uh, that sounds good to me. <laughs> yeah, like I'm game. Let's do it. <laughs> My apologies for the confusion there. 
It just sounded familiar. So, welcome, welcome to the stream. Sorry, what were you saying, Ghost? Since there's only ten winners for this one, we can use the wheel! We can use the wheel. I might have to set it up. Alright, well, we're gonna reset here. And go on to our next gym challenge. This one for Kratos. Is it Sujay? Am I saying that right? Feel free to correct me, absolutely. But we've got six packs of Battle Styles for you. One, two, three, four, five, six. Best of luck, let's do it. Kratos is fine. Sounds good. We got a spoiler in there. Colossal Reverse, one point. Segoy. And Flapple V. Segoy. Three points for V's. Um, DeRoy, do you get in? Sorry, not sure what you're referring to. Uh, if you're looking for packs and things that we're opening on stream, all of that is through our online shop. If you're looking for like the viewer giveaway, you are already entered, so no worries there. Reverse Bolton, one point. Segoy. Yep, do note that these are exhibition matches, which are slightly different for different products on the store than the gym challenge. Scrum Pig. Tapu Bulu Hollow, two points. Segoy. Curious to see our personal collections. They're actually not that big. <laughs> well, we've got some old original stuff. I used to have that, but I think it got sold in a move or something. So I sadly don't have all my originals. I have the original jars are. I'm so sad. Reverse rare, one point. Segoy. I honestly just barely started up collecting again. So. <laughs> Yep, I, I get all of my satisfaction opening packs for other people. I feel very lucky. Uh, uncommon, not hollow. Right, come on, Battle Styles. Last one. Now or never. What you got? You can do it. Got Entei Reverse, one point. Segoy. All right, one more. Come on, first timer's luck. Oh, oh, big teeny full art. Segoy. Well, I think that uh, that definitely qualifies. Segoy. Oh my goodness, I left this out. This is. Oh, right, the prize card. I'm so sorry. <laughs> All right, full art Victini, four points. Segoy. There we go. All right, getting those hollows plus the flapple V. Congrats. And going no bulk. Never too late to start collecting them. Still see you need to get me an alt art Titar. Mm. <laughs> Maybe one day. Alright, let's get you a prize from the B Box. <laughs> Can I open the seventh card for my win card? Seventh card. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Looks like Pokey Kid. Segoy. Segoy. We've got our full art supporter there. Pokemon Company really just needs to start selling these Eevee onesies, you know? <laughs> or at least just like a hoodie that Adult has Eevee Adult size Eevee onesies, please. <laughs> <laughs> and, you know, six foot three size, you know? <laughs> yeah! Oh, 
Okay. Here we go. So what is that? Down to three before we do the yep, we rainbow have drawing? Seven entries so far for the first rainbow bee. Soon, soon. Alright. Alright, up next. Hark. I don't know if I know your name, so welcome, welcome. We've got Hidden Fates and Shining Fates personals. Ooh, best of luck with the shiny hunt. Here we go, three of each. Here is some Shining Fates. Here's some Hidden Fates. Uh, Henny Chesney, is that you? Are you Hark? Best of luck. Zard or bust. Okay. We've got Greedent. A little ways off from a Zard. <laughs> Segoy, though. Segoy. We pulled one Zard tonight. Let's pull a second. Seriously. White Rice Dylan. Welcome. Segoy indeed. We got Baby Shiny Scent Scorch. Segoy. Alright, getting closer. We got a fire type. <laughs> yes, bacon command. Oh wait, stream delay is longer tonight. My apologies. Oh no, I think we're okay. <laughs> Zold and Skyla. Ooh, Ooh nice. Double Segoy. How do we feel about supporters? Skyla's pretty nice. Top loader for Arc Desolt. We're cool with that one. <laughs> Sounds good. <laughs> Alright, here's a uh, hidden face time. Oh, baby shiny Eevee! Sure We have even more Shining Fates. Do I only do two? You did three packs. It's a six. <gasps> I'm so sorry! Thank you for catching that ghost. Yep, no problem. <laughs> Alright, we'll come but back and baby circle. baby Shiny Eevee! We will circle back around for a round two. How's that? I was gonna say, Eevee goes in front and center. <laughs> Puff, Giovanni's Exile. Segoy. Segoy. Getting a good mix of supporters as well. How did I read that? So wrong. I just probably read the three twice. King's Gone and Electrode. All right, let's get our round two Shining Fates. Three more. Here we go. I have plenty of Eevees, thank you very much. <laughs> Cinderace VMAX. Segoy. I don't know how to feel about their Gigantamax forms. They are kind of oddballs to me. I, mean, I feel like they're Gigamax forms that are maybe, like, for just in general, or the starters? The, the starters. Because the starters, like, they, they look almost the same, just big. Like, they didn't Have get, like, a weird... Have you seen their, or their Gigantamax forms? I thought they were, I thought they were almost exactly the same. Galarian Darumaka! Sugoi! Sugoi! Okay, I gotta look on Bolopedia to see if there's significant differences that I missed. We got the little snow cone guy. Oh no, apparently they are very different, yes. 
I never realized from the cards that his ears are like three times the length of his body and he stands on a giant fireball. <laughs> yeah. Maybe they're kind of weird. I never saw them in game, so I just didn't realize. I feel like they came out later, but. I don't know. Sniper Tower for Inteleon. Oh, yeah, okay, I remember the Inteleon one. I never realized it was his tail from the cards either, because they focus on the top part. Alright, so we've got no bulk. We've got our hollows here. Nice hits. We got Skyla, Baby Shiny Eevee, Cinderace, Baby Bacon Bug, Green Vent. Yeah, I missed out. Really got kind a of massive drum set in like 400 mile long vine arms. There we go. Congrats on those. Happy for the first time. Segoy. Beginner's luck, yes. Yeah, that, that baby shiny Eevee is a nice hit. Mm -hmm. That is one of the uh, top three most in demand baby shinies of the entire Hidden Fate set. Oh, nice. Kratos opened a. Wait, a gold Rillaboom? Ooh, is it... nice. I didn't think Rillaboom was in Chilling Rain. Wait, is it chilling? the Intellion? In Intellion? All right, Lunar, up next. Exhibition match. All right, let's get that battle styles going. One, two, three, four, five, six. Best of luck, Lunar. We need that 10 points. Let's do it. Common, uh, non hollow, such scorch. Don't remember which pack. Weekend was a blur of drunk Pokemon rips. Uh, maybe I want to say Dark News Ablaze for a Rillaboom, but still, Gold Rillaboom. Good pull. Come on, Battle Styles. Yeah, it's Secret River from Darkness. Uh, Mega Lol. So this is an exhibition match. Slightly different from our gym challenge. Uh, same style, but the starters are not in the exhibition match. Come on. Come on, Battle Styles. Let's see what you got. Colossal Hollow, two points. Segoy. I haven't missed anything, have I? Oof, no. That's not right. just being mean. But yeah, because the exhibition challengers can come from any region, you don't really have your region starter to fight them with. Oh, we got an altar! Segoy! Segoy! It's not a win, but what's up with the last card, Altars? Last card, Altars. Last card, Charizards. It has been a last pack magic. Oh, finally. that's a good pull. Uh, four points. Empoleon V Altars. I think the only Altar we have not pulled tonight, then, is Rapid Strike V Full Art 1. Because we pulled the Single Strike 1 twice. Uh -huh. We pulled both of the V-Maxes, we right. pulled T-Tar, we pulled Empoleon. We're only missing wow. one Altar tonight. That's insane! First uh, Altar! Nice! Oh, Congrats, Lunar! I count it as a win. Not an official win. It's a win in our hearts. Here's Colin, just pouring on the cheese. Yep, we had a sleep in <laughs> T-Tar today. Oh, so many Altars. Alright, alt art day. Crazy. Should we try for the last alt art? I mean, I'm in if you guys are. <laughs> uh, let's see, up next, we got Noe with some Shining Fates. Here's hoping it's as good as last time. One, two, three, four, five, six. 
Good luck. Here we go. Didn't know Kinker was making nachos. <laughs> Don't you know? I supply the cheese. <laughs> <laughs> to be our mandatory whale. Where have you been? <laughs> nice. Two amazing rares down. Sidui, baby shiny. Sick boy. Man, he was so hard for us to pull. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the last card in the set in Shining Fates that we needed was the Sidui. <laughs> Mr. Mime and Cinderace V. Double Segoy. Hey, <laughs> Buttercup with the resub. Segoy. Three muds. Thanks, Buttercup. Fresh and saw this pop up. Pop up. So go away. <laughs> Alright, getting some reverse hollows as well. Going uh, no bulk. I gotta say, your uh, sub badge is uh, very stylish. <gasps> yes. It's beautiful. <laughs> Calling to make bad puns too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Alright, getting a couple of bees. Cinderace, more Peko. Uh, a couple of baby shinies, Galarian Mr. Mime, and Decidueye, plus the Kyogre Amazing Rare. Can't get rid of me. <laughs> we would never want to get rid of you. You're just too much fun. <laughs> Alright, not bad at all. Okay. Chris, your turn. Gym challenge. First gym challenge for Chris. All right. Going with Cyndaquil and Steam Siege taking on Faulkner. Was there another claim sale? I feel like she just did a claim sale like last week, but I guess that was a couple weeks ago. Uh, yeah, she's doing one uh, right before the Chilling Rain release. Oh, right, this is her uh, first pre order claim sale thing. Yeah. Or you have a number for it. Pokemon Anonymous. I don't, but we can be your support group if you need it. <laughs> <laughs> I think we'd be a very bad support group for that, though. Yeah, true. I guess we're all just in trouble then. <laughs> all right, Steam Siege. One, two, three, four, five, six. Pre claim sale, that's the phrase. Best of luck, here we go. Very bad, yes. Uh, we, we try not to encourage people to do bad things, but here we are. Still collecting. Oh, gym battle, what am I doing? Infernape, reverse rare, one point. Segoy. And we have Eveltal Hollow, two points. Segoy, Segoy. We're over here like, Essentials and bills come first. 
And then Pokemon. Yep. All Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> Common and non hollow. There is no number four. <laughs> <laughs> We have a problem, and the solution is just one more pack. I knew it! <laughs> Uncommon, not hollow. It's like scrolling through Facebook. It's never enough. Until you realize you've been on it for too many hours. Um, uncommon, not hollow. On Steam Siege. Way there, three more points. We got Hydreigon breaks. Oh so boy. boy! We got one point for the break. Regular jump left. All right, last one. Come on, Steam Siege. You can do it. We believe. Gavantula, reverse rare. Ooh. One point. Sugoi. Oh, I see something. We've got Mega Gardevoir. Sugoi. Sugoi. Three Victory. points. Don't have a break card. Nice. First one. They're kind of cool. Mega Gardevoir and the Hydreigon break. Sugoi. Sugoi. With the last pack of magic. You know, it is a trend tonight. Well, the jump, ch jump challenges are always like that. They are always like, let's raise the suspense, and then the last pack. <laughs> uh, going with no bulk. All right. Faulkner Prize. From our flying type box. Is that Mega Gardevoir, Shiny? I think so. Uh, yes. It, uh, it is Shiny. I feel like a lot of the Megas uh, were shiny cards. We got Celestia GX. Sigoy. I think it was mostly the Gyarados and the Gardevoir, but maybe the other ones? I a lot of them are shiny. Uh, I'm not sure. Alright, we got Flying Bamboo Lady for the prize. All right, we've got Hark up next with the Mega Charizard Chaser Bundle. Ooh, I'm excited. Ooh, we're opening up Evo again. And we finally got some more Evo back, so they Mega Charizard Bundles are now the full form. Six packs. Every one of them it's having a here. chance for a Charizard. And a couple of them having a chance for multiple Charizards. Thank you guys for the follows. Soxy and Tor Torres. Thank you guys. One, two, three, four, five, six. Here we go. Uh, Champions, Darkness, Evo, Burning Shadows, Shining Fates, Hidden Fates. Good luck. Reverse Water Energy, my champion's path, always and forever. <laughs> <laughs> Should you do more Mega Shinies? If not, then because they are cool cards. Mm -hmm. I think they are moving away from the Megas with the V Maxes, but maybe next gen. Interesting to see what they've got up their sleeves. Welcome, Haywood. Magnemite. Ton. Ton. Every time. <laughs> also, was there a secret rare in the back there, or did I just see mm -hmm. the wrong thing? I thought I saw a Jesse and James. Nope, it was oh, a Misty. Misty. I just see Jesse and James everywhere. They <laughs> haunt me. Like a ghost? I guess. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty bad. 
But I went for it. <laughs> and that is how my, I, I do all of my bonds. <laughs> well, this sounds terrible. Everyone else now suffers with me. <laughs> Alright, it's up to the fates. You got a Zard for us. Energy. Oh man, rough packs. A couple of reverse energies, and we got that Magneton rare. And that Hitmon Lee reverse, or Hitmon Chan reverse. It's true, it was a rare. We are in the habit of sleeving Evo, uh, Evo rares just because they seem to be bouncing up and down in value, so just in case. And the rares in Evo seem to be worth, like, Vs plus in every other set. <laughs> it's a wild ride. I'm going no book. Man. All right. Um, Lunar up next. Uh, no, you just might might just be me, but I think all those are great. Yeah, I feel like it kind of depends on where you are at in your collection. Because if you're just down to, like, the really rare hits, then it could be a bit of a bummer. But, if you get lots of holes in your collection, you're just like, sweet, more cards. <laughs> Alright, Lunar, here we go. Exhibition match. One, two, three, four, five, six packs, battle styles. Best of luck, here we go. Uncommon, non hollow. One point. So go in. All right, come on, Battle Styles. No points there. Let's get two big packs. Give us a home run. We need a home run. Reverse rare, one point. Segoing. Non hollow. Alright, last one. Reverse rare, one point. Segoing. Oh man. Battle styles. Oh, I was really hoping for one of those like last pack alt arts, you know? Rough nice. battle styles, shame on you. And going no bulk. Hey, at least the victory bell brought a point this time. <laughs> True. It's like Bruxious, like. You know, we don't like seeing it, but when it brings a point, we can at least be like, okay, you're welcome. <laughs> We're canceling Victory Bell after tonight. Mm. <laughs> All in favor. Aye. All right, Justin, your turn next. Doing some hidden fates. What do we got? Three, six, nine, twelve packs. That was a victory bust. <laughs> Uh, One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Eleven and twelve. Alright, Justin, here we go. Oh, starting off with a full art. So going. Yeah, stack attacker. And a Jesse and James. Not the full part, but still a cool one. He's given the beatings. Ooh. <laughs> All 
right, full art vibes. I like it. Type no, baby shiny. Sigoli. Like, you know, I've never really looked at and, inspe and inspected type null, but then again, maybe I don't want to. There's a lot going on with type null. <laughs> Buzzwall, full art shiny. Sigoy. The buff bug. of all my Deku goaded. I have not read the manga. Don't know much about anything past the anime right now. <laughs> Cheaper, that's for sure. Oh, tap dancing Charmander! Sick oh boy! Our little uh little orange dreamsicle Charmander, sick oh boy. One more. from the last one. We got some nice hits. Dance Mander. Love it. <laughs> Dance Mander. That beautiful full art Sylveon. Less beautiful, but you know, still good. <laughs> Buzzwool, full art. We got the birds. And baby shiny gibble. Good things, good things. You know what else is a good thing? Uh, lots of things, but what? 
Talking about shipping, because we have to sometime tonight. I mean, I have to. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good thing, because I don't have to talk about it. Alright, it is a good thing to go over. So, real quick, we're going to talk about shipping. Our shipping policy is a little bit different, uh, so heads up. We hold all of your cards and your purchases with us by default until you tell us that you are ready to have everything packed up all together and sent out. You can hold your cards for pretty much as long as you want. Weeks, months, totally up to you. Up to one year. Um, but whenever you are ready to have it shipped out, immediately or not. Um, there is an item on the shop called Send My Stuff. That is our shipping request and our shipping fee combined in one. Uh, shipping is a flat $5 rate for anywhere inside of the United States. Um, regardless of the weight or the size of the package. Shipping is $10 for anywhere outside of the United States. And that one does have a weight limit of 4 pounds. Uh, it takes about a thousand cards to reach 4 pounds, so... So you got packs with all cards, or, you know, more Yeah, you got without. quite a ways to go until you hit that weight limit. Um, on the off chance that you do hit the weight limit, we will contact you for an additional $10 Send My Stuff fee, um, because we can only send packages up to four pounds. Uh, if, it, um, if it goes over that weight limit, then we'll send you two packages. Um, but yeah, we do all of our packaging on Fridays and Saturdays. And then we send everything to the post office on Monday. So if you uh, do a send my stuff, expect to see your package moving in the mail on a Monday. Hey, Hyperstar! Hey, how's it going, Hyperstar? Thank you for the sub. All right, so that's our shipping spiel. If you have any questions about it, check out the FAQ page. Uh, it does go over it in detail, kind of breaks down some common questions we get about shipping. Yep, and you only have to do a send my stuff request once a week, so if you pick up one for tonight's stream and pick up more packs on Thursday, you're already covered. So, you don't have to do shipping more than one time per week. Uh, so you know we bought packaging tonight, which means mine will be sent out next shipping, correct? Yep. That's correct. Yep, so you are covered for any packs you buy the rest of the night, any packs you buy on Thursday night. Um, do note that the shipping is different between us and Japan, because their cards are in Tokyo, and our cards are in the U.S., so we don't have access to them. So it's a separate fee if you buy cards from Ashley and Ginko. But, but yes, no, your cards will be packaged up Friday and Saturday, and they'll be in the mail Monday. Yeah, because the post Unless office... it's a holiday. I was going to say, the but... post office isn't closed for Father's Day, so I think we're still good. But I think that's next, next Monday. All right, Dylan, up next. Oh, didn't timestamp you. But we have a Mega Charizard Chaser for you. I think earlier you guys were saying you're in... You guys are all in Discord talking about it or betting on it. So good luck. Here it goes. Starting off with Evo. Oh man, it's been a while. Diglett. It is nice to have Evo again, though. <laughs> Alright, striking out with Evo. Next! Desperately hoping someone pulls the shiny Zard from Champions. We seem to struggle with our shiny Zards. I was gonna say, we, we, so we, for those of you who are new to the channel, the way we pulled Zards in Champions Path is when it came out, we were like, we pulled a shiny, then we pulled a rainbow, then we pulled a shiny, then we pulled a rainbow. Like, they never were more than one off of each other. And then the last six or eight. Zars of Charizard we pulled from Champions Path have all been rainbow. <laughs> Disturb the balance. Kyogre, amazing rare, and Cinderace V. Segoy! Can I get Charmander, please? Um, I can find one for you. I will pass this off to Ghost. I have the bulk hunting skills. <laughs> Not like Charmander is hard to find, but it's... <laughs> and Kyogre. Pikachu! 
along with the sad Charmander and Wayne. Oh. Duck, thank you for the follow! And Ryan, welcome. Any Zards today? Yes! We had a shiny face one not too long ago. Alright, getting the Cinderace and the Kyogre. And we did have that Charmander as well. Pikachu. Do we have a Pikachu? Uh, I can get a Pikachu. Yep. No problem. There's a Pikachu. Just to make sure it's the right Pikachu. There sometimes is more than one. Uh, Jacob's turn. Gym challenge time. Uh, what do you have for Jacob? Jacob. Total taking on Whitney. I have Morty. Alright, let me double check. Jacob's last gym challenge. Loading, loading. Um, we had a 7 to 9 victory over Bugsy. Or, sorry, 9 to 7 victory over Bugsy. And then we were defeated by Whitney 4 to 7. Okay. We are still on Whitney. Doesn't hurt to check. Nope. All right. Always good to double check. Battle styles, attack choice. This is why I keep detail records. Best of luck, here we go. Starting off with the Mimic QB, Segoy. Segoy. Three points. Thank you for the follow. Welcome. Artillery reverse rare. One point. Zero. Two points. Segoy. Can I get song ID for this song and the last one? I don't know what the last one was because it's on random. This one is called Cancel Culture by Harris Heller. <laughs> Interesting name. Got a little bit of variety you get on uh, copyright free playlists. <laughs> yeah. Common non hollow. Wait, he cries after losing a pencil. So. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's great. Come on, we're so close. Let's do it, Battle Styles. Uncommon. Oh, there we go. Necrozma V. Segoy. Segoy, three points. We've got a pack for victory lap. Artillery Hollow, two points. Segoy. All right, 11 points. Solid win. Revenge complete against Whitney. <laughs> Couple of psychic hits. Very nice. Whitney box. Dragon. There we go. Congrats. The boys are up next. All right. Oh gosh. 
Is, oh gosh, what is his name? From Gollum? Lord of the Rings, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's a terrifying emote. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Dylan, you are up next. Shining Fates time. One, two, three, four, five, six. Good luck. Let's do it. Oh, frozen balls. <laughs> uh. Oh, Lepris. Sigoy. Full art shiny. So, GDM, welcome. Oh, look at those happy Blastoise emotes. So happy. Oh, the big Boreon. You guys have such good emotes. Love it. Pokey Kid! Sigoy! Sigoy! You got shining fates. Nothing in that one. <laughs> Trap inch twins. Not quite what we're after. So another art for the night. Last pack left. And Zigzagoon, baby shiny. Zigzagoon, or some shiny cuteness that works too. <laughs> All right, well, one out of two for our hits. Not, not too bad. Zigzagoon, Lapras, Full Art, and the Pokey Kid. No book. All right, Jamie, your turn next. Mega Charizard Chaser and also six Shining Fates. Hold the Charizard Chaser. Detective. Mm -hmm. Always missing one. Ah, Burning Shadows. Shining Fades, Hidden Fades, Champions, Evo, Darkness, Spring Shadows. Six. Alright, we're just gonna pull your Shining Fades bundle as well. Since they're both for you. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Best of luck. Here we go. Hunting we shall go! Hunting we shall go! Agron? Oh! Gold Colossal! Sigoy! Sigoy! I love all the crazy stuff we find when we're Zard hunting. <laughs> <laughs> like this! Crazy, just how popular opening Pokemon cards on Twitch. I know, you know, the industry's kind of exploded. It's been around for a long time, years, honestly. Um, but then just recently, probably within the last year, it just really just boom. I was gonna say, Ashley's been doing it for four years, three years, somewhere in that range. Can you say about four? Probably getting close to four, certainly. Does anyone know when the Bari Bari anniversary is? <laughs> we have our actual Bari Bari birthday. Did you can press cold and gold. Oh, you know, it's, it's transmuting. It's a few extra steps, <laughs> but you know. 
Jam or die. I'd love the Pika and Charmander. Sure. Can you uh, find oh, I can for certainly me? not for that. There we go. Well, Gold Colossal. Not a bad pull at all from Zard Bundle. Until about a month ago, I didn't even know opening cards, group breaks, etc. was even a thing. Hey, well, you know, welcome to the community. <laughs> Uh, we got our start, at least uh, Bari Bari USA. Uh, we started on the Bari Bari channel at the beginning of this year, in January. And then before that, we were a separate channel. Double shiny and indeedy. Segoy. We started in August of last year. A Segoy stream, in case you couldn't tell from all of us yelling <laughs> Segoy all the time. Yep, yep. <laughs> But now, uh, Bari Bari Japan, yeah, they, my cousin, she's been doing this for years. It's crazy, but I love it. Toxtricity, Segoy! Segoy! And Giant Hempster, Marpeko VMAX. Let's see, use the wrong PayPal on the shop before. Hopefully I didn't mess it up. Uh, I can certainly take a look. Uh, I mean, as long as your payment clears, you're probably fine. Hamster, hamster. So the, does the different teams mean that this channel is broadcast from either Utah or Japan? Yep. Uh, we're in Utah. They're in Japan. Double in DD. Yeah, we stream every mm -hmm. Tuesday and Thursday. And they stream on the weekends. It's yeah, not uh, super common to share your actual channel. Uh, but since like she's my comment my cousin i i would trust her like with my social security number type of thing <laughs> mm -hmm. so she felt comfortable giving me access and sharing the channel so super grateful to her for that you know honestly hadn't even thought about it <laughs> uh That'd be around the end of the gym challenge, wouldn't it? Because we'd be able to get in August, somewhere in there, like 15th Are August. we talking about Bari Bari anniversary? Are we talking about Segoy anniversary? That's true. We have too many anniversaries now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, Jamie, going with no bulk. Also, we found uh, Charmander and Pikachu. We'll put those in. All right, let's take a look at these good, good cards. I feel like my mouth is running ahead of my brain and it's like, stutter, what are you trying to say? Like, I don't know. Ooh, gold Colossal, very nice. And a couple of NDDVs. <laughs> All right, up next, Dylan. Are we just trading off, <laughs> you guys? <laughs> Dylan going in on some shiny fates. Six packs. One year for you personally, and then one year as party. Just celebrate all the things. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yes, we want the Zard. Fair enough. All right, let's do it. We got Gold Eternatus. Segoy! Not a Zard, but a beautiful card. Oh, they need more of those black and gold cards. Like, 
Seriously. That and amazing rares. They can't just make a couple and stop. They're just too good. <laughs> Watch them. Well, you know, fair, but <laughs> still, they should. Gold and black Eternatus V. the style I want more of. I want more gold and black. It just works so well for so many Pokemon, potentially. It probably does take a lot more work for an artist to figure out, like, okay, I've only got two colors to work with here. But it's just, like, line art. True, true. <laughs> oh, wow! You pulled both of them! <laughs> Segoy! There's a pair! What?! Dylan! Also, wildly enough, this is not the first time we've done this with inside a single order before. <laughs> so oh, good. Oh, goodness. I, I mean, I, I'm glad we are getting some good pulls along our Charizard hunt. Both gold cards from the set. Wow. <laughs> oh, that's fun. Are there more gold cards? Other than those two, just the dogs. Full art for Lynx, shiny. Segoy. Segoy. Are you talking about gold and black? From Shining Fates, I'm trying to think if, if there are other golds in the set. Oh. Mm. Um, noob here. <laughs> no nope, worries. Just those two. Charizard, is Charizard a valuable card in every Pokemon set? Most of them, yes. Yeah. I think it's fair to assume that most. Like, full art Charizards are... They're up there. Yeah, and even <laughs> if they're not, like, a full art or they're one of the, like, over $100 valuable Charizards, they're worth more generally than another card of their same rarity. We got Chinchino, Baby Shiny. Segoy. Like, Vivid Voltage just has a regular rare or reverse hollow rare Charizard, and even that one is worth more than any other regular rare or reverse rare in that set. So. Zensington, I did see the Willard Pool floaty! I wish I had a pool to use it in. But since I don't have a pool, I probably won't get it. And sadly, most of the water parks I know of, they don't let you take external floaties in. Alright, uh, no bulk. Here we go, Chinchino, Full Art for Lynx, and our Gold Eternatuses. I don't know if that's the proper plural, but we're going with it. Eternity. Eternity. There you go. Gold Eternity. So welcome, Microstar. There's only the two of us tonight. Unless it's haunted. I thought that was your I job. I mean, I am a ghost, so... <laughs> uh, Sir Ryan, question. If you are a collector, should you buy single packs or boxes? Um... I feel like that's kind of personal preference. I mean, boxes have kind of an average hit rate, so... You're not guaranteed, but better chance of at least getting that hit rate. Single packs, as long as they're not weighable, they could be totally random. Single cards, on the other hand, like, at least you're guaranteed to get your collection. But, kind of up to you. Like, if you enjoy opening packs, go for it. If you have a budget, I don't know. Hey, there's our chat bomb. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry about that, we have a lot of commands. <laughs> oh man, do we have a fifth one now? Wait, one, two, three, four, five. There's six of them <laughs> now. Wow, that's grown. All right, um, Hark, up next. 12 packs of Shining Fates. Up in the ante here. Just make your kitty pool of water energy with the whale arts floaty. Right. Eight. Uh, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 12. Also, for the uh, question about the Charizard cards, is that the only Pokemon that gets a kind of treatment every set? Um, for the most part, Charizard stands out. Um, full art supporters have been something that, you know, has higher value than most in recent years, or recent year. It often happens to Pikachu as well. Mmm, that's a good one, yeah. I feel like those are the special ones. 
But I feel like there's a lot more Pikachus, so not quite as often. Yeah, and then to a lesser extent, the other two uh, Kanto starters, the Venus or Bulbasaurs and Squirtles and stuff, often are slightly more. But we got Phalanx, baby shiny. Mewtwo. I think Mewtwo is a little bit higher than average. It's like this is our first big legendary. <laughs> What is a supporter? So those are like the people cards. Uh, like this guy, it says supporter up in the corner. Um, if it's a person, it's gonna be a supporter. So it's your favorite gym leaders or characters from the games and stuff and they get their own card. And so people are like, oh, I know all about that person because they're like my favorite gym leader. And so those cards tend to be. Hey, ditto. So <laughs> Shiny ditto. Obviously, Venusaur is the better one. You Venusaur fan. Venusaur definitely doesn't get enough love, though. I feel like Blastoise, like, sometimes, but Venusaur, poor Venusaur is just like, meh. <laughs> Admittedly, poor Venusaur kind of got screwed with their game max form. Like, Blastoise has a, like, entire wall of cannons <laughs> on his back, and... The other Venusaur is like, you can't see him because his flower is so big. We got Pokey Kid, Segoy! Segoy! Yeah, this is another supporter card. Uh, this one's like a full art supporter because uh, the picture goes all the way through the card. Uh, the one I showed you earlier, that was not a full art because it was only the picture in the little box at the top. Basically, popular first gen Pokemon and supporters. No, yeah, I feel that's like a safe summary. Yeah, there's always a few cards in each set, like some are harder to pull than others, or some are, you know, just a more popular Pokemon, like Lucario's are pretty popular and stuff like that. So. Eldegas, baby shiny. But, you know, for the general trends, if you want like a big sweeping overview, that's pretty much the... <laughs> Blastoise best boy. He's awesome. I was always a water starter person myself. Unless Rowlet. Then Rowlet. <laughs> uh, I feel like everybody's got to start somewhere, right? Reshiram and Ball Guy. Segoy. Segoy. Lots of hits for Hark. But yeah, we are always more than happy to answer questions and stuff like that. Yep, yep. Because if you're asking the question, there's other people in chat wondering the same thing, and they learn when you ask. One for two hit rate. And we're not even done. Stone Journer, baby shiny. Oh boy. Hi, sis. Good morning. Welcome, welcome, and good morning. Oh, jeez, I just realized it was midnight here. <laughs> Full art shiny. Segoy. Wish, wish, wish the Sword and Shield games made Ball Guy the secret boss battle with all level 100. Oh, that would have been so cool. I mean, they could still do it. I'm sure they're not done with all the DLCs yet. I would also like this. I just wanted there to be more depth to Ball Guy's like secrets and stuff. There just wasn't. Alright, last one for this round. Cinderace V. Sigoy. Soccer bunny. Oh, Sonic just realized I did a dumb today. Okay. 
So the uh, Shining Fates hit draft break that was supposed to go up a couple hours ago, mm -hmm. it, it went up, but uh, all of the uh, spots had zero inventory, so it didn't appear. <laughs> <laughs> My okay. bad, I fixed that. If anyone's interested in a draft break, we have that one available. I'm actually taking down the Hidden Fates one because we had four slots remaining in that one, so get a refund for those spots. Alright, there you go. Who's up next? Dylan! Another round for Dylan. Uh, hidden Fates this time. Looks like I've got two orders, both for you, so we'll do all six at the same time. One, two, three, four, five, six. Good luck! Here we go! This ball guy just had a bunch of Pokeballs in his cargo pants since Pokeballs can shrink down to the size of a golf ball. I would not be surprised. Whooper! And Rainbow Birds! Segoy! Segoy! He just like stumbles one day and it's like a bag of marbles across the floor. <laughs> uh, do we? Do I need to do anything on my on my end in terms of refund for the third challenge? What I do beat? Uh, nope. Nope. I have it written down, so I will take care of that as soon as our payment processor finishes it. Our new payment processor sometimes doesn't see the funds, so it's like, there's no funds yet to uh, give back, so we have to wait till we get them, then we can give them back. But I have it noted down, so no worries there. I'm actually checking on that right now for you. Water energy and a misty, very fitting. Uh, I can have new dust. <laughs> Be the best. Just gonna order more anyways. <laughs> Sounds good. Alright, come on, give us some last pack luck. Maybe a full art. Pinsir GX. Segoy! Yep, your extra one. I just refunded it for you, so hopefully that should not take too long. Pinsir. Alright, Pinsir GX, Whooper, Baby Shiny, and the Rainbow Birds Trio. Plus the Hollows and Mew. We just use it in a positive way here. But yeah, that's true. It can be an expression of negative as well. We've created our own version of the negative Sugoi called Ugoi. <laughs> <laughs> just for fun. It's not a real word. Alright, uh, Lunar jumping in with some Shining Fates. Six packs of Shining. Accidentally punched the shelf. <laughs> mm. As yeah, as one does on occasion. Three, four, five, six. I mean, that's my first time punching the shelf, but is this something common for you? <laughs> I kick the light a bunch, so you know, I think it's about the same. <laughs> Silly light with your tripod light is always <laughs> getting in my way. Good luck, Lunar. Kind of nice Pokemon a little. I took a break to collect Yu-Gi-Oh! That's just as expensive. Oh no! TCG Hobby is all expensive, no matter the game. Good to know. I haven't... 
I haven't expanded too far out. I, I took a little jaunt through uh, the My Little Pony game, but that one died, so we're good. <laughs> <laughs> or at least it's it's on Death's Door. Milkery, baby shiny. Segoy. Segoy. For us, shining fades. More Peko! More Peko V. Segoy. Segoy. Did my little pony have cards worth 100 plus? Um, like maybe one or two. Maybe. It's been a long time. I honestly can't remember. Probably not, though. <laughs> All right, no bulk. There's that ugly. <laughs> Milkery, baby shiny. All right. All caught up on refunds of overdone or overordered gym challenges. Sweet, thanks. Mm -hmm. All right, back to you, Dylan. Uh, 12 packs, shining fates. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Here we go. popular enough. I really liked the art and the characters in My Little Pony, but I feel like its day has passed. Which is okay. Making room for new things. Galarian Crusula, Sigoy! Sigoy! Speaking of new things, that My Hero Academia card game coming out this fall. Oh yeah, looking forward to that one. We'll have a special stream day for that when we uh, get some of those in. Ooh, real a boom, VMAX, and ditto VMAX. Double Segoy! I saw that, I saw that, like, VMAX sparkle, and I was like, could it be? Ah, oh, really boom. <laughs> More sets need to have double hit packs. It's just so much fun. Undead Zombie, thanks for the host. Welcome, welcome. Cheering Pikachus. Six days in chat. Like that's how long you've been like active in a, in the chat. Yeah. Wow. Wow. Raboot, baby shiny. Sick boy. Oh wow, 
Question level one with no survivors. <laughs> Bot's just like, mm, no. <laughs> Easy mode off tonight. Ginkgo's in the background pulling strings like a puppet master. Mm -hmm. Do we let them live? Ah, <laughs> uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> No bulk for this round. There's our hollow pile. Baby Shinies, Raboot, Galarian Cursula, and Ice Cube. And then our V Maxes, Ditto V Max, and Shiny Rillaboom. Sigoy! Okay. Um, up next, Jesus, Hidden Fates, and Amazing Rare Bundles. Three hidden face. And let's see, one, two, three, four amazing rare bundles. Also, do you need a break of any sort? I mean, sure. I could go use snack time. Okay. <laughs> um, so we got four amazing rare bundles. So four shining fates here. And then for Vivid Voltage. So one of these days, I will watch that Nacho video. <laughs> it's great. You have to have sound, though. Yeah, I know. That's why. Like, it's always linked during stream, and then I forget about it by the time stream is done. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm expecting uh, Hidden Fates Charizard, Shining Fates Charizard, and Rainbow Trump. Can you do that? I will certainly try. Okay, let's go. Now just watch. We actually pull the trifecta. <laughs> Alright, so you got it all 4-4. Four, four. Yep. Alright. Oh, and you already got a time stamped for me. Excellent. Go enjoy your snack. Do we have any Steam Siege packs in store? I think we are currently out of them in the store. I think they're still available on gym challenges. But not as personals at the moment. Yeah, we're really starting to run low on those, so... And they are a popular favorite for the gym challenges, so. Reverse Floatzel, Gym Trainer, Full Art, Sigoy. Full Art Trainer off the first pack. Well, that's a cool detail I've never noticed on this one. There's like a like slowly decaying like ancient stone wall kind of going on in the background there. Never noticed that before. That's super cool. My hair goes to yell at somebody. <laughs> um, currently a little preoccupied, but I'm curious why you need some or need someone to be yelled at. <laughs> Crit and Spesh, they're no longer streaming or anything tonight, so. Not that I could yell at them anyway, considering the team speak is not installed on the computer here. <laughs> yeah. Okay, come on, stack. Just stay sort of stacked. Reverse Yanma, and, well, full art trainers back to back. So, go boy. Got a ball guy full art as well. Respond to him at 8 p.m., so apparently I'm ignoring him. Well, if you're ignoring him, then you don't have to, you know, pay attention to him being upset. It's wonderful how that works out. You get that? Someone's effort knows. Mm. Also, we are two for two with full art supporters. Nice. Oh, it's for work. Ah. Ooh, amazing rare Eve at all. Sigoy. You felt at all. Yeah, 
No, you're pretty right, yeah. My TF2 days, I was a lot better, but... That was because the, the entire team was idiots, so... A lot more motivation to yell at people in that case. <laughs> So Patriot, or Patriot Plays, thanks for the follow. Baby Shiny Morgrim. Steam Siege has a lot of cool stuff in it. I feel like Steam Siege got a lot of community dislike just because it was like the filler pack like every collection box it's like four packs of pokemon tcg and one of them was always steam siege so a lot of people finished their set and they're like well i don't need any more steam siege but it's in everything yell at him and i'll split the commission with you it just gets a random phone call or something and just someone yelling at them there you go side hustle you can hire me to yell at people I'll pass on that. <laughs> First Zip Strika and Fortress. Ah, we broke our streak at a hit in every pack. Come on, step it up, Vivid. Also, am I yelling at the person who is doing the commission or a coworker? Because I feel like random person yelling at them would make them less likely to purchase. Mm -hmm. Ooh, we've got Rayquaza, amazing rare, Sugoi. The Sky Noodle. Sugoi. Sugoi. We actually don't do the card trick because it is way more efficient for us to not do that. If you look up in the top corner, that's how many packs we've opened so far tonight. We often open many, many more. And I did the math one time, and apparently it is up to two to three hours longer stream doing the pack trick. And so since we have so many orders, we don't want to waste everyone's time. We want to get to the good stuff right away. Reverse Pickyback and Crocodile. That is a really sweet Rayquaza, amazing rare. It's also, I think the Rayquaza is the hardest one of the three to pull. Or is that Jirachi? I always forget. It's one of the two co uh, colorless ones. Oh gosh. Nope. You can yell at the property manager who's yelling at me. It's <laughs> a lot of money to yell at somebody. Like, it's tempting, but... <laughs> Reverse Beldum and Main Ectric. Ooh, who won? Who won? Congratulations to the winner. Oh, I don't know Instagram handles. Reverse Hollow. Fairy Energy, Gyarados GX, Sugoi. What? The bot is gaining sentience. Doing a fan purge. What? What is going on? I am so confused. The bot is now sentient, apparently. Oh. I am not Ginkgo, I'm a bot. I do not care about your feelings. <laughs> oh, jeez. I, I ignore the bot. I never even realized. Well, we're all doomed. We've insulted the bot too much. It's gained sentience. We've got reverse hollow coughing and golem. Pot works fine. <laughs> good check, good check. 
<laughs> All right, let's see some last pack Charizard luck. Starting off with the Pikachu, so that's a good sign. We've got Reverse Hollow Vaporeon. And Hollow Vaporeon. All right, there's some Evolution twins for you. Not Eevee Heroes Evolutions, but you know. Soon, soon. Wow, 50-50. All right, but we had some crazy pulls. Come here, you. We've got Reverse Hollow Energy, Gyarados GX, Baby Shiny Morgrim, Rayquaza Amazing Rare, Evitol Amazing Rare, and two supporters, Gym Trainer and Ball Guy. So going. Also, hollows and reverses. Going with no bulk. We can always use more Gardevoir. Uh, more, uh, more Gardevoir cards. Agreed. We do have the Gardevoir bundles, I believe, on the shop. So that is an excellent way to get your fill of Gardevoir. <gasps> oh, I get to do a gym challenge. Yeah, if you want to. All right, let's do this. All right, Chris, what do we have for a starter? God, how do I do this? Uh, <laughs> yeah, I haven't done it in a while. It uh, this is a regular gym challenge. Oh, I thought you said exhibition. My bad. Nope. I just haven't done a gym challenge in a while. <laughs> All right, who's our leader and our starter? Oh, is that me? Do you need my? Own? Yes. Who, who do we got? Uh, Chris Page. Wrong tab. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Cyndaquil. <laughs> Cyndaquil, Cyndaquil, Cyndaquil. Okay, those are down the bottom on this one. I'm so used to them being on the top. All right, we got Cyndaquil against Bugsy. Yep. Perfect. Here we go. How do I do this? There we go. <laughs> it has been a Same. while, like last week, Tuesday, since I last did a gym challenge, so bear with me here. We're going battle styles. Everything has been rearranged on the shelf by me, but I forgot where I put everything. One, two, three, four, five, and six packs. Representing your six Pokemon team. Let's crush Bugsy. Oh, you want some ghost luck? Get some lucky Eevee luck. Not that there's any Eeveelutions in uh, Battle Styles, but you'll probably get one of those Eevee reverses, maybe. <laughs> Cute little swimming Eevee. Got Reverse Bronzor Common. Colossal, two points. Ooh, wow, look at the hollow bleed on that one. It goes all the way to the bottom of the card. Common Dual Blade Reverse. Regular Rare Drampa. Right, come on, Battle Styles. We've got Karina's Focus Uncommon Reverse. Hollow. Nope, regular rare electivir. Come on, battle styles. You can do it. We've got uncommon weeping bell reverse. 
Steelix Hollow. Wow, look at the bleed on that one. That is rainbow all the way down. Two points. Honestly, I love the Hollow Bleed cards. The best ones, though, they're reverse hollows that bleed back up into the card itself. So you get, like, the hollow and the reverse. It looks so good. Come on, let's get something big. Maybe a rainbow or gold. We've got reverse common. Well, a full art flapple V will certainly do the job. One, two, three, four points. Suck, boy. Yeah. All right, and a one-pack victory lap. Also, that is a very, very talented artillery showing off in the background. Like, this Rim Raid's like, look at me, I can balance four things. It's like, yeah, I've got about 40. <laughs> Show off. <laughs> Reverse Hollow, Baby Bacon Bug, and regular Rare Stone Journer. All right, well, coming away with the Flapple V and the Victory, as well as Hollows and Reverses. Oop, shaking the webcam a little bit. All right, Bugsy is the green box for prize cards, right? Oh, Bug box. the winner. Where's the winner thingy? Winner sparkles. Winner sparkles. Green box. Never so happy to get an apple. <laughs> apple a day keeps the Bugsy away. And your prize card is... Caesar V Full Arts Segoy. Also check this out. A A. I can do it myself now. I'm proud of you. That one was close to the top of the thing, so it was like easier to grab. <laughs> Normally I have trouble getting into those sleeves because my fingers are a little too big. Now, now, Mumbina. It's a little rude. We have quite a few Shuckle fans in chat tonight. Oh my god, that is the greatest thing. I love it. It is a frog with a little Bulbasaur bulb on its back. And it is a great cosplay. All right, we got some Shining Fates and Hidden Fates. Oh, I need to go back to the main screen. Ah, uh, main screen. There we go. Did I have, to, was it Cyndaquil? Sorry, for? For Chris? Chris? For the gym challenge? Yeah. Okay, because I don't think I changed that, so I just had a panic attack that we went with the wrong starter the whole time. I recently learned... Oh, there's actually two timestamps. Let me timestamp them both. So six-pack shining, three-packs hidden. I actually learned today that apparently Shuckle is capable of the highest single attack damage output in the game, which is like over seven million damage in a single attack. It requires a complex series of, like, uh, buffs, baton passes, and, like, copying the right move. But it's insane. Two, Dang. three, four, five, six. You good there, Shuffle? <laughs> and three hidden fates. But yeah, you put Shuckle in a trick room, or not a trick room, but uh, using the power trick, goes from like 
weakest attack to strongest attack in Pokemon. It's crazy. We've got Reverse Hollow Luxio, Careless, Full Art, Sigoy. Man, what is up with the first pack Full Art Supporter Luck? Not that I mind. Keep it up. <laughs> <laughs> All the Piplup things. Where's Hollow Cramorant? Volcanion. Swimming Eevee. Snama Bench. Reverse Rusted Sword. And Beevil. I'm glad we got those cookie and cream uh, ice cream sandwiches. That's what they were. Mm -hmm. well, we'll get more next time. Reverse Eevee. Hey, there's our swimming Eevee reverse. And Rillaboom. Alright, come on, come on, shiny face. Let's see some sh baby shinies. Or big shinies. Oh, well, so much for reading chat. There's a legendary in there, so uh, I'll see you all in a minute or two. Baby shiny colossal Sigoy. I actually really like the shiny colossal because he goes like a lot more gray, and you can actually see all the definition. He has fingers. I did not know that because he's normally just this brown mass that you can't make out on the card. Sigoy. What do we got? What's what's this Twitter link poke? Match with your gold one. Nice, nice. Come on, shiny fakes. We got new cool merch from Japan or something. We got reverse swacky dreadna. All right, saving up that luck in Hidden Fates. Let's pull a Zard. It has been a little while since we pulled the Hidden Fates Zard. We had that one week where we pulled like four of them in a single stream and like two of them in a single break. It was insane. Mm -hmm. He's been a little bit harder to find since then. Verse. Dark energy, almost said steel, and Butterfree. Is that for the thing? What is the thing? Uh, do you have, do you have oh, <laughs> I see the thing. <laughs> Looks like I shall be opening some more packs, and you'll be enjoying some more snack break time. Snacks and packs. Packs are not snacks. Mm. Mm. Really. That Charmander too? Certainly. <laughs> I like your notes, Zephyr. <laughs> oh, I'll have to read the note in a second. We got spicy, I just ate some spicy food, Charmander. It's a marathon adding those bags. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, well, 
a little spoiler there, but it's Leafy oh, on GX. Oh, so nice. so go hoy. Nice. Getting some evolutions. So I skipped like half the cards in that pack getting to it. Well, good job, Eevee, bringing us some Eevee Lucian luck. Sugoi. Hyperstar calling it. Sugoi. Oh, wow, that's crazy. If this is your active Pokemon, once during your turn, you can heal 50 damage from any of your Pokemon that have energy attached to them. That's really strong. You know what? Energy, you can just uh, go to the back row. We got, you know what, Careless? Out of the way. Evolutions, front and center. Sugoi. Creepy Heroes wasn't good. Well, now you have a Leafeon. Shiny Leafeon at that. Reverse Hollow Fairy Energy and a Sleepy Snorlax. Ah, couldn't get you one more big shiny, but oop. we can play some uh, Guess Who and knock over all the cards. Leafy on Full Art Shiny Sugoi. And Colossal Baby Shiny and Careless Full Art Supporter. As well as a couple Reverse Hollows. Charmander and some, sorry, and then some Hollows and Reverses. But Sugoi. Going no bulk. Alright. Ooh, we got. Double Charizard Hunt Bundles. Charizard Chasers. Let us try to remember which cards are in this. So we got two Darkness Ablaze. Two Packs Evolutions. Um, two Packs Burning Shadows. Good time staff gets it in. I am... Well, I mean, I guess you're gonna have a break in a minute anyway. Let me I finish getting a, these. I think you've got a full break to do. Two packs, Hidden Fates. Two packs, Shining Fates. Kind of like stacking these everywhere. And I'm missing one more Zard. Which one am I missing? Champions Path. Where is Champions? Aha! Right in front of my face. I never remember. I never notice Champions when it's the Obstagoon ones on the front. All right. <laughs> then I would have recognized it. All right, give me a little bit of lucky Eevee luck. Maybe we'll pull some more Eevee Lucians. And then a Charizard. Ooh. All right, I'm going to go take a quick snack break before I make up on some packs. All right, guys, you get me back. Where's my face? Boom. All right, we've got the two Charizard bundles. That's what we're doing. Yep. Can't do it in Fates first. That's a crime. Do Champion's Path first, should we? I was right. maximizing the EV Lucian luck. Both what? What? EV Lucian luck. In the hidden Fates. Oh, gotcha. Direct contact with the EV. Increased luck. Get the sad out of the way. <laughs> oh, Champions. All right, well, best of luck. Here we go. Hey, that's a pack goal. Like Rock Hollow. So good. Also, thank you for the follow. My apologies. I do not know how to pronounce your name. But feel free to let me know. And I'll take a stab at it. Katakana was my downfall. I did okay with Hiragana, but like, 
Katakana is just like, nope. No Auburn GX. Sugoi. Sugoi. <laughs> hey, thanks, Zephyr. <laughs> Cinderace VMAX. Sugoi. Sugoi. Giant Snorlax look too. <laughs> These need to be closer to my life. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Have stubby arms. I just feel like throughout stream, my top loaders slowly just sneak away from me and get further and further. Ampidimp, baby shiny. Is that a Zephyr's badge? Mm. 200,000. Hidden Fates, up to you! Onyx GX! Segoi! Can I get fat Pikachu? <laughs> yes. The classic. Where are you at, Pikachu? The original Chunk Chew. There he is. Mention our viewer giveaway since we've had a bunch of people popping in and out of the stream. Um, it is completely free to be a part of our viewer giveaway, so you are automatically earning entries just by watching the stream. But if you're interested in earning more, roughly every 20 minutes we have a wild Pokemon appear in chat. Uh, if you try and catch that Pokemon with like Command Pokeball or Great Ball or Ultra Ball, and you get lucky, and you do happen to catch the Pokemon, you earn extra entries into our viewer giveaway. Just kind of an optional, fun thing. Um, but yeah, even if you don't participate in the chat catching game, you are earning about one entry every 20 minutes just by watching the stream. Uh, you don't have to be here to win. All the entries that you earn are still valid, even if you end up going offline, you gotta go to bed or something. And uh, at the end of the stream, we will round the giveaway for our cute shuffle today. <laughs> Hyperstar, good night! 2 a.m. Getting late. Have a good one. Left shark. <laughs> JDM, thank you for the sub! Segoy! Seven with Prime! Getting in on that sub giveaway this yeah. month. Awesome Sabrina and that gold Alakazam and Umbreon card. Alright, Dylan up next with some shiny fates. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten, eleven, twelve. But if you do end up winning our viewer giveaway, make sure to check your Twitch whispers, because that is where where we let you know that you won the giveaway. The bot will message you with instructions on how to claim your prize. So make sure you have Whispers from Strangers turned on. 
Otherwise, you can't claim your prize. And it'll be sad. Good luck. Here we go. And the bot will be sad because you consider them a stranger. <laughs> Good shiny. I was about to say, like, the neon green Call dragon is super good. <laughs> Ow, Kermie VMAX! Rainbow! So good. So good. we got the rainbow cake. I feel like we used to pull this card all the time, but, like, not really so much anymore. Wasn't there that one break where we had like three rainbow picks in a single break? <laughs> I mean, probably. Shiny and giant ditto. Segoy. Segoy. The giant wall of ditto. Ditto getting into the spirit in the uh, Galar stadiums, doing the wave. <laughs> Except misunderstood, it is the wave. <laughs> Just like I can do it by myself. Just getting this. I'm not musically inclined to know the answer to this question. <laughs> Didn't realize how many people put custom emotes. Oh, sent to score shiny! Segoy! Custom emotes up on Etsy until I searched Piplup to show a buttercup to make them just die of cuteness. Uh, <laughs> I did not think yeah, I Etsy feel like... a place to find emotes, yeah. I know there's a lot of like pre-made emotes on Etsy. A lot of them are real good. Mm -hmm. I have a hard time finding commissioners, but maybe I'm just bad at searching. This is also an option. We got Galarian Stunfisk! Segoy! Segoy! One of the cruelest Pokemon in the game. Mm -hmm. Think you're gonna find a loot ball on the ground and suddenly bear trap. <laughs> and you're gonna like reach for it with your hand, like, ow. Yeah, I feel like Fungus and Voltorb were better loot traps. I mean, Voltorb would just be like a live grenade um, <laughs> explode on you, and then Amoongus would poison you. So, I mean, none of them really are any better. <laughs> But the other ones are cuter! <laughs> Gossiflur! Baby Shiny! Morpheco! Double Segoy! Hey, Lime Life! Welcome! Canyon for the last one. All right, uh, no bulk. Here's our hollow stack. Down they go. Oh, that's a cool one. Progression badges. Not too 
bad. Not too bad at all. Don't have labels. Oh, I am behind on labels, yes. All right, Victor. Up next with Hidden Fates Personals. Nine packs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Best of luck. Oh, let's update our pack counter real quick. After 800 packs, next goal is 1100 for Galarian Rapidash. There we go, updated. It's our psychic themed ladder for the week. Uh, the ladder giveaway runs through the end of Thursday. Is anybody new to that one? Here we go, Hidden Fates time. Ooh, we got the Fuller Birds! Segoy! Segoy! Shout out to all of our lurkers. Welcome. All right. Feel free to keep lurking. Just thought I'd say hi. Appreciate you guys being here. Hopefully you're having a good stream. Mm -hmm. I can see all the awesome bowls tonight. Just me, but oh, baby Rowlet, Segoy. Segoy. Does anybody else get really excited when, like, the hand soap or your shampoo or your candle, things that smell good, when they like start to run out? It's like, oh, I can change it out for another good smelling thing. <laughs> Some of our hand soap is about to run out. I was like, ooh, what am I gonna put in there next? interested to find out. <laughs> Baby shiny Swablu, Segoy. Segoy. I keep buying the bulk size of shampoo though. I should stop doing that because then it runs out faster. <laughs> and then I get a new smell. <laughs> this has been the weird tidbits from Colin's brain segment. Thank you for joining us. <laughs> Except for, no. <laughs> On another note, Colin, come change out our hand soap. Pincer GX! So I don't think you'd like it. I make them all smell all, like fruity and, and fun. Just pick up a good collection every time one of those soap stores in the mall has a sale. Oh yeah. Alright, Victor picking up the Pincer GX. A couple of baby shinies. We got Rowlet. Swablu and the Full Art Birds Trio. What's Colin thinking about? Oh, you know, hand soap. Don't you think about hand soap all the time? <laughs> oh, wait, that's just me. <laughs> all right, uh, Eve, your turn. Lady Luck Bundle. sets for the Lady Luck. More of a fresh meadow sort of guy rather than Hawaiian dream. That's okay. As long as it smells like something good, I'm cool. If you're one of those people that just gets the generic non-smelling soap, I'm like, you're missing so many opportunities in your life. 
<laughs> I cough, cough. <laughs> That's okay, I fixed that. Yeah. Kramer and V. Sigoy. Sigoy. Only when I walk, walk past the Bath and Body Works, that's all my brain can process. I swear they have fans built in just to pump that out with them all around them. I wouldn't be surprised. I do know that, like, burger restaurants at one point designed some of their ventilation systems with the intent of, like, passerby smelling the burger and walking. Oh, yeah. Them. It's true. All right, Cosmic, what you got? Hey, welcome back, Slug. We got a character rare, so Gally. Joy. Oh, cosmic. You're wonderful. I'm convinced this is one of those starting to look like your pet kind of a deal. <laughs> <laughs> he does cow like on backwards, though. It's a work in progress. It's like a lifelong process. <laughs> Alright, Gallade, character rare, and the Kramer and V. Sigoy. Uh, you're going no bulk, so here's our hollows. Alright, hopefully you had a good snack break, Ghost. Yep. I'll get some packs to open. Also good to know that that's actually something they do. Ooh, Spectrum, that's a good one. <laughs> mm. Brown sugar vanilla mm. and soap. Oh, see, now I want a bagel because we have that brown sugar cinnamon uh, cream cheese. I'm excited to try it. Mm -hmm. It sounds delicious. All right. Well, let me get the break sheet ready. Wrong one. Uh, that one on, that one off. There we go. Uh, All right. See, Zach is asking, do you guys ever think about buying vintage cards? Um, honestly, it's not really our domain. Um, we focus more like on affordable cards, and I feel like vintage can be a little pricey. Especially nowadays, like, I feel like the vintage supply has just gone down so much that, like, gets harder and harder to uh, even find any. All right, here we go. Let's see what spots Zephyr gets. Oh, look, all of them. <laughs> but now we can keep track of which ones go hit list and whatnot. And then I'm going to delete these so that way I remember to set that up every time. All right, 36 packs, battle styles. One, two, three, four, five, six, two, seven, eight, nine, eight, ten, eight, eleven, twelve. Eight, six, four, one, two, three, four. Nine. Eight, eight, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. It's so hard. Was this a secret whisper from Zephyr to make him do this? No, but he should have thought of it first. <laughs> <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, six. eleven, twelve. Oh. <laughs> oh, you want to trade fire for water? All right, I can do that. All right, trade complete. Oh. Well, if you are looking to sell a vintage collection, you might want to join our Discord. We have a, um, what is this, buy-sell channel or whatever, so you've got, you guys can uh, offer your collections or, you know, purchase collections from people, so that might not be a bad place uh, to go check out. Oh, I need a timestamp. Dear. There we go. Timestamp complete. Nine, I've already done counting. Sigoy! Sigoy! Oh, you think it's hard doing this? Just 
Wait, 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 I just... try. <laughs> I just, out of instinct, echoed, uh... I didn't think that would work! <laughs> Oh, jeez. Try buying it and remembering what is in your cart. Uh, I mean, Zephyr, one thing you can do is rather than doing a wish list break, you can pick up personals and stuff. That one you have the ability to just say, I want, you know, 12 personals of three packs to get to 36. Might save you a little bit of uh, time and trouble. I can't believe I did that. Uh, <laughs> It's an it's an instinct now, like like I will Segoy like rares and stuff if her voice even has the slightest peak of excitement in it. Like, oh, I mean it is one. Okay, so it's a little bit later in the night, so I have some excuse to fall back on, but still, oh, reverse Luxio, ah. Oh. Oh. oh yeah, Spectrum, happy birthday. I think we've rolled over into the ninth now, at least on our end. Spectrum! Rapid Striker, Shifu V. I have so many other emotes to go before that one, though, Poke. I almost top-loaded the V. We are on a roll tonight. Got this. Oh, crap, that means my birthday's coming up. No! Make it stop. Guys, guess what Thursday is? <laughs> Hound Doom Reverse. It's definitely not not Ghost's birthday. <laughs> Bad poke. Bad. First grown pig. Right, come on, Battle Styles. It's a birthday week. My birthday is on Thursday. Ever played Black Ops 2? I don't think I ever did. I probably would have played the zombie mode had I played that. Yep. So many birthday fun things. I'm gonna try to sneak in a stream on Friday. We do some Pokemon Snap or something for my birthday. First Pawnyard. Ooh, Tapu Coco VMAX. Sigoy. Yeah, I, I just have never been able to, like, find a group to do the zombie mode with. Like, I totally want to play the zombies, but the problem is, like, everyone knows the tricks to it, and I would want to explore and figure them out myself. Which means, you know, find a group that has never played before. Santa Conda Hollow. Um, let's take a quick look at the up next list and see if your order went through for you. Yep. We got your order in there, so we've got one more order before you after I get done with this giant stack of packs for Zephyr. And then your then your order. If that is you. But yep, you can check to see if you are on the queue at any time. Exclamation point Q. Letter Q U E Q U E U E. You know, however you want to spell it. It will get you to our list of upcoming orders. And as orders are done, they're removed from that list so you know what one is current.
Hot sauce stream for birthday week? Oh. So how many candles do we have to buy? Uh, okay, let me do the math. It's 2021, I was born in 88, so 33? I have to do the math every time someone asks my birthday. Like, I never remember it. Once I hit like 25, I'm like, oh, that's the last birthday milestone. I can rent a car and no more <laughs> need to keep track of it. You just have to remember when you get like to the senior menu at Denny's. <laughs> You know, yeah, I, I, I think I'll keep track of that when I get closer <laughs> to that one. You're good. Uh, we are more than uh, happy to fix the display name on the up next list if you want a different name to show up. We can set that on the back end, or if you have not created an account on the store, you can change your display name when you create your account. Turn 33 <laughs> once, I wouldn't recommend it. <laughs> Sweet. Come on, Battle Styles. We have so many birthdays this week. Or within a week. <laughs> First Tapu Bulu, Stoutland V. With that stylish mustache. Also, we always talk about Stoutland's mustache, but check out those eyebrows. Stylish. Scott, you said Colin for a second. I was just like, we talk about my mustache? When? <laughs> I want to be a part of this conversation. Uh. The mustache that comes with the little goggles and the nose does not count, Colin. Rude. Don't insult my mustache like that. <laughs> First glory, Mr. Rhyme. Jeremy Hill. Okay, so that should be changing here in just a minute. Corbin Max. Sigoy. I never even realized. Got a blip going on. Or a mlem. Blip is the sound of the tongue going out, mlem is the sound of the tongue going back in. Okay. <laughs> My head cannon, I don't know if it's actually. <laughs> Summer birthdays. I'm so jealous. <laughs> Welcome to the world of old, my friends. Slapple VMAX. Sigoy. I am looking forward to celebrating the birthday. Day full of movies. We're getting some pizza. Ah. Oh. Haven't done a movie binge marathon thing in so long. Did you say whether you've seen Lego Batman or not? Lego Batman. I don't think I've I, the I, I've seen the first Lego movie, and I think that is the only Lego movie I'm current on. Did I, you like the Lego movie? Yes, I enjoyed the Lego movie. Okay, maybe we should watch Lego Batman too. All right, add it to the list. <laughs> I'm up for watching whatever. Rippy Fred Jar Jar Binks. I'll never let you unsee it. <laughs> just he's just Flapple V Max. That's all he is. I do not know of this Jar Jar you speak of. He's not no Jar Jar. <laughs> That's good, Colin. That's yeah. good. Uh, 
Even though, despite the fact that later on in the series, Jar Jar was the only competent senator. Imagine that as a scary thought. That is a little terrifying. Like, Jar Jar, one of the few senators that is actually doing their job. <laughs> Spoink, Conkleder. I have not played any Gartic Phone. Do you ever have to rethink about how old you are? Just remembered. <laughs> I hate shit. Zephyr, you are at most a year or two older than me. I don't know how it rounds based on when our, my birthday is. You are not ancient. But I do often have to think of what what I was, or how old I am, like, people will be like, and how old are you? And I'll be like, give me a second, gotta do the math. And it's like, I was born in 88, which means the math is not just a simple, you know, what is the end of the year? Okay, it's, you know, a multiple of that. My mom was born on a year with a zero, so that makes it so much easier for her to calculate out. But she also knows it without having to calculate it out every time. First bolt -tund. Some more Stoutland. Your dad had three kids by 34? I mean... You know, everybody has different timetables. Damn. Verse Mankey, Bronza. got that like video game like sort of peaceful but sort of not I don't remember what day of the week it is let alone things my age I struggle to remember if I had breakfast not what I had for breakfast if I had it <laughs> admittedly it, whether or not I have breakfast it also depends on like oh it's two o'clock oh I just woke up <laughs> Sometimes it just kind of goes into lunch. <sighs> Ooh, Flapple, VMAX, Ooh, Rainbow. Styles giving us Rainbow. Sigoy. This is one we have not pulled recently at all. Let's see, who's this going to go to? It's going to go to Zephyr, Intergress Spot. Stoutlands, you can uh, have some fun just hanging out over there. There we go, rainbow. Zubat and Age of Slash. Zephyr about to wheel and deal with the trade deals. We got Reverse Mawile. Ah. Love that more Pekka. Angry. But yeah, I have not played the Gartic phone. What is that? That's the one where it's the Pictionary plus telephone. But 
<laughs> Van. Oh, uh, that's great. Reverse girder or beetle. Successful wheel and deal. Single. Away. <laughs> oh, single Ooh. strike, gold energy. Nice. Sugo, battle styles. Hits are heavy coming through in this last stack. Sugo. This coming up uh, donation break uh, stream is going to be crazy. <laughs> also, if you can get that label for the... Uh... Um, for Buttercup. Yes, Bruce and Dee Dee and Pavilion. We've got Verse Hollow and Aegis Flash. I'm really excited for the Chilling Rain Gold Energies. Those things look sweet. They're finally, like, making modifications to the base energy card rather than just putting a gold border around it. So it's like, ooh, we got some nice stuff on those. I mean, just, like, sparkles and stuff, but it's like, looks good. First Marowak. Primate. Solo Houndoom and some Drampa. All right, come on, Battle Styles. You know you've got something else in you. Get one more big hit. Maybe another Alt Art Tar or what's the Alt Art we're missing? The Rapid Strike V. It's the only one we have not pulled tonight. Glory, Mr. Rhyme. <laughs> I like Angry Apple better. I, I'm going to be doing Angry Apple rather than Jar Jar. We're just we're just changing. We're 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 just we're just changing it over. You know, Jar Jar Binks out, Angry Apple in. Reverse my in foo, Let Devire. I feel like everyone else objects to me changing the topic away from it. <laughs> Probably, yes. We've got reverse Pachirisu. There's some T Tar. Sigoy. Maybe not a big hit, but certainly a big Pokemon. It's just the best Godzilla pro uh, pr impersonation. <laughs> All right, last pack magic. Energy thing go to Frozen. You want to uh, make a note for that one as well? Come on, we got alert reverse Electivire. Ooh, ooh, ooh. 
Phoebe Sugoi. Last pack luck going to Zephyr in the supporter spot. How lucky, how lucky. Well, it will be a fun donation break, should those be in the donation pile. Rainbow Phoebe, or not Rainbow Phoebe, regular Phoebe, Rainbow Angry Apple. All right. Which uh, gold energy is that? Uh, it is the single strike energy. All right, so let's see what we got. We had supporters, we had dark, we had rapid, we had single, colorless, grass, more grass, steel, and electric. Now, which spots were double? Oh, no, no spots are double on this one. So which ones were we missing? We did not have a psychic hit. And we did not have a fire hit. All right. And wait, we wait. How? There's eight stacks. Did you get all of your singles and rapids in the right piles? Yes. Okay. Oh, are the colorless randomized on this one? Battle styles. That's what it is. There's no colorless spot. Okay. I was like, how do I have eight stacks and then be still missing three? Okay. So we'll get some sealed packs for the ones that went hitless. And then these will be randomized into the other hitless spots. Ah, Sugoi. Gold energy. So yeah. Excellent, excellent pulls. Mm -hmm. Seriously, for 36 packs of battle styles, we hit like crazy. What is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten hits in 36 packs of battle styles. That is nuts. Everything else goes to donation. Sounds good. Yeah, I believe it was the uh, single strike energy. Well, this will be an awesome one. Thank you once again, Zephyr, for your generosity. These will go to donation, as will all of the hollows and reverses. All right, so that one and that one. Yes, okay. All right, I will hand things back off to Colin, and she will take care of the next orders. I need to work on my uh, opening endurance. <laughs> It's your elbow. It's doing okay. Okay. I've been watching it tonight. Like, I, I can feel it sometimes when I'm, like, reaching to grab stuff from you, but for the most part, it's doing okay. That's good. It was weird. Like, yesterday, like, I just had, like, it twinged. And it's like, I didn't lift anything heavy. I didn't strain it. I didn't smash it into anything. It was just, like, it hurt. I'm, like, weird. But it doesn't do that much. I guess I'm just getting old. It is your birthday on Thursday. I know. My buddy just wanted to remind me. <laughs> All right. Uh, Dylan, back to you. We've got 12 packs of Shining Fates. It's shining, yeah? Yes. Dear Pokemon Company, why do you name your sets so similar? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. At least Evolving Skies is like 12. decently different. Actually, no, Evolving Skies is Evolutions plus Roaring Skies. Like, never mind. I was gonna say, at least yeah. it's like more different than Roaring Skies. Like, it's on the other side of the alphabet from Ro Roaring Skies, so it's you mentally think of it differently, but no. I guess Hidden and Shining are not the same distance part, too, but whatever. My brain doesn't do it. Zard, 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 yes! More Zards! Zard hunt continues. Mm. <laughs> oof. Big oof, Spectrum. <laughs> I, I will pass on the ankle. 
Although every once in a while my knee doesn't like it, so you know, I'm, I'm getting there. Thank you for the follow, welcome. I'm already getting some lovely definition in my beard. That certain hair follicles decide, you know, screw color. <laughs> oh, two follows. Thank you, guys. El de gas, baby shiny. Segoy. I mean, maybe if you squint, it could look like a Charizard. <laughs> a Charizard has, like, a really big afro. Yeah. Is it special... Boogie Charizard rather than Touch Lillard? I don't know. I was trying to think of something quick with Disco. Disco's hard. Come on, Shining Face. You can do this. See, I skipped gray. I got a white. <laughs> Although I like it, because it's at least fairly symmetrical on my beard, so it looks right right now. Ooh, Lapras VMAX! Oh, we got close there for a second. Got a shiny VMAX! Also, another good option if it's not a Zard. Shiny Lapras. Good second. Imagine Ghost in like a draft of what stops working and him just going, nah, pass on the ankle, fix something else. <laughs> <laughs> Mega Helioptile said the pack was gonna be good, you called it. <laughs> Max Lappy. Brush Ram, amazing rare. So good. Giving you a hard time about the uh, exhibition match. <laughs> More Peck OB. Segoy. Teasing you. Alright, Snowbulk. Made one good prediction. It works, it works. Shiny Snom and Shiny Lapras VMAX. Very nice. My favorites of the bunch. Eldegoss and Reshiram, as well as Morpeko. Segoy! Alright. Going through my lines. Remember the script, guys. <laughs> I feel like I didn't get a copy. And I just don't know how to feel. <laughs> so we're just going to ad lib and uh, just follow where the packs go. Alright, Jeremy, you are up next. Doing some Hidden Fates personals. Uh, nine packs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Best of luck. Here we go. Oh, how are we doing on Hidden Fates personals? Voltorb, starting off with the Imposter Great Ball. Segoy! Segoy! Okay, we get 12 in stock still. And do let me know if we ever run out of Hidden Fates personals tonight. I can restock a bit more since we did not have that draft fill. Come on, Hidden Fates. 
right, you GX. Sugoi. Sugoi. With the tail speed. Electric buddies. <laughs> Pack prediction luck comes and goes. Give yourself some time to recharge the prediction luck. Every once in a while I take a shot. And sometimes I get good good predictions. I still remember that one time where we had all the different uh Oh, full art! Sugo! Stack attack of GX! We had all the different Megas and Evolutions, and I was like, man, wouldn't it be amazing with this last pack if we pulled the Mega Czar just to finish the trifecta? And we did. Eh. I used a lot of my prediction luck that day. <laughs> oh, we got gold! Segoy! Mount Coronet, Segoy! You get a sense that things were good in the set of packs. Nice one. It's always hard to pin down which pack it's in, but golden Mount Coronets. I love the gold stadium. They're just so good looking. I think they have a gold stadium coming up, if I remember correctly. Wiggly Top GX! Segoi! I want to say yes, but honestly, can't remember. All right, one more. Faramosa, baby shiny. Segoy. How many, how many exhibition winners do we have today till now? Uh, I think we have seven prize cards claimed. So the first Rainbow Bee giveaway will happen when we have ten. All right, a little bit of a mix of everything here. Baby Shinies, Full Art, Gold, GXs. Segoy. We are going with the bulk on everything. For that then. All right, Van, you are up. Exhibition match time. We are taking on B with six packs of battle styles. One, two, three, four, five, six. Best of luck once again. Guys, if you haven't been here, Van has had exceptional luck challenging B, so we're hoping that continues. Three victories out of four attempts so far. Good luck, here we go. Currently sitting with a solid 30% chance of winning that Rainbow B. Artillery Hollow, two points. Oh, that's right. It was the turf field stadium coming up. Yeah, that's the one. Those two points. Yep. So oh, sushi master. Come in. We got Victini V Max. Segoy. Segoy four points. Seven so far. Reverse rare, one point. Come in, Mimikyu full art. Sagoy. Sagoy, four points for the full art. All right, so eight prize cards down with B now. <laughs> Hey now, we still have two packs to go. <laughs> Mimic you, so good. I'm taking my creative license. 
I'm running off script and you can't stop me. Bronze on reverse, one point. Segoy. I love that you have a panda for everything. It makes me very excited. <laughs> Or is it a little pan cham? Can't tell. I believe it is four. Let me check my total list. All right, no points from that last one, but we're good. We're good. We got twelve. That's all. Yep. Van has four entries. We have Nicholas with one, Samantha with one, Sebastian with one, and Sujay with one. Once again, congrats. So what happens when we have 10? So we have 30 little prize cards, or not little prize cards, but normal prize cards that if you get, you get one if you win. And then we have three grand prize cards, which are each rainbow bee. So we'll be spinning the wheel for someone to take home a rainbow bee out of the first 10 winners. And then one for the winners 11 through 20, and then one from 21 through 30. 30. All right, prize card is Shiny Diddle VMAX. Segoy. VMAX, that's, that's our Galar theme for this guy. Got the Raspberry Tappy. Ditto in the house. Very nice. Uh, looks like Graham up next with a Mega Charizard Chaser. Let's do it. We are including both on this one. Okay. Also, I don't know if I'm embracing method actor status. I think I just don't know how to act in general, so. <laughs> <laughs> We've got the six packs in the Charizard bundle. Best of luck. Here we go. All right, we're going again. Sounds good. Go Bix. You too. trying to stop me right now. Perfect timing. <laughs> <laughs> well, you have granted us the luck of the Cheeto Burb. It's booked. Yes. Okay. The Cheeto summoning is complete. <laughs> Alright, back to you, Van, with the exhibition match. I think I prefer the crunchy to the baked, honestly. The baked aren't bad, but like the crunchy feel like you have more when you eat them. The baked ones just like make me want another bag. <laughs> Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six packs. Best of luck, here we go!
Electivire, reverse rare. One point. Sigoy. Clay doll, reverse rare, one point. Sigoy. Empoleon V, three Sugoy. points. The base flavor is good, yeah. If there was just a little bit more in the bag, I'd be happy. I'm like, I like a bag and a half, <laughs> and I only have one bag, so it's like, well, I gotta eat two now. Man, do you literally have pandas eating Cheetos? That is amazing. Oh my god. <laughs> you really do have a panda for everything. You've been caught orange handed. Victory Bell, reverse rare. One point. There going. I am a little concerned. I was going to say it is blue. We got a VMAX for four points and another victory. <laughs> How are you doing Sugoy. this? Wow, man. Defining all odds. It's cool. Oh. Well, my bad. Maybe we should stick with the Cheetos, little panda. <laughs> And we have two packs left. And no points there. All right, we're getting 10 points, exactly what we needed. Van strikes again! Segoy! <laughs> Segoy! You don't eat glue? Um, no. I don't. <laughs> and you shouldn't either. Public service announcement by Pokemon Barry Bark. Alright, let's go for another prize card. Fuller's a rude bee. Sigoy. Sigoy. I don't know if Zarude technically counts as Galar, but he was re released around that time, so I rolled with it. <laughs> Full arts are rude. I think you get him in Sword and Shield as a bonus, so. Do you? I thought he was just in the movie. But I think, like, the movie promo comes out for Sword and Shield. Ah, oh, okay. Well, then we'll go with it. Oh, there's Van! We got another one! Let's do it! Exhibition match! Another round! Okay, we set our points. Uh, okay. Six more packs of battle styles. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Best of luck! Common, not hollow. Lux Ray, reverse rare, one point. Sigoy. Oh, I see something interesting. Rainbow Tapu Coco. Sigoy. Sigoy, we got five points. a good pack. Perfect pack, if you will. Reverse rare and a rainbow. Uncommon. Cricketune V3 points! Segoy! Good feeling about this one too, Ben. <laughs> the 
those points going? It's gonna be up to nine. Reverse rare! One so point! Boy. For the snake! Single strike bear! Segoy! Segoy! Battle style is so nice to you so much. <laughs> Three more points! <laughs> <laughs> Uncommon and Crobat Hollow, two points. Segoy. See, but the sad part was that we had other people earlier going in on gym challenges and then they wouldn't win and you'd come back and win some more. So I think it's your, just your, you, Van. Your timing is just like perfect. <laughs> you know, when exactly when the hits are coming up, the next six pack. All right, pulling rainbow though, very nice. Segoy. All right, well, now we have a brief interlude. As Colin sets up the wheel. Oh, fun. We're at 10 already. All right, well, let me pull the regular prize. And I don't have anything for that. Oh, yes. I'm buying the label. I didn't think we'd get to the drawing today. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> Counting cards like they do in blackjack movies. <laughs> Good luck. Our, oh, we got more rainbow. Rainbow Milo. Segoy. Segoy. Oh, Milo. You were an adventure. Orange Milo. It's an eye <laughs> shuffle cases, so good luck counting with that many. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Also, sometimes I'm lazy, so sometimes I'll shuffle a random number. You're gonna have to give me a minute if we want the wheel. Do you have the names on here? I do. Um, let me put them in. Let me see if this works. I'm gonna have to go back to the main page. See, Ooh, he's a big guy. You can go to the wish list breaks. Call him DT in there. Random shuffle or two before sticking them on the wheel so it spreads right, so everything out. These are the people that are in the running. We've got Nicholas, Samantha, Sebastian, Suji, and Van several times. Let's shuffle our names three times. One, two, three. So that is translated to our wheel. All right, shall we give it a spin? Good luck. What? Oh, okay. I was just wondering where you got the names, but you got them, yeah. Boom! And a rainbow B goes to... Oh, he's got this in the bag. <laughs> yeah, that half of the wheel. Congrats to Van! Segoy! Alright, we got a rainbow B in here for ya. Secretly hiding behind our divider. Rainbow Bee! Sego Honey. Congrats, thank you so much for doing the exhibition match. And whatever you're doing, don't stop. <laughs> it, it seems to be working well.
Alright. Um, up next, Chris. Amazing rare bundle for ya. So, one Shining Fates and one Vivid Voltage. Good luck. Academy jumping in, gonna try and steal a bit of that luck. Mm. Aww, our amazing rare bundle. Not as amazing as we'd hope. Two reverse rares for this round. Uh, guess what? We're back to Van! <laughs> Secret is glue. Oh no! I feel conflicted. <laughs> um, again, we do have a total of 30 prize cards to be won. We've gone through 10 of them now. So, 20 left. So, if you are interested in jumping in the exhibition match, plenty of opportunity. Alright, six more. Here we go, Battle Styles. One, two, three, four, five. Six backs. Good luck. Common, not hollow. Uncommon. We got Hollow Steelix. Two points. Segoy. Corfish. Common. Uh, non Hollow Rare. Common. We got Vic TV. Segoy. Segoy. Uh, three points. Uh, common. Not hollow. Last one. Need a big one. Bruxish, uncommon, and more hollow, two points. Segoy. You literally do have a panda for everything. <laughs> Even <laughs> the angel panda. <laughs> oh, it was definitely a good run, though. Oh, yeah. For real. Big TV and the hollows for that round. And you still got close. You still got seven points. Like... You're even losing in style. Come on, man. <laughs> <laughs> B's gonna get a little depressed over here. <laughs> it's like, I'm going back to Got Galar. This Johto region. Crazy. Ah. Uh, well. Can't win them all, but you can get close. The band theory. <laughs> All right, Jeremy, going in on some burning shadows up next. How um, many? Three, six, nine, twelve. Twelve packs. So we're continuing the Zard hunt. Or we just like burning shadows. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And eleven, twelve. Good luck, Jeremy.
trying not to count points, but it's hard. I know, you, know, you just get into the <laughs> mode. Palisand Hollow. Two points. <laughs> no, you're so excited to get mine in the mail. I literally can't wait. Oh, it's gonna be fun. Mm -hmm. Gonna have a Zard on your doorstep. I never noticed some Finian and some Love Days cuties. Perhaps all that uh, Pokemon Snap is uh, making you look at the whole scene more now. Honestly, or I'm just like Finian, Finian everywhere. <laughs> Finian and Love Days everywhere at the same time. You played, I'm sure you know what level I'm talking about. <laughs> Glossopod GX! Segoy. Segoy. All right, come on, Burning Shadows, let's up our game just a little. Spooky Dark Cry Hollow. Sigoy. It's only June, why can't it be October? Alright, down to two. Oh, so Lazzle Full Art! Sigoy! background is super strong. I was gonna say, like, it is real intense, like, double, like, powder Kool-Aid intense. <laughs> Does anyone else make their Kool-Aid with, like, twice as much powder as it recommended? Of course. <laughs> when I had my hands on Kool-Aid, my mom didn't want Kool-Aid in the house. Mm. Uh, well, nothing crazy from that last one. I go over to friends' houses and make their Kool-Aid. Mm. It's like, ah, add one cup of this to three cups water. Ah, add one cup of this to a cup and a half of water. <laughs> Alright, Glossopod GX and Full Art. So as a, oops, sorry, we need that. Nope. Including Good both, call. my bad. Glossopod and Full Art Salazzle. Do you guys prefer the American or Japanese art better? Oh, I mean, honestly, I'm more comfortable with the, uh, the American art. It's nice to know, especially on like some of the weird like supporter and item cards, like what it is. <laughs> it's like I can get the Pokemon in Japanese, but what's this weird bag? I don't know. I will admit Japanese has some good quality cards for sure. But I feel like American cards are more like me. A little bit quirky. <laughs> sometimes unexpected. Most of the time you understand what you're working with, but sometimes you're just like, where did that come from? I think that might be the best sales pitch for <laughs> English Pokemon cards I've ever heard. Okay. <laughs> Alright, well, that is the end of the current queue at the moment. We do not have any orders up next, so if anybody's looking for some last minute packs, perfect time to jump in. Yep. Also have the opportunity to do some Hidden Fates draft breaks, if anyone's looking to do those. <laughs> yeah, you understand, Van. Van. It's a crimped card, but it's my crimped card. Oh, Chris, going in on gym challenge. Alright. That is very true, Free. Um, I think I like about 
the thing I like are the Japanese exclusive cards. You don't see many English exclusive cards. I would definitely be all in favor of English exclusives, even though I know that's probably never going to happen. <laughs> but yeah, that is really cool. Cindy Quill taking on Whitney. All right, going in with some Steam Siege. One, two, three, four, five, six. Like what I would give to have silly little Eevee poncho cards. I know, right? Seriously. In English. Put those in that 25th anniversary collection and you just watch people go crazy over them in English. All right, good luck, Chris. Here we go. Apple Canyon, reverse rare, one point. Sigoy. Cling Cling, hollow, two points. Sigoy. If you have not seen the Japanese exclusive Eevee Poncho cards, I highly recommend looking it up. They are the adorable, most adorable thing on the planet. Common. We got Magirna EX. Sigoy. Sigoy. Three points. I feel like this is going well so far. <laughs> Common, not hollow. Okay, ignore the giant massive link, but if you click on that, they get you a picture of all the Eevee Poncho cards. Reverse rare, B-sharp. One point for the win. Oh, and a full art Mega Gardevoir to top it off. Yeah, so go. Yeah, four points for the full art. Look how cute those Eevees are in their little ponchos. Imagine the crazy craziness for English Eevee heroes with poncho promos. Oh my goodness. People would lose their minds. I would lose my mind a little bit. All of the evolution ponchos are really, really cute, except for the Glaceon. It looks like it's trying to eat the Eevee. Chandelure reverse. <laughs> what? I need to look at this again. It's just its eyes. It's the same one I got before. Ah, uh, Shane Cammy, I cannot remember. I'm sorry. I Common? think that's the same Gardevoir, but it might be a different Could one. We, have we pulled this full art today? I feel like we might have pulled, like, the half art. Yeah, I think we pulled the other one, the other version. So it might be new. 50-50 chance. Could be, or could Great not be. Great card, regardless. <laughs> so going. All right, 12 points is where we're ending up. Congrats. So going. Definite victory. All right, uh, no bulk. And of course, we have a prize card from the Whitney box. And it's gonna be Shiny Duo! Sugoi! Sugoi! Full art, shiny. Shade, three for three. Nice. I'm so happy. And Derpy. I love Ditto. <laughs> Milking the victory. Still not better yeah. the second time Frozen Ball. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we got another gym challenge to do. This one is for Jeremy. Jeremy's very first gym challenge. Ooh, Segoi. Alright, just to let you know, you do have to start with Faulkner and work your way up the gym leader order. Sorry, that wasn't very clear in the description probably. Um, but the good news is that it doesn't cost any different and Faulkner is easier. <laughs> yep, and if you ever just don't know, put Faulkner on your thing and then we'll find the correct gym leader for you. 
Oh, no, 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 no worries about it. It happens all the time. Yep. Uh, I totally did change on our end because there's no difference really. Did, did I just leave Totodile on? Just like in behind City Pool the whole time. <laughs> Awkward. They were buddies. He was cheering them on. Okay. <laughs> um, all right. Going in with Burning Shadows. I've got one, two, three, four, five. I've got one more. Six. All right, best of luck on your very first gym challenge. We need six points to defeat Faulkner. Here we go. Dusk Noir, reverse rare, one point. So going. Oh my god, when I read that Frozen Bolt, I totally heard that in the Totodile voice from the anime. Oh, we got something in there. We've got a Vile Plume, Reverse Rare. So points. Oh, we got a Rainbow! Well, that's all we needed. Sugoi! So Sugoi! This goes well with your uh, Salazzle full art, so you know. <laughs> All right, five points for the rainbow. Sigoy. I would even like scratch the surface here, like four packs left. <laughs> Meow stick, reverse rare. Sigoy. out of the way early here. <laughs> Grimer and Butterfree, no points there. Alright, ended up with eight points though, and a nice rainbow to boot. Victory over Faulkner. Oh boy. Let's see, we are including the bulk. card. It's gonna be more rainbow. Sigalith <laughs> <laughs> GX. Our flying base friend. Maybe if we put a, a chibi eyeball on it, it'll make it cuter. Right? Mm -hmm. Right? <laughs> it's just a googly eye stuck on. There you go. It's, it's actually a haunted vase with a googly eye. Alright. Also, here are the Poncho Eevees, and notice the Glaceon eyes. Like, all the rest of them are, like, happy eyes, and Glaceon's like, mm, I'm upset. <laughs> oh my goodness, I love them all. They're so round. Thank you so much for the sub! Thank you. Jeremy, that's you, right? I'm still learning, like, Twitch to real names, so my apologies. It is. Okay, good, good, good. Well, thank you. Welcome to the stream. Appreciate the sub. I see King Louis. Um, how's it possible to do a gym challenge against you? I'm from Germany. Do we also ship to my country? Uh, King Louis, yes, we do ship to Germany. Um, everything that we have available is on our store. There we go. Free's got the link there. Um, we have a $10 shipping fee uh, to Germany or to anywhere outside of the United States. 
Um, but there's just a product on our shop called Gym Challenge. Just click on that one, um, answer all the little info drop downs, and you're good to go. Yep. And we do ship to Germany, but the one caveat is sometimes international shipping will sit for a while at customs offices. Globally, customs need to be a little overwhelmed and a little bit slow, so it could take up to a month or more. just at customs. <laughs> We are able to ship to Germany. But yeah, definitely take a look at our shipping explained and our send my stuff. That is the shipping fee. Shipping is not included with the items on the store. It's a separate purchase. Yep, because we have a holding system by default. We'll store your cards in your personal storage drawer for up to a year. Um, so you can do a shipping at any time, so especially useful for those of you with international orders and stuff like that. You can build up a few orders to do one send my stuff when you have, you know, a more cards and stuff like that. Uh, it's a $10 flat rate for up to four pounds, which is like a thousand cards, which is like a hundred packs with all cards, somewhere in that range. So it takes a while to get up to that point. Um, we can only ship up to four pound packages, so then we ask for either you know, you keep some of the cards in your drawer for the next shipping, or you pay a second shipping thing and we send two packages your way if you go over four pounds. And we do shipping once a week, so if you do a purchase on Tuesday, you are covered for all purchases on Tuesday, plus on Thursday, plus anything you had in your drawer previously. So you have to do one send my stuff per week. There, I did a send my stuff announcement. <laughs> <laughs> you did a little heart thing. <laughs> All right, Noe, we have 12 packs of Battle Styles. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, our shipping is a little bit different, but we hope it ends up saving you guys money what? on shipping and helps, you know, get you guys more exciting large packages to open. <laughs> <laughs> it's like Christmas. Alright, Noe, best of luck. Here we go. Speak it to us, Battle Styles. Also, those Eevee Poncho cards are several years old, I believe. So they're they're not cheap. Yeah, no. <laughs> they're super adorable and definitely not cheap. <laughs> oh, you woke up to order more. Alright, open for some good pulls here. QV Segoy. Segoy. Yeah, I'm looking at those EV cards and they look like they're generally running for around 200 piece. Wow. Which one is the cheapest? Um, which one does nobody want? <laughs> it's hard to tell because people keep listing the sleeves. Ow. Like, there was a pack of the sleeves that sold for $40. Whoa! Oh, that was one Flareon that went for 67 Also an Umbreon for 67 Really? Umbreon? Oh. I, I think these are just, you know, they, someone put it up for auction and just not a lot of people noticed it. Mm. Alright, come on, Battle Styles. Oh yeah, especially with Eevee Heroes, I expected most Eevee stuff to go way up. Necrozma V, Segoy! Segoy! You can get the less desirable Eevee ponchos for a hundred or less. Okay. <laughs> oh, still pricey, but I guess achievable if you save. Oh, we got a full art! Empoleon V! Segoy! Segoy! He looks so regal. That's what we want to see, Battle Styles. Full arts, good stuff.
Centaur V. Sigourney. Sigourney. Your second Empoleon. Don't think the first one was fuller, though. Oh, nice. Now you got options. <laughs> mm. Or both um, versions. Words. Words are hard. Got a full set of all eight. Seal for $2,000. Wow. Yikes. No bulk, so our hollow pile. I think our star of the show here is the full art Empoleon, and we got some bees, Titar, Mimikyu, and Necrozma. turn for an exhibition match. All right. Let's do it. One, two, three, four, five, six. Best of luck. Here we go. Age of Slash, reverse rare. One point. Sorry, <laughs> just thinking about the Segoy time. Oh. <laughs> uh. Lux Ray, reverse rare, one point. Segoy. Ralph, thank you for the follow. There you go, a little bit of a discount there, free. <laughs> Jerem, reverse rare. One point. Sigoin. And right. the big question to wonder on eBay is it the same set? <laughs> they picked it up for 18 bits and they're like, I can get 2,000. Alright, come on, Battle Styles. We need some big ones. Uncommon. Non hollow. Alright, this time. We got our common. Mini Q V Segoy. Segoy. Oh, three point three points. Avalanche. <laughs> I had two K lying around. I wouldn't spend it on a few cards. You know, I think I have to agree with you, frozen bullets. <laughs> Alright, last one. Here we go. Now or never. What do you got? Marowak, reverse rare. Segoy. One point. Luxray Hollow, two points! Oh no! Oh, Battle Styles, how cruel! We were so close. Oh, Jeremy, I'm sorry. We did get that Mimic UV. Hollows, and we are going with the bulk. Oh man, rough! One point away matches are always the worst. Hmm. All right, well, that brings us uh, to the end of the line again. No wait time for any packs. Um, I don't think we have any partial breaks filled, so I yeah, guess that's a good thing. Filled up all the ones we have. <laughs> all right, well, nobody's waiting on group breaks to fill. Glad we're not making anybody wait. How are you feeling temperature-wise since the AC just kicked on? I mean, I'm okay. I'd be okay if it turned off either way, if you're cold. 
Okay, let me know if you just get too warm. Okay. I feel like Command Shoe should be a real thing. <laughs> Wait, what's Command Shoe? Oh, it was a typo instead uh, of shop. Uh, I was like, I like Command Shoe. Um, yep, so, uh, Ur Urgy Bear. As Poke said, we are the Pokemon Bari Bari USA store. Uh, we sell um, English cards. If you're looking for Japanese cards, uh, Pokemon Bari Bari Japan is live on the weekends and they sell Japanese cards with the other shop link. one for you, Shade Academy. Sounds good. Best of luck. There it is. Gym challenge time. After your crushing victory over Whitney, I take on the last available gym challenge. Morty. Um, what's our starter? Cyndaquil. Um, in the USA store, if you're looking for just personal packs for yourself, there's a tab called Personals, and then the Personal Pack Break section. Uh, is it Cyndaquil? Oh, you probably clicked on the Japan store link. Um, there we go. Frozen Bolt's got a direct link to our site. All right, Chris, going in with the Guardians Rising set. Here's one, two, three, four, five, six. Alright, best of luck. We need eight points to take down Morty. Here we go. Victory Bell, reverse rare, one point. Uh, non hollow. Two points. So going. Common. Not hollow. All right, come on. Here we go, guardians. Let's see some of those big hitters. Reverse rare, so one point. Boy. Or choreo, non hollow. All right, down to one. What do we got? Let's go, guardians. We've got Gudra reverse. So go, so go, boy. One point. And or choreo, non hollow. Uh -huh. If it was a V, we would have won. Or EX. GX. I don't remember which set this one is. GX. GX. Ah, darn. Well, it looks like hollows and reverse hollows for this one. And let's see, no bulk. Pushed my luck. Oh no. <laughs> Having some crazy luck streaks tonight for lots of people. Excuse me. All right. Well, J 
Jeremy, you are up next. Code dial and pick it on Bugsy. Six with three against Faulkner. Nice. Uh, Burning Shadows, pack of choice. Will we pull more rainbow? One, two, three, four, five, six. So I'm going to compliment that Salazzle you pulled on the last one. Best of luck. Here we go. Last one for you. Okay, let's end on a good note. Common, uh, non hollow, electivire. Skull deed, are you? Yes, reverse rare. Sigoli. It's very hard to tell on purple. Oh, we got a full art. Oh, Lolan Muck. Sigoli. Sigoli, we got four points for the full art. He's halfway to a rainbow himself. <laughs> Wanna be rainbow. Prize card. What'll it be? Vega Bolt GX Full Art. Segoy. Got Zappy Bug. <laughs> Vega Bolt forever is a Zappy Bug to me. on and moving up. Congrats. All right. All right. Um, is it urgent? Am I saying that right? My apologies. Feel free to correct me. Absolutely. But we have two amazing rare bundles for you. So we got two Vivid Voltage and two Shiny Baits. Alright, I'm feeling Vivid first. Why not? <laughs> Good luck. Here we go. The amazing rare Jirachi. See how late night predictions work. Um, this is not a gym challenge. I don't need to <laughs> do points. <laughs> oh, the habits. The habits die hard. What you got, Vivid? Trumby, Perverse. Oh, I do love that Jolteon. It is a nice one. More evolutions in all types of sets. <laughs> Alright, Shining Fates, let's go! 
make up uh, something big. Come on, Shang Tate. Leave. Rush around, amazing rare. Sugoi. And greeted be. Double Sugoi. Amazing rare bundles coming through with the amazing rare. <laughs> an amazing rare. Greedent and Reshiram. Uh, we're going no bulk, so just our hollows, reverse hollows, and our hits. Alright, um, let's see. Jamie, up next. Also, since that was your first order with us, do make sure to uh, check out the Send My Stuff page. So you're familiar with our shipping policy. It's the uh, second link there. Long story short, you don't have to do a shipping um, send my stuff right away, but uh, it is not included in any of the products. So when you want your card sent, you do a send my stuff request. You can explain more if you want, but that page does a good job. All right, Jamie, we've got Hidden Fates for you. Best of luck. Do the newer gen nurse joys have blissies? Or are they just still chanties? Um, I Dark think troops. as soon as Blissey was introduced, they switched over a lot. Okay, cool. Dark Tricks, baby shiny! Sigoi! I just saw that, uh... Where is it? I saw the Pokemon Center lady, and I was like, hmm. Random questions. Lightning. So what? Are you serious? They have a DDs? But, but Chansey. See, I don't see the link. Does somebody want to drop that uh, shipping link once again? Oh, yeah. Sorry about that. Onyx GX. So good. Trying to figure out what the right There's the right command. Chat game does tend to wash links out of the uh, chat a little bit fast. Oh, Leafeon! So good! So cool. It has been a night for Leafeon. Is that our third tonight oh or second? God. Did you pull one too? I pulled. Yeah, you did, right? Yeah. And so I pulled two Leafeons and a Sylveon. That's what the other one was. Good evolution night. Well, I've already pulled Leafeon, so this is our third. So good! Yep, so basically what happens is you have a personalized storage drawer once you make an order with us. We store all of your orders and all your cards in there. And then whenever you do the Send My Stuff, that's when we package everything up and ship it. So you can combine a whole bunch of individual orders into a single shipping. So that way it'll save you on, you know, you don't do a $10 shift or a $5 shift with every single order kind of a thing. It also means we don't have to send out a thousand little envelopes, we can just send you a box. All right, well, Leafeon making that bundle of Hidden Fates. Very nice. Oh, Jammer, I already got one tonight. I mean, excellent trade fodder. I was going to say. <laughs> oh, well, you have just excellent luck. Mm -hmm. Dartrix and Onyx as well. Can I get the Pikas? Sure. Yeah, absolutely, I'll fish them out. Alright, Ghost is gonna grab you. Because. Uh, 
All right, who's up next? Sebastian! We have a blind box and an exhibition match. All right, let's do the Starium blind box first. Three Pikachus found, or sorry, two Pikachus found. cards if I order those on the days you stream with those. Uh, unfortunately, no. We're actually, we're in the United States and the people that stream the Japan stream, uh, they're actually in like just outside of Tokyo in Japan. So we're unable to combine shipping because they're, well, they're halfway across the world from each other. <laughs> Yep, and then do note their shipping, especially if you are in the U.S., works a little bit differently. They do once a month shipping, we do once a week. Yeah, unfortunately, Japan has to deal with COVID restrictions as far as mail goes, so it's a little bit different yep. for them. So be sure to read up on their page if you do orders with them. Alright, here we go. Ooh, we've got Umbreon for this Sigoy. one. Sigoy! Umbreon with that beautiful moon pedestal. Mm. That cloud wrapping around it. Just uh, Umbreon sitting in the middle. Ah, such a good one! Uh, looking like that all together. So since you were wondering about the Nurse Joy thing, I yep. looked it up. Nurse Joys have had Lissies, Chanseys, Odino and Mega Odino, Wigglytuffs, Comfies, and Adidas. But why would you stray from the Chanseys? I mean, I guess they're also very cute and pink and round and... Also, Chansey is not available in every region. <sighs> Rude. <laughs> okay, uh, exhibition match for Sebastian. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, we're taking on B. Let's do it. Good luck. Common. Oh, starting off with full art. Flapple V Sagoy. Sagoy. Four points there. Yeah, should have always stayed chance. <laughs> or Blissies. I would take Blissies too. I think it'd be cool to like see like a blissy head nurse like directing all the chances around. And a little happy knee running around after him. Mm. And boar, reverse rare. Sigoy. One point. Oh, no way! We got Rainbow Phoebe! Sigoy. Did we just do that in two? <laughs> I I think we did. Sigoy. Wow! Five points! Sebastian, you're killing it! First victory of the second set. Sunburn Club. Used to get four packs and all the goodies inside those. Uncommon. We got Rapid Strike. Segoy. Uh, three more. Oh shoot, I am just about out of sleeves. Uh, I should get you some more. We gotta set a new record on an exhibition match. <laughs> I don't know. We're getting close. What is it, 15 currently? Uh, 18 is our current season high, 20 is the record. Uncommon, non holo. Is it for exhibition though? Oh, what's it? Uh, I don't have the stats on the exhibition max. <laughs> uh, we had a 15 today. Uncommon, non holo. One more. Yeah, it looks like the 15 is our record currently for exhibitions. 
to Big Common. Well, we tied it. Two points Seven or beetle. <laughs> ah, good pulls. Nice. Rainbow Phoebe, full art, flapple, and a V as well. So going. So going. <laughs> Definite win. Let's see, uh, no bulk for this one. They're insane battle styles is what they are. <laughs> All right, prize card time. We're taking out B. Hey, Rapid Strike or Shifu Full Arts. Sugoi. I feel like Shifu's got the same pose as B does in her card. Except for B looks a tiny bit more flexible. <laughs> He's about ready to do the splits. Or she was like, oh, I'm getting there. But congrats. Victory. And of course, entered into the grand prize drawing once we get to, get to that 10, 10 victory marker. Threshold. Yep. <laughs> All right. Up next, Urgen with some Shining Fates. Packs. All right, good luck on these. Kyogre, amazing rare. Oh, we got greet it. <laughs> sigoy, sigoy, greet and delivering the amazing rares for you, apparently. <laughs> Brought your Reshiram, now it's Kyogre. Party train music going on. <laughs> well, we got something. Scent to scorch. So oh, boy. I saw the little whiskers and I was like, oh my gosh, could it be? Full art, or not VMAX shiny. I got duped. Send a Scorch though. Love Send a Scorch. In case anyone doubts my affection for Send a Scorch, I have a Bacon Command. And I have a Sislipe blush. It's real. Mm. <laughs> All right, we got one more. Did I put a hollow in this pile? No, because we had the double hit in one pack. Okay. Yeah. It always throws me off, too. I'm like, wait a second. I don't have nearly enough reverse hollows. <laughs> and DD, Professor's Research. All right, shiny and Scorch VMAX. Kyogre Amazing Rare and the Greeted B. Good boy. There you go. <laughs> I just don't want anybody doubting that I love Sense Scorch. It's important to me. <laughs> uh, we're going no bulk for that one. Well, so there you go. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Opening is towards the mic. is open once again. We can keep going, or if we're tapped out for the night, that's fine too. We're flexible. Yep. Either way, we do have that viewer giveaway for our cute chuckle plush coming up. There we go. 
better focus on Shuckle <laughs> while we're not doing anything. So I don't know if I mentioned with the uh, shipping earlier, we do shipping once a week here. So if you pick up a send my stuff on our Tuesday streams, any packs you buy on the Thursday stream will also be included in those send my stuffs. You don't have to do a second one. Just one a week. Sebastian, going in on an exhibition match. Unless, of course, you cross that four pound threshold for international, but rare case. Ooh, exhibition matches. One, two, three, four. Five and six. Was Sebastian just our winner? Yes. Yes. Okay. <laughs> it's like, I'm remembering that right. Right? <laughs> All right, let's go again. Here we go. Bruxish. Uncommon. That is one thing to note, the difference between regular gym challenges and our exhibition matches. Even if you win, you can keep challenging for more prize cards and more entries to the grand prize cards. Ball toy common. Flapple VMAX. Segoy. Segoy. You are reverse. Uh, four points for the VMAX. usually an overabundance of Corviknight VMAXs, but tonight, definitely Flapple. We've got Common and Non-Hollow. You know, the, the bird population went down, so the apple population and worm increased. <laughs> True. It, it, it's basic Pokemon ecology, I mean, you know. Of course, of course. Uncommon, Non-Hollow. Common. On hollow. Alright, Battle Styles, give us a big one. We need it. What you got? We got Luxio, Uncommon. Marowak, non hollow. Ah, oh, sad day. Didn't miss any. Darn. Alright, well, just the Flapple VMAX for this round. And no bulk. Ah, oh, Battle Styles. Not your best. Not your best. Oh, we do have another exhibition match, though. Frank, up next. Alright, one, two, three, four, five, six. Six packs battle styles. Best of luck. Charcoal Uncommon. Non hollow. Mr. Rhyme, reverse rare, one point. Segoy. Aegis Slash Hollow, two points. Double Segoy. Hollow. 
All right, come on, Battle Styles. We need some points. Reverse rare, one point. Zigoi. Primate non hollow. Last one. Come on, Battle Styles. Octillery, reverse rare. Zigoi. And. Oh. Ah. Drampa, non hollow. Ah, well, just our hollows this round. Sad day. That's the next door. Ah, sneaky. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Up next, uh, I want to see Dion. We have three packs of Shining Fates for you. Oh, another Zard! Hope one Shining Fates Zard so far tonight. Let's get number two. Mystic, one card with the giveaway. Will it come in with this order? Um, it kind of depends on when you won it and when your package was shipped. I would have to go into the back end and look. I am not sure. Sorry. The Emperor and Cramoran V Max. Double Sigoy. Ah, love the Emperor. I do apologize, um, Playboy Mystic. I am spacing on your the name that you use in our shop. Um, but maybe if you want to message Ghost with the name that you use, then we can look it up for you and let you know. If you don't click on my name and send me a whisper, I can definitely see when that was fulfilled. Oh, this is your shiny face. Okay. Oh, okay. Sorry. <laughs> Colin is bad at names. Okay, um... I will take a look. We felt all amazing rare. Segoy. Segoy! I can definitely explain the wishlist random breaks. So, if you are familiar with wishlist breaks, or sorry, no. <laughs> you're not familiar with wishlist breaks. If you're familiar with um, breaks in general, they're group type um, breaks. You have to have every all of the slots filled in order to do the opening. Um, a wishlist break is kind of just a better version of a random type break. So basically your first, second, and third choices let you bias the odds in your favor to getting those kind of those spots in the break. So the way it works is the first, there's four rounds of selection. So the first round takes everybody's first choice and any spot that has been picked by anybody as a first choice will be assigned in this first round. So say you had three fire and two water and that was all, that was all the spots. They, instead of having a one in five chance of getting a fire spot, they would have a one in three chance because you're only competing with the other people with the first choice of fire. Um, so it greatly increases your chances of getting the spots you pick. Um, and then the two the two waters would have a one in two chance instead of a one in five chance of getting water. And then any spot that was not picked in the first round, then it looks for people with the second choice of that spot. Um, so say someone had picked fire as one of their second choices, well, fire was already selected in the first round, so that choice doesn't get considered, but your, anyone with any other spot that had not been taken, they battle it out there, third choice, that battles it out in the next round, and then the last round is any spot that has not been selected up to that point gets randomized to somebody who has not gotten a spot randomized to them yet. 
Hopefully that makes sense. So basically you're not guaranteed to get the spots that you select as your wish spots, but you have a much higher chance of getting those than in a normal random type break, and at worst you have the same chance. Like if all ten people picked fire as their number one choice, well, it's a one in ten chance again, but most of the time you get a better chance. Oh, and um, Playboy Mystic, I did look up your uh, ladder card, and yes, it will be included in this shipment. So you're all good there. Yep, letter cards, letter cards tend to make it into your personal storage drawer the week following the ladder randomization picking. <laughs> yep. So if you win a ladder this week, it'll be in the drawer next week. So if you do a send my stuff this week, it won't be in this send my stuff. But yours will because it was from a previous week. I don't mean to confuse you by adding other theoretical examples. I just realized <laughs> I'm like, this is not happening things. I think I get it. I was watching Bye Bye Japan do breaks for Eevee, and I was a little confused. <laughs> oh, yeah. So for them, they broke down spots by Eevee Lucian instead of by type. But. Yeah, we'll probably do a wishlist break or two on Thursday if it helps to watch it again. Um, but yeah, if there's any aspects that still get you, feel free to ask. Yeah, just a couple basic things that you might want to, you know, bear in mind. You don't want to pick the same type for all three of your spots. Because if you picked it for your first choice, then, like, say you say fire, fire, fire. Fire will 100% be assigned to somebody if you picked it as your first choice. So your other two choices should be different slots. They could be, you know, slots that you would be like, okay, well, it's not my favorite spot, but this is, like, my second choice. Or it could be I... You know, you pick a spot you don't think other people would pick, so that way you don't get just a general random one at the end. Lots of strategies. Yeah. I got red bars again. That's not oh, good. Oh no. Are we frozen? We're not frozen. Okay. Yeah, it, it just does that whenever it hitches or doesn't have a full speed uh, upload. Alright, well. Should we do a verbal last call since the internet seems to be uh, getting <laughs> upset again? I think so. Alright, guys, well, um, consider this a last call for orders. Uh, if you want to get orders in right now, we can do them. But we're probably not going to wait around too much longer. Yeah, we have been opening for a little over 11 hours tonight, so, busy, busy night. Um, A4 got an email saying I won a ladder giveaway here. What's that mean and how do I redeem it? So our ladder giveaways, if you ever see us pull up this image with like six cards on it, that is our ladder giveaway. Uh, the cards that you won are going to be different from what is on screen right now, but um, you were a winner of one of these giveaway cards. Uh, just follow the link in the email. Uh, it'll have instructions for what you need to do. It'll basically ask you to rank your top choices of the cards available, and it'll show you pictures of what's available. Um, yeah, but you're gonna be receiving one of those cards. Depending on if you took first, second, third, etc., you'll get your top choice according to your place. So if you're first place, you get first pick. If you're second place, you get second pick, and so on. Yep, yeah, and you get the top, your top choice, the highest choice on your list that is still remaining. So if you in the first place, like say you were second, the first place person picked the same card as you for first choice, well, you can't have that one, so you get your second choice. But if they picked a different card, then you get your first choice kind of a thing. And I do recommend uh, filling out that ladder giveaway claim, even if you're last place, because sometimes people don't fill it out. So we give priority to people that filled out the claim instead. Yep. <laughs> And so if you don't fill it out, you just get in get whatever's order, left over. <laughs> the, like the highest pack goal one that's left over. And we just kind of go down that way. But it may not be the one you want or the one you need, so. Um, but this ladder giveaway is a weekly giveaway. We do a different one every week. And it's basically a thank you to anyone who buys into pack openings through our shop. 
when we do a hopefully six card giveaway at the end of the week. Um, the only way to earn entries is to buy packs off of our shop, so we do appreciate you guys supporting us. Yep, and do note it does require them to be open or packs that we are opening. So if you picked up just blind boxes or codes or promos, those don't count. But if we opened a gym challenge or a mystery bundle or you were in a break spot, we opened a pack for you, that gets you an entry. Let's see. A4 it says I'm number four, that means I'm last, right? I believe so, yes. So that was probably from last week, so yeah, we only had four winners last week. But like we mentioned, still do your top four rankings. So that way we can get you in factored into, you know, getting everyone their top choices that are left. Because you may end up picking a little bit earlier than fourth if you are if someone else did not submit their claim. Or their choice list. Oh, Mr. Baby Bits took a nine hour nap. Just Ooh. like went to bed. <laughs> Nine hour naps are excellent. I love the Snorlax emotes. <laughs> Snorlax doing what Snorlax does best. Alright guys, well, final call for any more orders tonight. Um, we will be live again on Thursday, so... Final call for tonight. Yep, as a reminder, our Thursday special is the Variety Set Shuffle. So, yes. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's our unique item for Friday, Thursdays. It sounds like sushi. But uh, if you are looking for, you know, a whole bunch of different variety packs, um, the way the variety set shuffle works is I think we have 53 different spots, and each spot is an envelope containing either two English packs or three Japanese packs. All of them are the same set, so you could end up with two Shining Legends, two Tag Team All-Stars, um, I tag team all stars with the only Japanese we do two packs of because it's a rare one. Um, you get, you know, two packs of Cosmic Eclipse, you get three packs of Chilling Rain, or not Chilling Rain, uh, Silver Lance, that kind of thing. So if you're looking for a wide variety of packs, that is a fun Thursday thing. Plus we'll also have more hit drafts, we'll have breaks, all that kind of stuff on Thursday. Just remember the shop reloads at 1 p.m. Eastern, so if you want to make sure you, uh, get spots in what you want and, uh, you know, get spots in the variety set shuffle and those things reserved, that is when to look. All right, well, I'm not seeing any orders come through on the queue, so I think it's time for us to wrap up tonight. Give away! <laughs> Cute little shuckle. It's time for shuckle to find a new home. Look at his oh, little noodle sugar. arms! They're so cute! <laughs> Anyway, let's do a giveaway, guys. <laughs> this is one of the Pokemon Fit plushies from the Pokemon Center in Japan. Let's set the shop real quick. Okay, uh, we do this giveaway through the chat bot. So keep an eye out there. Yep, you will be receiving a whisper with instructions on how to claim this shuttle if you win. Good luck, guys. Noe, congrats! Good boy, congrats! <laughs> ah, we know you're not a bot. <laughs> Let's take a look at the leaderboard, see how many entries everyone has. Oh, I forgot to pull up the leaderboard beforehand. And I forgot to timestamp, always. Oh. If I timestamp this week. I'll back it up, yep. But Sugoi, you should have received a whisper from uh, Pokemon Bari Bari Bot, or Professor Bari Bari Bot, with the link to claim that. So let us know if you did not get that, since you're in chat with us. This leaderboard needs a refresh. What was I there checking for? Timestamps. Timestamp, please. But congrats! Thanks for watching the stream! <laughs> Alright, how many did we have? Mm -hmm. It's not finding you. But <laughs> it says you're not on the leaderboard. <laughs> it might have already taken them off. Oh, yeah, because you won. 
Well, we were gonna check how many entries you had, but it resets you down to zero once you win. So, <laughs> never mind. But congrats. So as a reminder, you earn one entry for every 20 minutes you're watching on the stream, plus you get another entry <laughs> for every regular Pokemon you catch, and two extra entries for every legendary when the chat game rolls through. <laughs> You know, Van, I remember people saying that about you just a little bit earlier. <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys. Well, that's pretty much all we have for tonight. Thanks for being here. Again, we'll be live Thursday, 6 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. 51? Nice. Not bad. Um, yeah, that's, that's all I've got. So have a good night. Go get some sleep. And we'll see you on Thursday, 6 p.m. Eastern. <laughs>